Uh, you've just seen the cafe because I've just seen it on the screen, so does that count getting it? <laughs> I'm really sorry about that. We, it's this spot. It, um, I, I don't know what it is here, with here at the moment, but every time we come here to boot up a stream, it like doesn't do it on the first go. So I think next time we come down here, I'm going to make sure uh, we do a, an additional boot up of it. So uh, hello, everyone. Welcome. We're back. I Good hope. morning. I was waiting for the adverts because I, I get the notification. So, oh my. Just trying to give you a fit there. Um, that uh, head torch. Try to kill you. <laughs> okay, well, you got a bit of the cafe, didn't you? So, does that count? Oh, it's taxied in now. No, no, no. It literally, on the start of the stream, it goes oh, past. Yeah. Oh, there we go. You go then. past. So, you actually got it on the runway, so that counts. So everyone here in the chat who's like going, we want planes, you got planes, don't be starting. <laughs> I've got a wobbly chair. Right, One good. part of the chair's in like the ditch. <laughs> oh, we got mugged off before. Oh. Yeah, so if you've just gone through the adverts, good morning. Uh, so obviously they're out and they are now literally just switching to runway two for departures. Obviously they're on runway one for departures and there weren't many. And I was actually keeping an eye on it because the moon's like quite low in the like in the sky, and literally just we just finished setting up. We were like watching this easy jet take off, and, and when I say it was like an easy jet eclipse, it literally eclipsed south side. It did. It literally went right through the moon. Of course, we weren't pressing record or anything. You know. No, I actually panned it as well. That, that's the that, yeah, it was due to practice pan. <laughs> so irritating. Right, we're gonna like our own stream. Hello, well, Les. Everyone like like it. If you hate, even if you hate it, I don't care. <laughs> it's cold here. Uh, here we got Hayden, Lee, Ian, Optimus Toaster, Living at Large, uh, Martin, Stuart, Craig. Hayden's there. I've seen Hayden as well. Yeah. Good morning. Good morning, Dean. Do you know? Wow, we've all we've all our mods set an alarm this morning. Mods are on it. Mods want it. What got you out of bed? Mods want the love. <laughs> uh, Ian S, good morning. ABQ, EDC. Uh, Andy, who else we've got? Good morning, everybody. Another fresh day here at Manchester Airport. We're saying Wendy. fresh, it means cold. <laughs> yeah, Wendy, good morning. Gary, good morning. Oh, we're waiting for... Oh, past 36, so it should be good to go here. Eh? Yeah. Uh, Minnie Mouse Mel, Darren. And am I up to date? I think so. Paula. Good morning. On it, peeps. Love the dedication to the show here. And uh, Big Leo One as well. Good morning to see you. You are the authentic spotters, you know what I mean? Up at 6 o'clock to watch some geek action. At uh, 6.30 to watch some geek action on a Monday. That is next level. Absolutely. I do think we might get some moon action still, though, people. Because the tracking corridors for the transatlantic flights are taking them right close to the moon. So yeah, they are. We'll the, keep there's a shout. Them. There's a shout for that today. And the skies look clear. This is... And it's easy to get one to stay at Manchester. Nah, he's going now. He's off to Belfast. It's an A320. We have British Airways going back down to London Heathrow. Uh, we do have an Aer Lingus A330 just to north of Manchester. Well, just coming around the top of like the north of Manchester. That's coming in from Barbados. Bridge town. Let's have a look where everything else is. Well, that's one of them pans where you start as you mean to go on. Well, that's that's good. Uh, A380 is currently near, about to fly over Doncaster. Donny!
Paula, yeah, I do have my hot water bottle. It's uh, warm and toasty this morning. <laughs> Crazy, and, uh, and then after dreaming of her favourite airline eclipsing the moon, Liz woke up. Oh, it was real. It wasn't a dream. It wasn't Logan Air, come on. <laughs> that would have been the ultimate. Well, exactly. Uh, Karen, good morning. I think, uh, we think we've got Carwin in the chat as well. Did see someone else say hello? So good morning. Nigel. Morning, Nigel. <laughs> Are you allowed to be post on social media at the moment? Don't think so. Oh, that's awkward. Oh, oh we're allowed to live stream them. <laughs> yeah, BA allowing us to actually live stream a British Airways plane. Come on, BA. Sort that out. <laughs> Bruce, good morning. Uh, Craig McAllister, good morning. I tell you, that Matt Cherry better be in the chat somewhere now because I'll go for him. I'll go for him, people. <laughs> well, first I'm going to read uh, Jim's 449 Super Chat app uh, saying morning at Think Plains and everyone. Uh, busy day at work for me. Uh, may try and join in... Um, uh, may join in as the morning rolls on. Thanks again for your efforts, Liz and Simon. Well, thank you so much, Jim. Thank you, Jim. I hope, and, uh, uh, hope work isn't too stressful or difficult today. Yeah, exactly. And, uh, yeah, pop in when you can, mate. Absolutely. Uh, just, like, just sack work off, though. It's yeah. So rated. <laughs> uh, and our good morning to you. Oh, there we go. There's Mr. Matt Sherry. Oh, he's there. I knew he'd be there. <laughs> so to, just dispatch Mrs. C in a taxi to the airport. Well, we're here, mate. We're not in London this time. No, no. <laughs> it's a crispy morning. It's, it's going to look good. At dawn, yeah. I've, I, I, won't lie, I had some really bad tendonitis in my forearm kind of yesterday. and um, I almost gave Simon a heart attack this morning. I woke up like dead naturally because I got a good seven hours of sleep last night. And it was, I forgot when Simon came to bed that he was like, right, I set the alarm for quarter past five. And I woke up at seven minutes past five. She's freaking out And I out assumed it, the alarm should have been set for five. I was like, you know, seven minutes past five. And you just heard the seven and went, what? Is it seven? Yeah, that wasn't great. I won't lie. Yeah. And uh, Sarah, good morning. Um, I was going to say, I think this full moon, I think, was Saturday, was it? Yeah, it started. Yeah, cause yeah. We, yeah. And then it's close enough to fall, let's be honest. Yeah, Matt's already walking the dog. Uh, already walked the dog. Sorry, look at him. He's the that, that, this guy is like prime, like a master uh, of his art. So ready to go chilly. today. It is a bit chilly. Oh, what is? Oh, oi, oi. oh no, I know what Rodders is going to say as well. What? Yes, I know what's in today, mate. I, oh, I didn't really. I just put yeah, it's Monday. Oh yeah, he's getting ready for it. He's, he's preparing <laughs> himself. You know, you get, sometimes the banter doesn't have to go out straight away in regards to Etihad, but sometimes it does. Easy Jets going to Barcelona. Going out there and I'm saying it. These are the best pans in the game at the moment. <laughs> these pans are on it. Right, you're uh, uh, the airling. This is just past Cheadle. Okay. Let's get a little bit of an extended departure on this one, and I'll whap it round in a second. Yep, I can. Oh yeah, I can see the uh, thingy through the bushes. Bush camp. <laughs> uh, David, good morning. Keep good morning. You can see it there. There's, there's the Ellingus on the right hand side going through the bushes. But let's let's just let's go in a place where I can actually see the plane. Yeah. For... Oh, and Shirley as well. So it's Keith and Shirley. Good morning to you both. Yes, people. Good morning, and I uh, hope you're having a, a great start to the week. And if not. We're here to help you through these hard hours. 
uh, Ian Brown, also saying, should be uh, putting scaffolding up. Instead, it's a day off. Get so in. I think planes it is. Sounds like a good day ahead. Hi, Fred. Good morning. Pilot had his uh, torch on on his mobile phone there, trying to get our attention. Looked like there was a light coming from the flight deck towards us. Don't know if he just left well, something on. Well, that was on. the uh, EasyJet A3 Swansea going to Alicante. Oh, yeah, I can see that. Is there someone maybe in the... I don't know. Don't know. Say someone in the jump seat. Don't know. Well, we can have a proper look at the A330 now, because uh, I think that EasyJet was always going to be in the way of it, so... Let's have a... One of my old work colleagues flew out on this baby to uh, Bridgetown yesterday. Very nice. Right. What have we got? I think next arrival is going to be the A380. Boost, boost. The uh, EK21 in from Dubai. Start of another week. Great. <laughs> there you go. So yeah, I just kind of started your week for you. Started your meeting to go on, people. Whatever. Just with planes. That is how we roll on this channel. <laughs> we do planes, we do planes, and we do planes. We don't do trains. And I mean that in multiple ways. Yeah. Uh, we just do planes. I swear we need to do that as a logo. What was that, sorry? We don't do trains, we do planes. No trains of any kind. Oh, I've got double lofties out already. That's, uh... Everyone's on it today. Christina, good morning. Lufthansa A320 on the way back to Frankfurt. A few minutes yet for the uh, Emirates. Uh, Ken, good morning. Dwayne, good morning. Watching before school. Hello to everybody who is tuning in before they have to go to school or to have to go to work. And Start your day right. And if you don't have to do either of those two today, nice one. Get a drink, <laughs> sit down. Nice one. Don't move for the next Get a hours. bacon butty. Get something. I don't know. Just do something like that. It's, it's got to be done. Or a packet of crisps. No. No, no, not for breakfast. I'm oh, going to no. about everybody else. Uh, you know what? You can just go away with your No, your I'm, I'm thinking of everybody else where it's not... No, I know what you're trying to do, Liz. 10 to 7 in the morning. What if it's 10 to 7 at night? Yeah. I want a bacon butty. At well, actually, do you want a bacon butty at 7 at night? Probably. Yeah, I won't mind it. Yeah. All right. Fair enough. Fair enough. Uh, David, good morning. What's this coming out? Coming out. Brussels? Uh, da, 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 Brussels, indeed. It is, yeah. I, I, I can't, I can't, I can't resolve it on my screen. So I was just like, going, "What's the only A320 out there that I know has got a dark tail?" <laughs> well, it was a good guess. Yes, get in there. I'm such a geek. <laughs> Give me um, advance notes on the A380 and get yeah. the heel, please. 
it's uh it's not quite a hide yet okay cool so we can i can taxi on this baby for a little while can charlie good morning good morning sir how are you doing is it charlie charlie uh or is it another charlie uh, da, 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 i think it was uh was it charlie 13 the username charlie 13 i'm sorry i, I lose track yeah, of I know, yeah, yeah, yeah. so many people with the same names i feel for teachers <laughs> Oh, we had the dogs with the uh, neon lights and yeah. rings around the neck this morning, didn't we? We, we did, yeah. I, I like seeing them. It makes makes the, it's a good start to the stream, if you know what I mean. This one jogging as well. That is dedication. That well done. Well done. Bet you're there thinking, what are them two not doing up there though? Well, I'd rather be doing this than sat down and go for a jog right now. <laughs> Although it would warm me up. Exactly. What's that like? Uh, it's just the light reflecting off the lens there. Sorry, I just, I just saw some uh, refraction um, from the glass. <laughs> yeah, David, uh, we also do uh, Carlos, KFC cam, Bush cam, uh, and Wally the Wind Soak uh, with occasional uh, stomping. Um, uh, Simon, well, that was you, and as well as Think, think Food. Think and food. he says, you have also been known to mention planes. <laughs> Apart from those, but we don't mention trains. No. So I'm taking that. Right, A380 update, please, Liz. So A380 it? is at Stockport. Oh, cool. We can get get this the park to them. Yep, this is back to go back to Brussels. Tell you what, you can tell it's getting lighter earlier now. I can see light in the sky already. Oops, no focus. I don't want focus. I have a camera. I'm useless. And, uh, Joe with the twelve dollars super chat saying happy Monday, at Simon and Liz. Uh, thank you for giving us another great broadcast early on um, uh, on a cold morning. I love pleasure, you lots. Joe. Sending love back at you, mate. Absolutely, top guy, Joe. Yeah, we had, the, uh, we had a chat with him yesterday because Joe's one of our long haul members. Yeah. And as part of that package, you kind of will, will, will I don't know, FaceTime you or do a, a, a live stream where you can type in, whichever you prefer kind of thing. Um, yeah. And we did that. And uh, yeah, I thought it was really good last yeah, night. Yeah, we had a good chat. We had a good old natter and everything. And it's kind of gets great to know get to know our members a little bit more. So thanks for uh, doing that, Joe. Uh, we really appreciate that, mate. Absolutely. It was a lot of fun. Heading towards Heald Green. Well, my camera is down there. Ready and waiting. It's ready for the beast from the east. <sighs> that was a decent yawn, that. Wow. I'm excited there. <sighs> I am today, actually, aren't I? I'm feeling... I'm well, feeling... It's not as bad as you. We went to this birthday party yesterday. <laughs> uh, we got there and um, Simon got, like, the full lowdown on, like, the family tree. <laughs> Yeah. And um, my mum and dad were there. I felt like I was going to get a bloody test at the end of it. <laughs> and um, my mum and dad for a little, little bit worse for wear because they'd had friends around on the oh, Your dad was so quiet. It was like, my you could tell talks. he's... My dad talks a lot. He so. does. It I was can like... see the emirates now through the trees. Yeah, we'll, uh, we'll get back to this one because it, yeah. it was funny. Oop, jog up.
Very nice. Very. Everything, um, I think, well, there's not much like wind at all today, but it's, uh, everything seems like dead quiet. Like when the cafe came in, like you could barely hear it. Yeah, it is. I always find the other end is a lot louder, isn't it? Yeah. Sometimes it can be quite loud here, but I, I do think it depends on which way the wind's blowing it and does make where it carries difference. the sound. Well, that, that, I better heard that. I know. You know. When we were talking about the Virgin A330 yesterday. Yeah. Like, in comparison, that was like, yep, yeah, is there a plane there? If it was, was it like a Pilatus? Yeah. yeah. Uh, plane spot and ringway. So I'm also here. Oh, we are, we are Charlie yeah. out today. Oh, what? Well, I can't deal with, like, this many. Yeah. And then other Charlie's just put these three people in my uh, maths class with the same name, Charlie. Wow. <laughs> like, that's fun. And uh, Ian Gifting One Membership. Thank you very much. That's going to uh, Franny. Thank you so much, mate. That's uh, so so appreciated. The enforcer at it. I think, it I, I, I think he kind of hates those names. He's just, he's just like going, I'll, I'll just take the names. Just uh, appreciate the compliment. We do. And uh, I can't remember who was gifted that membership, but please make Franny. sure to... Franny. Franny, make, please make sure to thank Ian, because as I say, it's a great way that uh, people support not only our channel, but, you know... Uh, but you as members as well because you get to use the emotes and if you want to you can join our Facebook group Think Planes Clubhouse exactly and if you do just make sure when you uh, go on go on there that you answer the question about what is your YouTube channel otherwise we can't accept you because yeah it uh, takes it takes an absolute age to go through the whole list it does there's no like search function it, that, that's slag another thing YouTube. that we've got to slag YouTube off for because it makes life so difficult I have to go through all the lists to see if you're a member or not yeah. so it, it makes it difficult I was going to say something and I completely forgot what I was going to say I was going to say um, if you haven't been gifted a membership though I think like you can kind of I think you have to interact with it a little bit like yeah. so if you well I think you'd have to be subscribed wouldn't you you have to like, sub you have to be subscribed I think well, you have to opt in as well you have to opt in there's a little thing that comes up um, I think, and then just like, start to like like in a stream. And if you, even if you just send like the old comment, I don't think you have to, but I think you maybe do. At, you get at pushed least, up. Yeah, I think it'll be on at least like one stream or something. Yeah. But uh, next arrival, we've gone from a uh, ginormous A380 gun down to a little A319 from Eurowings coming in from Dusseldorf. But uh, not seen one of those for a while actually. Oh yeah, going back to your dad. He's so so quiet. Oh, yesterday, yeah. That I could see the internal workings of his head. I'm like, going, I'm suffering, I'm suffering, I'm suffering. Yeah, why are we here? Why yeah. are we here? When can we go? And, uh, who else have we got in here? So, uh, Jane Chapman, good morning to you. Yeah, uh, go through the comments. I think half terms next week, isn't it? It is. Right, I'm going to go into the Euro Wings because I can see you going through the bushes. Christina's saying, I can't wait for my holiday. Where are you going, Christina? Anywhere nice? I can't remember if you said another stream or not. At least try. Everyone, so many people go on holiday and I'm like, I feel like I need a diary with everyone's holidays yeah. in it. Just literally like the Think Planes subscribers holiday diary. <laughs> And um, Perseus saying, uh, you guys are the best. I agree. <laughs> so would I, to be fair. I might be a bit biased. Uh, Man City, good morning to you. A happy day, good morning. Oh, Paul, I agree. said one of my mates um, said to me the other day, Planes are just trains with wings. I said, how dare he say that? Now, I know a lot of people do like trains as well. Uh, did you unfriend him? Because that guy's... That, that, don't mean he's a <laughs> he's an idiot. <laughs> the A380 is more like a, a cruise ship with wings if you're going to compare it to another mode of transport. <laughs> but don't, just don't compare? Well, no, true. True. Yeah, mate. I'll tell you what. Why don't you go up to, like... 35,000 feet and open the window of your train <laughs> and see how you get on. 
I don't definitely don't stick your head out. Do you remember all those things when you were a kid and they were like, you know, the dangers of trains? I, I used... And it was like, don't put your... I remember I had like a little rolled doll book of like, I think you got from school of all the things you should and shouldn't do near trains. Obviously, it's, you know, don't go and play on the tracks and stuff. But I always remember the cartoon of the person that stuck his head out the window and another train just like whipped his head off. Yeah. I tell you what, it scarred me. I never put my head out of a train window just in case. Oh, I did. <laughs> oh, well, it's amazing you're still here because my Roald Dahl safety, Roald Dahl was train you safety off. book. Roald Dahl made you think that there was going to be uh, BFGs like bopping you out of <laughs> your window and stuff like that, so. Oh, God. Up to his toes say, I don't think I've uh, ever been up uh, so early for the A380 landing. Wow. Welcome to the early crew. Yeah, exactly. It's worth it. I think it looks better. To the beacon and everything. I think it's nice that we're getting it's like a bit of a blue hour when that thing comes in now. Yeah, it is. Oh, I can see a plane coming towards us. Well, that's a start. <laughs> I can see two planes coming towards us. Right, so I'll go then. Can't deal with this pressure. <laughs> Oh, so I think a lot of people got like a lot of uh, like different views of planes and stuff yesterday because obviously they switched operations to O5s. I was um, all over the place said yesterday. she was going walking around Entwistle Reservoir. Got a good view of the A380. Oh yeah, yeah, it was scary as hell yesterday. <laughs> it's like, what the hell? Are they, are they switching? I called it first. I won't say that. I said that to Liz, didn't I? Well, they didn't switch at the point when you called it. I think they did. No, they didn't. No, they were getting ready to. That's why they had them hold. I seem to remember it was the chat, but... No, it was the two. So two in, I said the first reason would be that it might be the uh, swapping over. Mm. I, I thought it was I thought no. it was the chat. Sorry, no. chat, I was on your side, guys. <laughs> I'll good morning to you. Yeah, Matt, so I think as long as you, I think it depends like what, sometimes where the memberships go can be, you know, if you've just been watching and things, because you're saying I got gifted a Big Jack TV membership, but I wasn't even watching. I've had that on there before. I think it was, it was around, if it not, wasn't Christmas Day, it was around Christmas. Yeah, so you... you and I'd gotten, I'd been in the stream, but then I'd gone out and got, then I got an email and I was like, oh... Uh, you, better go back and watch some more planes. You also have to remember with Jerry's as well is Jerry's a total different machine in that. <laughs> no, no, no yeah. offence. Right, it's times when you go in there and there's, there's people dropping 60 or 70 memberships, you know, like in a half an hour. So there's also like a... Oh, they're, them people are amazing. Like, it's, uh... So I think if that's the case, then not everyone has the free membership things turned on, do they? So then yeah. it'll just go through the chat uh, yeah. members and just, like, choose. Well, I was very oh, oh, appreciative oh, 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 oh. of it. Come uh, on. That easy journey that just left is going to Hamburg. This that is coming ahead of us. In your uh, face, EasyJet. EasyJet for Berlin, an A320. Hello, EasyJet. <laughs> But yeah, no, I think gifted memberships are, um, like we were saying, we, were we saying said on Joe. the show, we were saying to Joe last night, like, we were a bit, like, sceptical of them at first, but I think they're... They're very good. I think they're very good. Like, so obviously we've got, like, memberships on the Think Planes account with uh, with other channels, um, but I don't, like, I don't have any personal anymore. It's kind of like, I, you know, I, I'll be honest, I don't have a lot of money, so it's unfortunately just out of my... Um, kind of budget and things so so when you get gifted a membership it's so like it's such a nice feeling so i you know fair play to youtube i reckon mr easy jet though is going to sit there for a while i've got a feeling engine's still on oh we'll see
Pressing a load of buttons, though. Pressing a load of buttons. Yeah, so they're shutting it down. I was going to say, is that the... There we go. There you go. There Engine's you go. off button. Yeah, I just saw the FO. Just switch it, switch everything, turn everything down, so... Oh, well, it was so good while it lasted. And uh, speaking of memberships, Craig has just gifted a membership that's going to a happy day. Oh, thank you so thank much, you mate. Thank you so much. And uh, say, if you are gifted a membership, please just make sure to thank the person who got it for you. If, you know, uh, as I say, it's just great generosity. Yeah. And it just shows why we do have an amazing community in yeah. the aviation sector, not just like in our chat, yeah. just in general. So many lovely people. So, uh, yes, there we go. But all we will ever ask of any of you is just to press the like button. Yes. You're never going to find us sitting. I know we were just talking about it, but that was definitely... I would never be here, like, talking about that with a... Oh, well, if I say it, maybe maybe people... I, I don't want you to do that. Just hit the like button. That's all I've ever, ever asked you Start to do. Start gifting membership straight, uh, trains. No, no, don't do that. No. That's ridiculous. We are not about that life. No. This right there is after Tenerife. Andy said I can remember that book. <laughs> oh, that easy jet I think went through the moon. Oh, did it? Yeah, just looking at it, it's the line that it took. Oh, okay. So that's something we need to check on departures. Yeah. So we did this at stream when we were down the top end. Yeah, yeah. Um, and we actually got a plane going through the moon. I wouldn't mind doing that again. Just because I'm, I'm aware. Harry, I went back onto that the other day. <laughs> and all you could hear me is you going, like, focus, focus, ISO, ISO, focus, focus. <laughs> and then you just get it at the last minute. <laughs> That's what it's all about. <laughs> it worked. Seven three seven was off to Berlin. Not German flights out this morning, or flights to Germany rather than just they're all German. Uh, nothing on the approach just yet. Well, I am going to watch the previous Ryanair that departed to see okay, what it does. Yeah. Oh, no, um, right, where was I in the chat? got another Ryanair. It's Ryanair hour. Mike, well, we've just had EasyJet hour. Well, it's Michael O'Leary hour. <laughs> Don't say that. He'll think, oh my God, I have to pay for this. I can't. Ryanair will not be paying for this. Michael but... O'Leary, you need to pay for your seat to watch this. <laughs> it's a £122,000. Uh, £122, <laughs> and if you want to bring a bag with you, that's another £258,000. <laughs> See how you like it. If you, want, if you want a drink and a snack while you watch as well. Oh, yeah. <laughs> We're going to rob you, boy. <laughs> yeah, I can stuff you in your lair jets. You're flying with think planes today. Exactly. Um, right, where... Oh, I'm sorry, I've like, lost my place. Oh, Robin's next to you. Oh, well, David's saying, um, you need to check out uh, Dumb Ways to Die, a short animated video from 10 years ago produced by Metro Trains Melbourne. Uh, be safe around trains. That sounds uh, sounds like the sort of thing that they'll show kids. And it, it will, it, it, well, unlike you, it doesn't, like, you forget about it. Someone like me, I'm, like, scarred for life. Uh, Wacker, good morning. Eighth day, good morning. Right now, it's too low. So, so the right now is just departed. Just checking who's going to go through the moon, but he's a bit too low. Oh, okay. Ah! 
it went through. Oh, no. It's like, so it goes under and then they're banking over towards us. Ah, oh, right. So it, it's actually going through. That went through the bottom of it. It wasn't through the middle. Okay. But that's why that pan was so bad, because I was actually watching it going through the moon. And I was like going, I was, I was swearing underneath my breath. So, it, like, if this one doesn't go through now, we're going to be struggling to get one, because I think it'll be too low after that. So we've just got to hope that this one does it. Let's do an extended departure on this one. Yeah. Uh, Richard, good morning. And uh, Joe gifting 10 memberships. They yeah. have gone to uh, Ian Finley, Gary, Dean, Ian Dunn, Ben Smith, Arthur Clark, uh, Douglas Crab, Harry P, uh, Matthew Mavic, FIUK, uh, Anil, and I think that was it. I think that was all awesome. But thank you so much. That is amazing. Thank you, Joe, mate. We really do appreciate it. You're an absolute ledge. Yeah, that's uh, that's fantastic. Big welcome to our new members. No thought we'd be doing an extended departure on the right now. Well, here we are. How things change. Dare Paul, a good morning to you. Just watching what's on the airfield. We've got another Ryanair on taxi. Oh yeah, this one's banking round. This one, this one's going to be close, right? All right, here we go. All right, I'm going to start playing with the ISO. All right, so it's going to get darker because I, I need to try to guess what the exposure of the moon's going to be. <laughs> you know, I'm here for this, people. Uh, Noah, good morning. Oh, I think it's going to go right through. If you're just tuning in, we're trying to get a Ryanair crossing the moon. Yeah, so it's going to go right through the shot if it is. Okay. Come on, bank, bank right, bank anyway, right. Just, I'm going to just up. Oh, it's going under. Oh, well. I've just got it to 4K, just for like in the hopes. No, of... it's going under. Oh, oh loser. <laughs> sort your life out. Right. right, no more Ryanair to the day. Disappointed. Easy jet. Go on, start up, get out there, we love you, mighty orange, all that. <laughs> Michael O'Leary's like, that's what you get for charging me. Yeah, oh, I'm going to charge you <laughs> double now, you absolute mug. <laughs> oh dear, right, well we've got a few things coming round on to finals. We've got an Aer Lingus ATR 72 from Belfast. Oh, look, they're having conversations on the flight deck. Oh. What did you do on Sunday? Oh, I had a belting roast, mate. Oh, it was banging. We had Yorkshire puddings as well. <laughs> Why is he talking like that? He's from Yorkshire. <laughs> Why? And the captain's from Liverpool. All right, mate. Well, uh, uh, yeah, you know what I mean? Let's just, let's go to Corfu instead, you know, because it's better. It's got a better runway. And the Yorkshire going, yee, bag, I'm not sure about that. <laughs> and I don't know what happened with that accent at the end. Oh, like, <laughs> that weird. Uh, anyway... <laughs> I would do the uh, ATR, which you should be able to see relatively oh, soon. it's an ATR. We love an ATR. Um, there'll be a Ryanair 737 Quinn from Dublin. And then behind that, we've got a Virgin Atlantic A330. It's the VS76 coming back in from Orlando. Just going to have a look where... Uh, where anything else big is. It's a turn and burn. That's up early. Where was that going to? Uh, two seconds over the Atlantic. Um, <laughs> that is going to Dublin. Yeah. Probably explains that one, doesn't it? Yeah, probably. Uh, uh, so, yes, yeah, so we've got a uh, Tui Dreamliner from Montego Bay. That's just over the west coast of Ireland at the moment. And mid-Atlantic is the uh, Singapore A350 from Houston. That's one hour and 43 minutes out. People is... Also near there, we, we saw this on the board yesterday, is a, um, 
a Bombardier Challenger 350. Oh, yes, coming from uh, Teterborough. Yeah, um, to Manchester. You got serious, Dollar. got some money. <laughs> you got some... I expect that to land and just, like... Just throw tennis at us. Just loads of music, uh, music uh, money, just yeah. to, like, Throw dollars at out. us. Yeah. I'll and... lap dance for you. <laughs> <laughs> uh, yeah, because if you can afford... Um, transatlantic. A transatlantic private flight, you, you know... You can be my sugar daddy. <laughs> okay. Um, yep. Yeah. So EasyJet's on the roll. Fantastic. Um, it's, uh, yeah, we're sponsored by EasyJet now. We've got three. Fantastic. Benjamin, good morning. Easy out, you need to bank right and go through the moon. <laughs> yeah, one job, one job only. Daniel, good morning. Lindsay, good morning. Some mixed reviews on the accents. <laughs> I just saw Paul say, Not the mighty orange for me. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, but that one was going to Bordeaux. It has just left. And it's a little baby 19 as well. And we've got a Ryanair 737 Max 8 on the way out, going to Milan. Sorry, a Max 8 200. Oh, yeah, just thanks, Liz. 737 8 200. It's Max 8. <laughs> yeah, it's just a Max. Just saying it for you, people. Right, I'm watching this easy jet, the other one, the first one that's departed. Okay, we're, yeah, we're looking good on this one. You've just got a Ryan, Ryanair's next arrival. Your Virgin uh, Atlantic is Don't up near Hyde. Don't care. <laughs> Don't care. Get, get lost. <laughs> I'm here for the moon. That's all right, that's short speed. Oh, wrong way. That way. There's the moon. Simon's commitment here to... Oh, this could, it, could, it could do it. Right, here we go. It is banking towards us. All right, I'm going to go back into 4K, just hopefully get... Uh... Yeah, guys, going to 4K if you've got it. I'm just going to lighten this up a bit. <laughs> oh, it's going under again. Oh, you're going to see it underneath here. Somewhere. <laughs> oh, oh, nearly pulled the HDMI out. That would have been good. Yeah, you can see it underneath it. It's gone well underneath it. Oh, Oh. Well, you got a nice shot of the moon. Thanks. <laughs> Great. Awesome. Alas. I'm not feeling that. <laughs> <laughs> we tried. We tried. Thanks, mate. Uh, yeah, I think the other one's banking off to the left as well, so uh, that's not going to do. Right, we've got Ryanair. Right, let's see if O'Leary does as good for once. <laughs> Right, if you if you're on Sc if you're on Scottish ra uh, radar, can you please just make sure that you get them up a bit earlier? Just like just let them go, <laughs> let go, let them get, just go up higher, quicker. Do you know what I mean? Uh, love you, Scottish. So, uh, sky's starting to look quite nice, actually. Yeah. yeah, it is. It's getting light very quickly. It's very frosty here actually this morning. Now that I can see, um, Ryanair's just landed. Your next driver will be the Virgin Atlantic. We'll get the Virgin, I'm not getting that, because we yeah, have yeah, a max right in front of us. Yeah, it's over Stockport. Excellent. Uh, magnetic pictures, good morning.
I can't find the message, but I think a few people are saying bye to Carl in. So if you are going, thank you for tuning in. Uh, if you're not, then I don't know what's going on. And <laughs> that's what happens to you know, in the chat. Oh, wow. <laughs> but, um... I'm just going to say goodnight, Carl Wynn. There we go. Okay, right. Um, I, don't, I don't know, because I, I don't have a phone on me, so I'm, just, no. I, I'm even worse than Virgin anyone else. Passes, has Antic passed Cheadle. Okay, well, I'm going to go down to that end now. And I'll just do a quick... A few quick cable inspections. See if we're still cooking with gas. Well, yeah, I hope you all enjoyed the moon. I hope that was... Uh... Yeah, Paul said the disappointment in your voice. Yeah, thanks, mate. Happy Christmas, everyone. <laughs> Bar humbug. Oh, I can see the virgin coming through the bushes now. Okay, this rhino... Uh, what Do we know where that one was going to, that rhino? It looks like he's going to do the bank, right? Oh, he is, yeah. Okay, so we'll, we'll keep an eye on this one. The virgin just better get down on the, the ground quick, because, I'm sorry, moonshots are... Oh, no, he's... Oh, he's banking left, I think. Oh, I'll have a look on uh, flight radar what he's doing. Oh, he's bank left. He's left. He's bank left. He's mugged us off. Yeah, and he's saying uh, maybe Ryanair might start charging uh, for a moonshot um, special for an extra euro. Yeah. Well, Ryanair can pay me because they use a lot of my git, my voice. So. That's, That's very true. Yeah. Love you, admin team. <laughs> Wow, I'll tell you what, got that stock quickly, didn't it? I did. He's going to take this early intersection. Dave, good morning. Mohammed, good morning. Well, whoever's on board wants to get home early there, don't they? They're like, yeah, yeah, I don't care. Wow, how light has it got in the last few minutes? Really, really light. Lee, good morning. And uh, Dean, have a good day at work. Is that Dean? Be, yeah, yeah, but he said... Uh, about, I hope you don't. He said, after work, but I'll listen to Simon chat waffle through my speakers. All right, I'll let you off. <laughs> there you go. Compromise. Let's get in. Let's get in. This. Let's see what they're up to now. Diana, good morning. Oh, they don't like each other anymore. They're like, oh no, they're still talking actually. So, do you like being a pilot? <laughs> no. You, uh, you on Facebook, mate? Yeah. No. Mm. What's the favourite bit about being a pilot? Cabin crew. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> oh dear, I'm gonna get into some. Tip for that, aren't I? <laughs> Sorry, people. Okay, well, let's go. Let's go onto a plane that's doing something. We'll go back on that Virgin. That so I like that. Like I like this shot one. as it goes past the tower. It's quite cool. And uh, what can I say? My partner Anthony is on at GVNYC. I don't know which one that is, but uh, hang on. <laughs> it be Virgin, right? GVNYC. You make potentially. Oh, the Robin's here. I'm Hello, probably totally Mr. wrong Robin. with that one. My regs have just gone out of my head. Won't lie. Yeah, it's a virgin that's just landed. There we go. Yeah. Happy days. Yeah, I'm on it. I'm on it, me. No, my reg is me. I'm such a jerk. You just said you forgot them all? What you call? I, I, knew it was, I knew it was a virgin. Yeah. And I don't have a phone in front of me just like to tell you what it, what, what <laughs> reg it is. You know what I mean? I can't believe how light it's gotten. It's 
to warm my hands up for a minute. So uh, here's when the sun comes up. It does get. Does it get has rude. got a lot colder. Like when we got, like when we were walking from the car, we were like, "Oh, it's like it's really cold today." Um, and then we got here and we're like, mm, "It's not not too bad. It's quite sheltered here." But as I say, as the sun comes up, you do start to feel it. Yeah. My stomach, like, warm with my hot water bottle. <laughs> the rest of me's cold. I'm going to have to start getting one of them, um, you know, like them kind of jacket liners that heat you up. No. No? No. Why? Because I said so. Oh, you can have one as well. I don't want one. Oh, wow. Well. You can stay cold then. I will do. No, do you know what? I'll have hand warmers that just keep my hands warm, thanks. Oh, look, Liz. Hand warmers. Mm. Oh, keep my hands warm. Lovely. Thank you. <laughs> Let's have a look at the A380. Uh, see what I'm doing on it. Oh, crew bus. Hashtag sell wins. Yes, yeah, Dean's saying, uh, I have a good job and a good boss, and he lets me watch the stream while I'm working. I'd say do you like, actually do any work? I'm not sure if you do. I said that should be like in your contract, like allowed to watch Think Planes. Yeah. No other channels, just think planes. Yeah, you can't watch anyone else at work. Yeah. I'd, In your own time. I'd you sack can... you for that, Dean. Yeah, no. <laughs> sack you, mate. I, I know we're mates. I'd still sack you. Well, just to the right of that Emirates A380, we do have an EasyJet that uh, looks like it's going to be making its way over here any time now. Tamapani, good morning over in uh, Sri Lanka. Wow. Currently uh, just before 1 pm there. Yeah, I'm warm. Yeah, so uh, just before 7 30 in the morning here in Manchester. Uh, next arrival will be um, an Embraer Pr- 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 Prater 6. Oh, it's a biz jet. Okay. Thanks, Liz. Yeah, it's come from. Uh, I don't think Embraer will be Hang on a minute. Up. That's coming from Teterborough, but there was another one in the Atlantic. There's two of them. Oh, oh, something's happening. Someone, what know? is going on? Why is everyone coming over here? Wow. Right. Interesting. Is anyone, anyone know, aware of any conferences or something that's happening in Manchester that would involve a big Yan- uh, American company? They said Yankee company. Though. Yeah, I know you did. <laughs> Oops. Uh, American company? If you do, please let us know. Probably is them. Yeah, because obviously there's two. Yeah, two, two. I wish this one set off quite a bit earlier. <laughs> I think they've got like I know like them little private jets are like dead car. I hope it's one of the ones that's got like a proper bed in it. Alright. Because they do have comfy seats, but you never see them like oh these lie flat. Oh, it's interesting that two are in. Mm. Maybe they've come to discuss balloons. No, they come to talk planes with us. Like they're going to no. offer. Us, they, they're from Boeing. They've come to offer us a massive contract. <laughs> oh my god, I'm getting so excited now, Liz. <laughs> they saw that we were the first 4K streamers here at Manchester and Heathrow. Like, we need this in our lives. That's saying it. And they went, "Oh, we, yeah, this is what we need for our next Boeing production." <laughs> we realised the 747 one was a bit n- naff, to be honest. <laughs> uh, I need some. some British humour in there. Oh, oh God. Uh, starting up. Planes by Mike. Good morning, have you all? Oh, let's go, let's go on this. David, go. good morning. We're starting up on the EasyJet that's been there for a while. Oh, that, ver- oh, that reverb. Smoke, smoke. <laughs> Do love a little bit of engine smoke as you start up. Should we give him a wave? Let's see if, let's see if we can get a wave. Uh, David, not a problem. Uh, enjoy chat with your daughter. Guys, you're you're in 4K on our stream. Stop pressing buttons; they're not important, <laughs> unless it's an ejector seat. <laughs> about yeah, it's a second engine up. It's an Airbus retrofitted ejector seat. Yep, so on. Uh, David, we don't even have breakfast. We've uh, we've got some coffee. We have coffee. We do coffee. We but do we're not co- even, I'm not even having it yet. Oh, that smoke off that engine there, starting up. Love it. Jamie, good morning. It's 
Sammy, good morning. Good morning. That was uh, an EasyJet A320 going to uh, Copenhagen. That BizJet has touched down over there somewhere. It has. I'll jump on it now. It's just for you to know what a BizJet fan you are. Oh, yeah. I'm just thinking of Harrison. Isn't he going somewhere? He's flying out today. I don't, I, you need to check his socials. Hang on, at, uh, hang on. Right, and message him what he's on. Two seconds. Like I don't know walk. what he's flying today, to be honest. Right, 26 minutes to go. Oh, that's a nice looking biz yet, to Very be honest. Security. Hang on, I'll message him. Just put, hey, sexy. No, I'm going straight to the point. <laughs> I'm sure what you're flying on. <laughs> I put, no, we put, hey, sexy. Oh, <laughs> well, you can think... come in the chat, can't you? You know it's all live. We're not good enough for him. He doesn't watch us anymore. <laughs> We've got this yet. Doesn't care because he doesn't post photos anymore. It's too, it's too blowing. <laughs> I hope he's in the chat, by the way. I'm trying to wind him up. Oh, man. All right, Captain, if you don't wave to us, you're going to lose your job. Oh, FO's got shades on. I don't think he needs one just yet. Like, he knows he's on TV, he's like, I'm going to. Okay, on okay, okay, okay. And there's some, I know there's some at landing, but I don't care because I think this easy jet's going to go through. Okay. Right, let's go. Let's go. Let's get exposure right. It's only the British Airways that's landed, so... Oh, I'll uh, sat that. Don't worry. Ah, oh, no, no, don't do that. Sorry, I apologise. It went auto-ISO. <laughs> Welcome back to uh, the escapades. We're trying to get a plane flying through the moon. Oh, it's just above it. <laughs> <laughs> this is muggy wrong. You're going to see it come through the top in a minute. It's just over the top now. Oh, I hate you. <laughs> My hate is so strong right now. Oh, dear. Oh, no. Oh, that's so annoying. I don't like... At least I got my settings dialed in for the moon shot anyway, so... Oh, dear me. I'll take the positive um, side of that. Uh, Dean said he watches Jerry as well. I can let that one off. That's fine. Yeah, we'll go, we'll go with that. Don't worry, mate. Yeah. But that's it. That's all that's written in your contract. <laughs> Us and Jerry, that's it. Yeah. <laughs> right, sorry, I'm going to record. I just want you to know that that captain's getting the sack. Because <laughs> he didn't wave. I'm emailing Stalios as we speak. Stalios. <laughs> Even though he literally has nothing to do with the business anymore. I don't care. Well, they're off to Berlin, so... Um... Uh, well, I hope you get delayed on the way back. Oh. 
bitter, salty. Hashtag sigh. Well, we've got another uh, another easy jet on the way out now. It's another A320. Hey, got, what, what's Matt's, which one is Matt's wife on? Because we do have one of the uh, thingies. Uh, this one's going to ca- uh, Cambridge. Cambridge. Yeah. I couldn't read the word Cambridge then. I think she's going to Bill and That's she? right, she is. Okay. Well, I, I'm going to focus on this one anyway, just in case. But yeah, you're right. I think she, she is on the Bill and one. I might even do you a little 4K video, Matt. And, uh, morning, Mike. Saying just a brief look in working today. Not a problem. Thanks for popping in. Magic. Yeah. Magic. Nice, mate. Like, as we always say to our mods, if you can come in, that's great. If not, don't ever feel bad about it, honestly, because we just appreciate any time you can pop in. So don't. So thank you anyway for just saying that. But we, we, we understand that people have lives. Actually, no, I'm changing my mind. Mike, why aren't you in the chat? <laughs> what, well, you 24-7? Even though when we're not streaming, you need to be there. I say, where's Ender? Where's Ender? He's mad. Where's Ender not in the chat? Because <laughs> Ender gets in, like, 22 magazine publications in a month. That's why. <laughs> right, so don't start Don't start my Ender. <laughs> Oh, Mike's saying apparently they've had some flights at Liverpool from Teterborough. It's interesting. Like, when was... Sorry, sorry, Mike. Uh, was this, is, that, is this in the last few days? Or is it just in general? Shall I wait for a response? Oh. Wow, this light is changing so quickly I still. Know. Yeah, it's billing 8.55. Brilliant. Cheers, mate. Just wanted to confirm because uh, otherwise I just ignored it. Give me practice though, practice panning, you know what I mean? Yeah. Guys, what do you want me to like pan on? Liz, you choose it because they won't be able to be getting the chat quick enough. Uh, the um, the engine. The engine, okay, that's cool. Do you, do you want a specific engine? Do you want one on the other side? I just got to guess yeah, where it is. Yeah, 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 go for the other side engine. I don't know. I'm not doing that, I'm doing the one on this side. <laughs> I'm just joking there. I'm making it look silly. Um. But Matt said she's uh, installed in the new T3 upstairs quiet area. Thanks for the tip. Are we? Yeah, we loved it when we were up there. No, yeah, it's nice quiet. Like I say, I think in summer... That'll get hammered. Yeah, if people realise that's there, uh, that's going to get really busy and it will not be quiet. And I don't know how they're going to enforce that. They're going to have to. They, they will have to enforce if, that. If, the airport, they can't, if they're going to sell it as a quiet area, they have to enforce it. It's not a party area. Yeah. There's a bar downstairs for that. But yeah, it's, it's nice up there. Nice view out the windows as well. Yeah, we enjoyed it, didn't we? And there was nobody up there. There's literally not another two people. There's the bloke who's having his buddies as well at work, but he doesn't count. Yeah, it's entirely their sleeping, wasn't there, when we got up there? Yeah. Well, that's what it's there for, though, isn't it? Unless he snores. Well. Wow. Right, I feel. I... Come on, Harrison. What are you doing? He's enjoying the. Uh, he's enjoying the lounge. Oh yeah, he's got he's got he gets lounge access because he has a certain card. Other cards, the credit card. cards are available. <laughs> um, <laughs> but to be honest, if you want the perks, you gotta go for a certain brand. Uh, Harrison Harrison's probably the only person who gets his worth out of it. Yeah, yeah he does. Mine isn't as fancy for that. on that engine Liz well done just have a watch now uh, next arrival is going to be Ryan uh, A320 that still throws me because it's the uh, it's operated by Lauda uh, yeah. it's come from Vienna Lauda sorry Lauda yeah, yeah. <laughs> it still throws me though no Carlos is up Gillian good morning should we get in over the top? Yeah, why not? There you go. Pocket rocket, yeah, that's the one, James. Pocket rocket. There we uh, go. Nisha, good morning. This one's coming from, well, I'd say roughly north to south. 
north of the Let's have a look. See? Um, so it's over the middle of, like... Is it further south at the moment? No, it's, it's literally just to the north of the airfield. Oh, no, hang on. There we go. Jet 2, potentially. Is the only one I can really say. Which way is it going? It looks like it's going, like, south. Yeah, I think it's the Jet 2 to Rome from yeah, that, Glasgow. That, that, no, that'd work, that'd work. Yeah. Um, also, uh, I know a couple of people yesterday were saying... Uh, you know when you were like, oh, I can see another flight. And yeah. we were like, oh, it's coming here and it's not coming here. And a few people said Leeds Bradford. And I was like, well, that, that's really weird. But actually... No, that would work. That would work. No, that's already... It's gone past that one. I didn't know they took that track out. Yeah. That's yeah, my no, that, sort that of... Worked. That's me going, sorry, guys. I just, I, I just assumed they wouldn't... I kind of forget, A, how close that airport is. And B, I don't expect them to just go... Oh, and we're going to take off and then fly right over Manchester. Well, sorry, I was just concentrating on our lovely friends at Nats there. Um, oh yes, did you say yeah. Uh, I'm going Tim's to. at work. Uh, my, yes, I think he's in today. I think so. um, sending yeah. sending our love, mate. Absolutely, that allowed it. It's just landed. It's crimson skies, beautiful. We had a couple of cracking uh, sunrises and sunsets. Yeah, we have. Sunset last night was beautiful, wasn't it? It was. Oh, my Facebook was covered in yeah, with so mobile was phone pics of like the sunset. I'm like, guys, just go out with your camera. And like a lot of these people have cameras, so it's not a case of yeah. people not having cameras. I know that they do. You can tell he's got an iPhone as well because of the way it does the colours. Yeah. It like oversaturates the colours in the sky. Uh, David saying, "What's the temperature this morning?" Oscar? Cold. Well, <laughs> the official temperature is cold. All right, so uh, so look fact, at the... why am I going to the Met? Should we actually know? It's interesting to see what the Met Office says in comparison. So the Met Office saying at the moment minus two feels like minus five. Well, let's go on the um, what's it on flight radar and see what that's saying. Uh, that's the wind. Not looking at that today. Temperature zero. I think that's Tim standing up. It looks like Tim. So in the centre of the picture, you've got two... Like, there's just one person on the extreme right, then there's another person, then the person to the left of that, I think that's Tim. Oh. Hi, Tim! Hi, Tim! <laughs> Magic wave at you! <laughs> South side! <laughs> he's there with the warm broom, we're like, yeah, it's freezing, it's minus five over here. Yeah, he's like, oh, I'm glad I'm not out there today, like, yeah. <laughs> See, he's all wrapped up, he's then remembering how cold it was when he was here, knowing it's colder today. Yeah, I'd, I'd have forty-eight p on that. That's that's Tim. Uh, Simon, good morning. And if it's not Tim, I look silly. <laughs> wow, it's what time are we on now? I'm going to look at my phone. Seven forty-three. Like you know, like when we compare it to like a probably like a month ago, you yeah. know, like when it was great, and it was like it just wasn't even remotely light at this time. I know. That is crazy. Well, like I say, there was already, when the Emirates was landing, there was already just like that little touch of light in the sky and you're Absolutely. just like, that's, you see that in the dark. It won't be long before that'll be arriving and it's just like daylight. Yeah, absolutely. Right, well, I think the moonshots are out of it now. I think it's far too low and yeah. it's about to go behind the cloud base, so. Bye-bye, moon. Thanks for mucking me off once again. <laughs> yeah, I was having a go at Nat, uh, at the uh, ATC, uh, you know, at Nats and uh, Swanwick and stuff like that, but no, it's... it's uh, I know it's Scottish, isn't it? Um, sorry, I'm thinking to myself. Um, <laughs> sorry, what? Yeah, sorry, I was just having an uh, internal moment. Uh, so, yeah, I was, I was blaming them. It's actually not. It's the it's the universe that's against me. Yeah. So, uh, well. Um, thanks, universe. ADC Teterboro, did you say it's in um, New York somewhere? Yeah. It's, it's in opposite the state. <laughs> there we go. It's uh, it, If you watch the... Um, Miracle on the Hudson film. It's one of the possible oh, diversion yeah, it's one airports. Of the, oh, there you go. Put them on the map. There you go. Uh, Peppy, good morning to you over in uh, Innsbruck.
would have to do that. I don't know what he's trying to show me. Oh, really? Yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah, you're fine there. Dearing me. Yeah, absolutely. So. Uh, Joanne, good morning. Uh, Andy, yeah, so La so Louder originally was Loud Air, and that was set up by Nicky Louder, the F1 exactly. driver. Um, that kind of went, went, went to, to administration. Yeah. Didn't they? Um, and so I think obviously Ryanair of. So sort of tax dodge. Yeah. <laughs> I went, let's go for it. Let's go all in. I think they saw the uh, potential of, like, maybe more airports that are maybe more custom when people might have been like, I don't want to go with Ryanair, but louder. They kind of see it as a name they know. So, yeah. Although you are still flying with Ryanair. Well, it is, though, isn't it? It's definitely a kind of airline that I associate with good good things. And yeah. Like, you, know, you probably wouldn't see that sometimes with... Uh, right. He's on the EasyJet A320neo to Tenerife. Oh, he's back up to tenors, is he? Okay, thanks for that, H. Um, what time's that out at? Hang on. Um, oh, but men and I'll see at 3C. Yeah, he said that um, to me. So the worst wave ever. <laughs> oh, we've got some bizjet action for you, H. Oh, dear. The robin's right by my top. Robin knows where it's at. He does. He's got taste. <laughs> uh, Flight Simmer, good morning. So I'm watching whilst sitting in Manchester waiting to go to Orlando at ten past ten. We'll get we you. We'll catch you. And, uh, Mavic, good morning. George, good morning. Uh, David uh, saying uh, I'm dreading coming back on Thursday uh, I've been averaging 33 degrees in general in Malaysia oh well, you're going to love it when you get off that plane I'll oh, tell you absolutely you might turn into an icicle and that is not an, that's not even not a, a joke. joke vision thing good morning hey Paul how you doing mate it's good to have you in the chat And uh, James Williams, good morning to you. Said, uh, nursing a cold, glad to be watching. I feel like I've been, like, trying to dodge a cold for, like, ages now. But uh, I hope you feel this, I, soon. I, I wasn't feeling too great this morning, but, yeah, I'm, I'm not, it's, not, it's not like a cold, but something else. But, yeah, it is that silly season, isn't it, when everyone's kind of just yeah. getting the odd kind of ailment. And I'm guessing this is a cold Snap's not going to help with that. Definitely not. Oops. Also, the pink skies, though, for us. I'll take the pink skies. Yes, I will. Any day. It's a bit dead at the moment, isn't it? Where's all the planes gone? I think it's going to be a peaks and troughs day, kind of. I think it is. Today. I think it was used to yesterday where it was... Uh, I am going to get this one, Liz, if that's all right. Yep.
Right, right well, our next arrival, just coming to finals, is a Logan Air. Uh, it's an Embraer uh, E145. That's coming in from Aberdeen. Excellent. Uh, we've then got the uh, Tui Dreamliner from Montego Bay. Uh, that's currently just over Bolton. Okay, so I've just crossed over to where I used the auto so that's why it's just got a little bit darker, but we should be good all the way through now. Sounds good. Good. <laughs> Alright, we've got a Ryanair coming out. That's going to Limoges. I've, I have. N you, you got it right yesterday and you got it wrong today. Oh. Limoges. 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 It's a 737. <laughs> Oh, should we get some over the top action? Yeah, there's not We've much. Got two coming towards us. All right, let's have a look. Okay, well, I didn't get them that time. Let's have a go. I was going to say, I think there's an Air Canada that's literally just flown past, but yeah, there are. Yeah, that that one. This is the and one. And the I'm... other one to the north, more. There's a Ryanair going to Stansted. Oh, uh, not Stan. Yeah, it is Stansted. Yeah, that is from that uh, Edinburgh. What's the one behind it? Behind. Uh... Ooh, um, the two following very similar tracks. I can't see one. Like almost just, it's like there's one. No, that's too far. Okay, well, I'm gonna get second one because the pan, my pan can't get my panning handle. Can't. And there's a Rhino going to, um, Memmingham, but I don't. That's the only one it could be if it's around there. So I'm gonna look under that underbelly. It does look like it could be a Rhino. To be oh, honest, right, there's okay. a lot of blue on there. It is quite a distance out, to be honest. Yeah, maybe it is that then. Oh my god, my hands are so cold. Do I borrow this for two minutes? Oh, yeah, if you don't mind. Yeah, I do. Well, I just warm my hands up, everybody. Right, exactly. Oh, god. Oh, and it's like, I used to have some of these. Like, not like this, they were a bit different. I need to dig them out. I don't know where they've gone. Then we can both have hand warmers. They work better in a pocket, don't they? They do heat up a lot quicker. Right. I shall do that. Oh, let's all just think of summer days. <sighs> T-shirts at five o'clock in the morning. That's just going to be epic. Oh, I can't wait. That is, uh, that is living the dream right there. Some say living it large, but some say living the dream. <laughs> but um, no, I can't wait for that. Gotta look at the colour of like, the sky over there. I feel like, I definitely feel that O'Leary needs to pay us today. I, I would agree. Uh, I'll take a free flight. <laughs> well, haven't you just paid for a flight? Yeah, I would like. Can I have a refund on that then? <laughs> I'll do me the world of good. I might pour myself a coffee in a minute. I think I said that about ten minutes ago, yeah, to be I fair. Yeah, I think you're, uh, your standards are out the window today, to be honest. I know, I know. If you were cabin crew, you would have got the sack by now. Especially if you're at um, Ryanair. Oh, that would be too stressful for me. No one ever wanted me as cabin crew. That's true. In fairness, you knock so many glasses over, you'd be a liability. <laughs> Everyone would be walking off with scalded legs. <laughs> like, going, oh, I can't have Rhino, I've got first, first degree burns. No, thank you, Liz. Oh, oh cheers, my that uh, Apparently it's uh, 8 o'clock, that um, EasyJet that is due out, that Harrison's on. Oh my God, I'll get there in the end. I wonder what you were doing though. Um, that battery's just gone down like really quick on that today. That was like three quarters full. You know, it has that day where it just goes, doesn't have a good day. It stays that day. Oh, we've got, uh, got a plane coming in. Well, we've got a plane at Manchester Airport. We love it. <laughs> uh, right, I'm back to where I was. I found out I Logan Air chair. Embraer. Uh, oh, yeah, that's the one in from was it Aberdeen. Oh, do you know what I Right. This is a really weird story, right? So I woke up last night. And I think I was like half drifting off to sleep and I bit my tongue somehow. Oh, God, she's been moaning about buying a tongue. Right, it's really sore. And I feel like I can't talk properly. I think it's like I've swollen a little bit or something. No, Liz, you just can't talk properly anyway. Oh, thank you.
with uh, Debbie, good morning. Phil, good morning. Excellent. Welcome, everyone. It's great to have you with us today. Jenny, good morning. You can tell I'm uh, focusing on warming my hands up. <laughs> Priorities. Oh, absolutely. Oh, my God. It's just got... Oh, I know what's happened. Oh, there really doesn't like that exposure today. Okay, one sec. So I don't like going to auto ISO too early. Yeah. It just doesn't nail it for me well enough. Yeah. Um, Mark, to be fair, like, man, like yesterday we were saying yesterday, like, it, was, it was pretty busy yesterday. Was a good yesterday was like, I, I think like for us as a show, I thought it was like the best show uh, in regards of movement wise. Yeah, it, it was, was just great. consistent all the way through. Okay. It just it just does this every so often. You yeah. just have to live with it. I think we've got to remember as well. We are still in the winter season. Yeah. It picks up more in summer. That it's, it's just natural that it is quieter in winter. But it it it, it you know, what will happen is we'll get to well like ten past eight or something like that, twenty past eight, and all of a sudden there'll be like ten planes pinging. Yeah. Uh, that's what that's how it always is. So, yeah, get your cups of tea, coffee, bacon rolls, cereal, muesli, porridge, and all that kind of rubbish. Uh, get well, and soldiers. That was as a hint to Liz as well to get the coffee on, please. Oh God, right. Okay. Yeah, because if we do it now, then it's like we don't need it when it gets busy. All right. Right. Shan, sorry, I'll be back with you in a minute. We do have a rhino on the taxi over here at the moment. And we've got an easy jet. See what I mean? It's the, it just have, but look at the light I'll on the A380. I'll see what the, what the easy jet is. And, uh, Steve Harrison. Thank you. <laughs> No, the, light, the light's just gone on to the Emirates and it looks um, it looks gorgeous, so... Uh, what is that? B-roll. <laughs> B-roll. B-roll. I love a bit of B-roll. <laughs> there we go. Okay, I'll give you the... Uh... B-roll for the B-team. <laughs> oh... Some planes. There we have a Ryan there. I mean, come on, people. We were showing some O'Leary hatred before. You know, try to charge him with ten million pounds for a seat on a plane. Now we're showing him some love. Right. Let me put my filter back on. Oh, press the wrong thing. Do you want to sit? No, I'll have some in a minute. Okay. Right. You've got a rival. You've got a two Dreamliner. Not far off, literally about to touch down. No. I'll oh, stick on this right there for a minute. Okay. I oh, know, there is. There's Say, two. told you, told you. All right. <laughs> uh, right, these are coming out, it's going to Athens. But, uh, oh, I will look keep at an the eye light. For the Tenerife. Sorry, I'm going to get this one as well. Pan that you did on that thing. That's ultimate pan in that. I've got a coffee in one hand, I was swigging in front of it, right? And I moved from the two to the three. <laughs> I'm like going, yeah, nonchalant, I'll just uh, yes, I'll just do this, thank you. That's what you get when you're uh, when you're a pro. It's like, no, it's uh, we're just raising the bar here on this channel. It's uh, it's how we roll. And uh, oh, the light on that is gorgeous. Oh, nice. I'm James saying a friend of mine flew out to Dubai last night on the A380 on the way to the Maldives. Ooh. I know they, nice. they did a Maldives sale a while ago, didn't they? Emirates? Oh, did and I was they? Like, yeah. You know, when they reintroduced the route there? Um, well, I think it was extra flights, wasn't it? But, um, yeah. But, well, I hope they have a fantastic time over there. Duh. 
Josh. Good morning to you in West Yorkshire. So I'm waiting for my new fridge to arrive. Uh, my fiance is in bed still, and I'm sat with a coffee watching this on my phone. Top man. Uh, oh, and darts on the TV as well. You're a multitasking that legend. That is like that's a great morning, right there. You are peaking right there, sir. Okay, we have uh, one of the mighty orange coming over now. We'll uh, move off that to me. Thank Cheers. you. Thank you very much. And, uh, Europe 001. We we get to the airport nice and early to get the best, the best planes, the best spots. If you wrap up late, you don't get the best spot. Exactly. Number one for robbing the spots. I don't know, I sat back down that chair. Really <laughs> I bet you it Oh is. my god. I'm just going to have my coffee. I really can't wait till this flask is full of like a nice cold drink in summer. Right, what have we got going on? Uh, right, so this is EasyJet to Athens. Uh, the EasyJet to Tenerife is also on the way. Excellent. Just. Got a Ryanair that's going to be going out to Dublin as well. So I need to switch the transponder off on that Virgin. <laughs> Uh, next arrival, KLM 737 from Liz, Amsterdam. You've missed out the uh, Etihad that's out, coming out. <laughs> what? In my defence, it is not on flight radar. You're joking? It's just going past uh, the end of T2? No, it's not on. Oh, okay. So. Hey, I'm just saying what I see. I don't have a phone. I'm just saying what I see. <laughs> I bet you have a go and look. It's right, well, there's, apparently there's an Etihad coming out as well. <laughs> You've been, you've been treated, people. It's, uh, it's going to be going back to Abu Dhabi, I think. It's uh, new livery as well, for all you new livery lovers. New livery lovers. Can't say that. Good morning to you, saying um, at work, sadly, can't watch live, but we'll definitely catch up later on. Have a good one. Oh, thank you, Paul. Hope you have a good day at work as well. Okay, well, I've just arrived in some nice light. Yeah. Decent. Uh, Matthew, good morning. That they're looking forward to a morning of bickering and banter. Which one do you prefer, though? I know which one I do. Yeah. Bickering all day long. I was going to say banter. Okay. Well, I'm going. I'm here for the bickering. It's and uh, Paul Carlish, good morning to you. I uh, said so just doing some early morning baking. Nice. Uh, bake well at tart. Yum yum. Very nice. I baked in ages. Thank you. Dominating the B-roll here. <laughs> oh, yes, yeah, Richard, coffee's on the go. This is what it's all about, isn't it, in Pizza, these kind of good conditions? Morning. Yeah, it's um, it's a lot warmer. So, I mean, it stays hot anyway. I feel like it's even extra hot today because I made it this morning and not last night. It, yeah, it does help those extra few hours, doesn't it? Yeah, I mean, it's fine otherwise, but just still tastes like a boiling fresh hot cup of coffee like you've just poured it yeah i always love those steam stacks in the background you always look so oh, atmospheric yeah. on like a uh, winter's day i agree um yeah i was knackered last night yeah she was she like well we uh, we got we got pizza <laughs> um literally it was just like mm, all the pizza she um, went into a pizza coma I, I went yeah and i was like i'm going to bed <laughs> right so Liz. Yeah. In regards of uh, 
pizza companies. Oh, yeah. Would you like to rank them now? Because I, I've always said I, okay, I'm a big so... Papa John's fan. Yeah, so last I don't night. agree with some of these views. I'll just talk out there, but okay. I know the company's kind of moved him on, haven't they? Uh, so that was the last, the first time I'd ever had a Papa John's pizza last night. That is definitely ten times better than Domino's. Yeah, so much better. So the thing with Domino's as well, though, is that I would always get the double decadence. Now I still like that because I like because that's um, they're not like freshly baked things. They're like two pizza bases with like really thin ones with like cream cheese in the middle. Oh wow! Um, like sandwich between. And um, so we've got some over the top action. I know there's a plane coming. I don't care. <laughs> but there's like four of them in a small stack. Like, uh, so I don't they are. Um, but yeah. That, then we've got that, and then in front of that we have. There should be one to the right. And we've got this, which is really cool. Right. So they're up there somewhere, there is a Qatar Dreamliner. There's a E. I don't know. There's an easy jet that's just left here. Um, yeah, that's the Dreamliner. There's a British Airways 319. There's a Delta 330. Yep, there's just so um, much. Yeah. <laughs> That's cruel. cruel. There's a little, little biz jet out there, up there, from Autac. Okay, well... Uh, yeah, so, but for, like, actual just normal pizza, none of this, like, fancy pizza. Um, yeah, Papa, Papa John's, John's, it's so, like, the dough is so good. Yeah. Um, Domino is just it's just not that great. It's flat. There's no air in it. Yeah, that's what I've noticed. So I I, I have an uni oven and I make my own pizzas. Well, this is gonna go. Nye, 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 nye. All right, whatever. No one cares. <laughs> um, and one of the things that you notice when you do these kind of uh, Neapolitan style pizzas is like the air and the crust that you can get from cooking at these temperatures. And I just think that the dough and the temperatures that they have for the ovens with the uh, with the Papa John's are just far superior. I think the, the the cooking process is better. Yeah, it's so good. And don't you like Pizza Hut? It's just why would you even bother? Yeah. Me and Hannah, me and Hannah, my friend Hannah, we used to go to Pizza. Like when we were younger, um, we used to go like quite often. That was like a little treat. We'd go have like a meal at Pizza Hut, you know, especially if you had like offers on and stuff. And at some point, it just got really bad. Like they cheaped out at some point, and, yeah. and they went from like, oh, we're like this level of restaurant to like we are cheap. Yeah. That's. I'm going to be cheeky, can I have your mic off your body? It's, yeah. Uh, it will be rubbing on it. That's why we get this departure. Thank you. He's an out for you to check for as well. No, care. no one cares. Harrison. Harrison will care. I don't care about Harrison. So, we're going on Harrison's plane because Harrison's a legend, apparently. I think it's this one. Hang on. Sorry, I know I'm HP. Quite... Oh, it is him. It's Harrison, everyone! Harrison! Right, huh? he's, in, he's in row 3C, remember? 3C, he's in, he's in the aisle seat. I'm not going to see him. I mean, I know he's got a big head, but... <laughs> he's, I think he'll try! He'll he's try! He's got a big head. But, you know, it's, I'm not getting that. Are you recording it? No? Oh, right. I thought you were recording it. Harrison. 
Oops. There, Harrison, this is a beautiful plane that you're on today. I hope you enjoy sitting <laughs> in row 3C. It's the row you deserve. I am going to record it, actually. <laughs> right, when, it, when it spills up. So they're just waiting for the uh, the weight turbulence to dissipate yeah. from the triple seven departing. I think you have to wait a couple of minutes, probably for uh, A320 after that. So uh, I know that the A380 should have got three minutes. Uh, Jonathan, good morning. JJ, good morning. TJ, good morning. And a uh, bit of love for the Tui that in the light. I think I'm getting to the point where surely there's a lot of love for the Etihad in the light as well. It's a lovely morning here at Manchester. It really is sublime at the moment. Uh, Jeff, good morning to you over in Melbourne. Got my beer and nibbles. Life grand. That's what I like to hear. You are peaking, mate. I've just that, seen... To be fair, that cycle's like when we... Because of the time difference, like when we watch Kevin on airline videos... Where they're like, no coffee for us. Like, I know it's morning there. It's like, get a beer. Yeah, exactly. Get a snack. Well, it's like when we were talking to Joe last night, I had a beer, didn't I? Yeah, and he had a coffee. Yeah, he's like on the coffee. I'm like, this is beer o'clock for me, mate. <laughs> right, Matt was saying that there was no Etihad on his flight radar either, so it wasn't just me. Well, don't care. <laughs> <laughs> uh, Northerner, good. Oh. Morning. Oh, it's Lizzie's press, pressing buttons there. Oh, I know. Nearly accidentally blocked someone then. I don't think I did. If you've been blocked... No, I have, but it, it shows out. me. It shows me if I have. Just accidentally press... Like, if I if I press on anyone's name, like, for most people, it just pops up as, like, you can block it yourself. I can throw people out of the channel. Ooh, the power. I only do it to people I don't like. <laughs> Oh, no problem, John. Thank you. So, you know, thanks for the entertainment this morning. Sorry, the uh, moonshots didn't work out, Simon, and have an awesome day all. Oh, thanks, mate. Uh, there's always next time. Yeah. Um, right, pizza. Let's see what other people say about pizza. Oh, got Euro wings to part in? Uh, Stuart's saying about... Oh, tuna and pickle on a pizza. Like a bit of mayo on there as well. Mm. I mean, you basically, it's just a sandwich at that point, really. I used to like tuna pizza and though. The problem is I can't eat tuna now without mayo. That was a very beautiful departure there. Are the Euro wings? I think the light is just. Well, I'm going to be assuming. It's gone to. Sorry, the... Oh, they're going to cross. They're going to cross. Oh, neglected. that was beautiful. Collective flight radar. Uh, so I'm drinking my coffee, but that's uh, back to Dusseldorf for them. Uh, would... We've got a biz jet landing. Oh, that's that Ortac thing I saw. Um, it's coming from Dublin. It's an Embraer Fenham. There it is. Yeah. You just missed a beautiful moment there. 
two planes just crossed as they were departing. Oh. OK. Oh. Well, that's cute. I actually think sometimes... The guitar's pinging. Good. Well, so it should do. I think it's due out there. Sometimes you think what? Sorry? Sometimes I think you're wasted on aviation. Well, if I look around, I can't see my screen anymore because it's too bright. Uh, next arrival will be a Ryanair from Barcelona. It's a 737. And that's a lovely looking Embraer Phenom a, in this light. Got a Tui Dreamliner. Um, Going to be arriving soon as well. That's a position from Newcastle. Newcastle. Yay, yeah, man. <laughs> All the Newcastle people go mental at me now. <laughs> It's just because we're playing it like United no, no playing it. No surprise there, then. It's just, well, yeah. <laughs> All right, over the tops are fantastic. So we've got two coming in from the Atlantic. Well, coming in from the uh, Irish Sea, actually, to be honest. Right, I'm not looking unless you're... Uh... Well, one, I think, is a quad. OK. Oh, so I am going to get that one. Oh, chat, I'll be back with you in a second. Um... If I get it quickly. Yes, I can... No, there's, that's not it. There's an American... No, it's not. It's not. It's, it's Dreamliner. Yeah. Sorry, just look, look. It was pumping out for way. you got to understand, this is like on the other side of Manchester. This there's a Ryanair. Behind it. Yeah, I know, I know, but... <laughs> what else have we got flying around... I'm getting both in one shot. Two planes, one shot. Sounds like a certain <laughs> film. Oh, my God. Uh, ooh, will that go a bit south? There's a DHL triple seven freighter that's going to be going to Frankfurt. I like how you kind of said Frankfurt, but really didn't want to say it at the same time. I, I was just double checking. I, I was I the I'm most... not used to saying DHL and Frankfurt in the same sentence. That's the most non committed kind of Frankfurt I've ever heard in my life. <laughs> Well, anywho, where was I? Um, yeah, Mike's saying, can't wait for my easy jet flight this week. Ooh, nice. <laughs> I do like my flights in the Mighty Orange. Can't uh, can't beat the Mighty Orange. I'm not flowing them for ages, mate. I just, the only thing that I it's found... Like with, Ryanair till I die. The only thing that I've like found with EasyJet of late, and, and it's nothing to do with the service they offer. The service is fantastic. Mm. Is the uh, the baggage prices? They are. Just, I, yeah. I've moaned about this quite a bit actually. I don't know I have on here, but they're, uh, rant they're emojis, everybody. Rant emojis. Yeah, get get on there with your rant emojis. But um, their cabin bag policy sucks. I'm I'm going flat out and saying it sucks. I don't yeah, think it's, it's great. Not good, that is it. Um, th it adds a hell of a lot to your thing. I mean. You know, when you compare it with Ryanair, mm, that's it's it, not great. It? No, exactly. So, uh, yeah, I, I, I found myself... I've got to be honest, I, I used to be someone who used to be on that EasyJet website, you know, looking first. Now I'd probably go to Ryanair first. Oh. And I didn't think I'd ever say that. Michael well, O'Leary's just going, ka-ching! I don't think he's doing that with me, to be honest. I'm, tight, I'm as tight as Tom. T uh, Tom's taught me the best. Oh. But um, as you can see now, we do have the Qatar 777 now uh, taxiing out from the back. Uh, Harry, good morning to you. Um, I'm just going up. Uh, Ollie G, ham and pineapple's the best. That's what I had yesterday. Ian saying I like pizza. Well, Ian Brown saying I like pizza hut. Sorry, I had to stipulate Ooh. the surname then just so we know which Ian we're on about. I'm not like. Are you going to block him from the chat for that? <laughs> no. <laughs> I, don't, I don't rate that pizza at all. No, I mean, look, I'll be honest, I've had it for ages, but I was never, like, that taken by it. I think what you've got to understand is there's different types of pizzas as well, and I think... Pete... <coughs> Bless you. Thank you. But, you know, pe pe uh, everyone kind of thinks that, you know, all, like, pizza is just a single entity, and it's not. There's totally different types of pizza. Um, so the different crusts do different things. I just don't, like... So it's... The, the ones that we usually get, like, from uh, Pizza Hut and from Domino's are an American-type version, whereas the Papa John's is more of a kind of hybrid Italian-American type of pizza base. So, uh, Got yeah, Italian at some, heart, yeah. There's some, there's some uh, 
difference is there? <laughs> uh, where was I? Um, ba -ba -ba, LTN, good morning. Vice, good morning. Just buy yourself a new New Oven, people. They're brilliant. Oh. And I don't, oh, I, I don't have me. any discount codes or anything. Um, but if you wait... You can probably if, make sure that you've got space for one. Yes. Because, uh, and if not, then you can just do what I do, which is um, buy a frozen pizza. You can make them at home as well yourself, because you just need to get this malt extract, which makes the uh, dough rise you know, uh, in ovens with low temperatures. Oh, okay. Um, yes, and that works as well. Yeah, I'm, I'm a bit like, I can't bother doing all this for pizza. If you want to do it, then that's cool. Oh, God, this is <laughs> so boring. Not boring, I just like food quickly. It is quickly. The pizza only takes like 90 seconds to make. Hang on a minute. Right, you've got to make the dough. How long have you got to leave the dough for before the dough is ready? 48 hours. Right, so guys, if you want a pizza in two days, minimum. You can do it in 12 hours, to be honest. <laughs> Still, like, most people, like, last night, like, should I get a pizza? Yeah, go on. Just efficient people, there's you know, it's people just like actually uh, making plans and stuff like that. And like some people, what I'm gonna have today? Oh, frozen chips. And what? Frozen chips. Oh god. Uh, right, where was I in the chat again? Oh, they're scaring Carlos. Yeah. That is just rude. Carlos haters. That is discrimination against Carlos. Yeah. I'm going to get this as it goes across the runway, Liz. Okay. Actually, I'm going to wait for, to get that board out of the way because that is just an ugly eyesore. Uh, Jeff saying um, visited the UK from Oz last year. Flew um, the EasyJet between Gatwick and Edinburgh, and was uh, quietly surprised with the service and flight. And they are really good. I think, like if you if you read every airline, about every airline and social media, you probably think they're all abysmal. But I think when you, once you get on and you, yeah. you kind of you know chat to the crew and stuff like that, they're they're, they're awesome. I mean, yeah. e EasyJet for me are like. The nicest, on, so you know, for on average, all the, all the way through their crew, they are mm -hmm. the nicest crew. Yeah, any any airline I know. Uh, so you know, I, I always give them you know, kudos for that. Mm -hmm. uh, Davy, good morning. And uh, Gray was saying uh, we had pizza from uh, the Aldi, uh, sweet chili chicken. Oh, that's the you? Carlos ones. Uh, did you have the Carlos ones? We know there's Carlos pizzas. In we know they sell Carlos pizzas. <laughs> we need to do that. No Carlos's were harmed in the making of them. I don't know if you've got well, a black feather know. in there. You'd be like, oh, wait a minute. <laughs> <laughs> oh, gosh. Um, I tell you what. Like, sorry, guys. i told to move him back. I just think we can get a nice video out of this and it's about time we put another video up. We can talk. I'm, when oh, you right, hear, sorry. When you hear the ping that I'm going to be going. Right, well, I'll try and get back through the chat then. I wouldn't because you're about to ping now. Okay.
So enjoy this departure, everyone. Well, that light was absolutely exquisite, wasn't it? Just a bit. Take that Even in you... 144p, that was good. Oh, wow, it must be good if it's good in 144p, Liz. I hope everyone that's in 4k, or, well, to be honest, anything above 144p is... Uh... Liz doesn't know what 4k is. I haven't treated her to it yet. One day I will do. What do you mean? I'm just saying, you, you only ever see anything through 144p, don't you? I'm just pretending <laughs> I'm that I'm... saving battery power. I'm, I'm just making it out like I'm depriving you of 4K ness. To be fair, my, I did have a 4 Well, I bought a TV thing, and it was branded as 4K, except it was 4K that was 4K back in, like, 2015. <laughs> so uh, it's not full 4K. One and a half K. Yeah, exactly. 2.5K. Two, 2, 2K, I guess, isn't it? Yeah, 2K. It's 2K. I've got a 2K telly. So we have the Ryanair coming out on the taxi now towards us. It's coming back from T3. Uh, arrival. Dreamliner, TV. Something oh, do you know in, what? in that order. Sack that. Let's just get the extended departure on this one. Okay. And you prefer that, won't you, people? We've had, we, uh, old Leary's had well enough out of us today, so... Uh, it's not a Ryanair, it's a Dreamliner. I told you it's a Tui. No, there's a right now in a taxi, I just said. Oh, right. I thought you didn't know. I was talking about the arrival. No. All right. As long as you know. As long as you well, know. How far is the arrival out? Um, it's about to touch down. It's just past Hill Green. Okay. Well, I'll keep an eye out for it. <laughs> um, but, yeah, Devin, has a couple of people responding. Like, we're really lucky here in Manchester, just um, with all the spotting locations that we've got. So, I think it's a big thing here. I think... I feel like in the US it is also... Um, I can't. I, I feel like it'd be hard to compare. So obviously, we get a lot of like views from Australia and New Zealand as well. And obviously, there's other people dotted around. But we were saying, like, is it as big of a thing in other places? And so I don't really yeah, know. Yeah, because we noticed that there's some really good streams, like in uh, Belgium. You got Witter Balls, um, and he, he's been doing 4K. I think I think he's the first one, isn't he? I'm pretty sure he. I I, I remember I, I remember seeing his stream in 4K for anyone else's. Yeah. So I'm happy to be corrected on that, but as a, you know, and you know, he's, the content is good. You know, it's from a good airport. It's busy. There's some really interesting movements, mm -hmm. and he's, the, the poor guy's only knocking out a few hundred views every time. And I just don't get why YouTube's not pushing it out to more people. That's strange. This is after Prague. Okay, that is officially my worst plan of the day. That's all right. I apologise to my ancestors for that one. Your ancestors? Why are they... Um... That was awful. You come from a long line of uh, aircraft planners. No, just the ancestors in general, just for a shame oh, right. of the family name. What were you going to say? I thought you knew, like, you know, your great-great-uncle great, 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 Jeff. Great granddad was uh, filming the Wright brothers as they took their first flight. Well, he nailed it, didn't he? <laughs> He absolutely smashed that. Uh, next arrival, a Rini ATR-72 from Guernsey. Uh, we've got a, uh, a Lingus ATR or Emerald uh, ATR just crossing. I've never seen a plane cross the runway as quick in my life, to be honest. No, there's another plane coming. Whoops. That's... I saw... Mm -hmm. um... Oh, it was uh, Wayne saying, uh, Simon is Geordie in the building, watch it. <laughs> and some laughing faces. It's all right, I've got one who's like, probably put like 10 death threats out against me, so, you know, uh, <laughs> I'm so, used to getting some love from there. There you go. 
uh, local time right now is 8.30 a.m. I don't feel like we've been here two hours. I know. Uh, Andrea, good morning. Oh, I'm getting back into the chat now. I know I've, uh, I've neglected you all. You always know I come back, though. Like a cold sore, she'll always come back. <laughs> I've got that nice prop blur speed, speed on the um, on this ATR. This is my favourite prop blur speed. I don't. And if everyone wants to know what it is, because I'm so nice, it's one it's one eight hundredth of a second. Okay, just giving away the secrets there. Pans in the game there. Hope you enjoyed that. And Aisha, good morning. Cyclist, good morning. Oh, we were talking to uh, Liz's um, mum about Diablo yesterday. I actually, showed oh pictures. yeah, yeah. Because mum and dad have got a cat called Lily. Um, she's not. She's just like a. She's like a little white thing with some black splotches. But um, yeah, so I think you showed some pictures, didn't you? I certainly did. Um, but you say I just noticed you uh, reached 18k. Ah, yes. Yeah, we saw that yesterday. We did see that. Oh, thanks, mate. Uh, yeah, slowly getting there, aren't we? Yeah, well, considering we've only been doing this a few months. Uh, I mean, obviously, we got a few subscribers from doing videos and stuff, didn't we? Yeah, short, um, <laughs> shorts, on it? Yeah, shorts. And shorts. That's how you get your subscribers on YouTube these days. You know, if you do get a proportion from... Uh, you know, your live streams. It literally, if you look at the analytics, it goes shorts, lives, video. Um, but yeah, everything comes from shorts. The majority of everything, the majority of reach, impressions, subscribers, comments. <laughs> when you've got a guitar, go around on there. They all, everything comes from shorts. Oh, there's another one this morning. Oh, Where well, they were going... Oh, where you say corrections, there are a lot of corrections going on. I'm, I'm just going to link him to the comment where he's saying what you want about going corrections. I'm going to let them fight it out. Oh, well. <laughs> Could be a fight to the death, this one. I'll, I'll, I'll update the chat in regards to that in the next stream on Wednesday. I'll oh. see if they've uh, murdered one another. And uh, Mike, thanks for the update. The uh, SQ51, Singapore Airlines A35900 from Houston over Ireland, June 904. Cheers, Mike. It's about half an hour away. And uh, Travelodium, good morning to you over in uh, Adelaide. Oh, there are a lot of small birds out in the airfield today. I can see them on the uh, stream. Oh, yeah, there you go. Um, Davy with, you know, an, an even further ancestor filming the medieval jousting tournaments. Pan the horse. Oh, well, I can go one better. Oh, God. Uh, one of my ancestors was at the Circus Maximus doing the, uh, what do you call it? The, um, you know, when they were on the horses and everything, they used to go around the um, Coliseum kind of thing. Well, it's was, it was Circus Maximus, it wasn't the Coliseum. Oh, right. This is like a genuine thing. Because we were still in the jokey area, and now you're telling me you've actually, where did you find that out? Oh, my oh, no, God, no. you're, like, taking this as serious. Sorry. I'm like... Sorry, no, I, didn't, I don't know. I don't know what this is. Oh I just heard God, horse. I, I literally just heard horse. I don't know. Okay. Oh, wow. That was blonde, that. Oh I am blonde, so. Yeah, that, yeah, I know you just proved it. How beautiful, that. Look, I have a, a limited amount of knowledge in my brain. Yeah, I know. Do you know the things I do? I know things like runway times. Um, how to put plugs into um, how to put plug, batteries. How to put plugs into batteries. You nailed that, Liz, by the way, today. And how to edit a picture. Oh, that's debatable. Well, if you like a pink sky. Pink skies are better than white skies. Racist. Uh, for me, any day. Just racist. <laughs> white sky racist. Pink skies matter. Come on. 
but um yeah so anyway let's just move on from that <laughs> i've been looking at the sky now and i can't see the chat anymore because it's too I'm too, my eyes are too like light adjusted give me a moment um i and help you a poll good morning and uh paul and rosie even good morning to you both Okay, my eyes are adjusting to the screen again. This is why I don't actually I come out here all the time and I don't actually see any planes. Oh, everything's good so far. Fantastic. Uh, thank you, Mike. We've got an estimated departure time for the Emirates of 9.23. So, late. <laughs> Probably about 50 minutes away-ish. I'm just going to call it. I'm going to say the Emirates is going out in an hour. <laughs> Probably by the time it actually pushes back, comes out. It'll be before that. I think I'm going to, I'm going to, I'm going to throw it out there. I'm, feel, I'm feeling positive today. This, this morning, it's quite a weird one, the morning one, isn't it? They, they're very, very good on the morning one. It's the afternoon one where they just like go. Yeah, there's a lot of things that happen. And uh, next arrival will be a SAS A320 Neo, old delivery, I'm afraid. Oh. Uh, Stockholm. Why are you mugging us off like that? We want new livery in this light. Uh, behind that, we've got a British Airways A321 coming in from London Heathrow. Excellent. I look forward to that. And the louder is now entering the runway. I am going to record this one because I do like this livery. Yep. This is uh, going back to Vienna. Excellent. It's a good looking aircraft, I think you'll all agree. Let us know what you think about this uh, later in the chat. Yeah. Sort me out. <laughs> Put a little bit with that. Um, you'll do good. you make um, money. Well, was... Ah, uh, my thing's gone back. So, here's the sass Liz was on about a minute ago. Just realised right. it's still recording. Uh, Michael, good morning to you in South Carolina. Oh, wow. We do have a Logan Air now. This uh, good looking Embraer. Just about to taxi onto the road. Uh, Chris saying, uh, great stream this morning. Uh, my best prop blur on stills was a shot at 180th handheld. I ain't doing prop. I, to be honest, I don't really take pictures of props anyway because uh, you may have gathered that I'm not really a big fan of prop planes. So I'm not into this whole, oh, prop blur, blah, blah, blah. I'm just, I can't be bothered, so... I can't, I think, and every time I've kind of tried, I've kind of just not nailed it because it's just not my thing, so I've not practised it because, like with anything, you just have to practise to actually be good at something, so. I'll just stick to my pink skies. I'm happy then. And, uh, oh, we've got, some, we've got some Diablo history here going oh. on. Oh. All right, so, uh, so you know. Don't, don't tell me Diablo was in, like, the pharaoh cat from, like, Anthony and Cleopatra. <laughs> like, one of his ancestors. <laughs> No, he said, uh, I've mentioned this before, uh, Diablo's pedigree name is No Limit of Sweet Sun Tigers. Wow, that's all I'm going to say to that one. <laughs> Just Diablo for short. I mean, it must be a right sod to put in a card. I was born in Germany. Oh, okay. Right, good morning. There 
very nice. And we do have the BA now just about to touch down. So I'm just going to pan like a madman. Uh, Mr. Pingu, good morning. Yeah, great to have Hope you in the well chat, mate. Today. Dash Rankenboy, good morning to you as well. Yeah, we hope you're all enjoying this beautiful morning here at Manchester Airport. It really is sublime. It's just... Uh... Well, I definitely want to get, get off and uh, have a view of the RVP there. It's like going, I want to make this turn. Oh, well, we've got a Ryanair 737 coming out. That's going to be going to Cologne. Uh, we've also got a 2E 737 MAX 8. That's going to be going to Hagada. We've um, got a Jet 2 737 going to Rome. That tail, I was just always thinks it does look good in any light. One thing BA do is, like, I think the tail looks gorgeous. Yeah. Uh, we've also got the uh, Swiss A220 on the way back to Zurich. Oh, that was a quick turnaround. And then, no that? messing. No messing, Swiss. They right, they literally land, everyone's up, like, right, we've got enough chocolate. Oh, I'll tell you what, yesterday was great because we had there, where we were, do you know where we were down at um, the other end? Yeah. We had so many people come over to us and like chat to us, which was really great. Uh, I really enjoyed that. So, you know, if you're ever around and you're, uh, you're near us and stuff like that, feel free to come over and have a chat with us. We, uh, we love that. Yeah, absolutely. Just say we don't bite. Well, not to everyone. <laughs> So I'm just trying to catch up with the chat. And uh, Andrew, not a problem. Thank you for stopping in today. Hope you have a lovely day. Uh, James saying a light louder in general, yeah, craft and the livery. Yeah. They are good, I, li I like them. I haven't flown with them, I really want to. You have, haven't you? Memory serves me right, but the original no. louder. The oh, OG. the original. Yeah, you flew with the oh. OG. <laughs> oh, if I went on louder now, it would be a serious uh, downgrade uh, in Ooh. comparison. Ow. Well, it would, wouldn't it? Would it? Yeah. Uh, well, for a start, you used to get like a proper meal. Um, so you can ride it, you just have to pay for it. Oh no, I'm not talking a panini. I'm talking, so I used to fly Manchester to Vienna. Um, it was usually on a... Oh, what were they on? Is it Embraer's or something? I think it was Embraer's. Sure, actually, was it that? There were small planes anyway. Um, but you used to get, I remember the plates, um, they were they formed a triangular shape. Oh, yeah, so you'd have like your main um, kind of meal in like the bottom kind of section of the triangle. It was usually like a schnitzel, and then in the top bit of the triangle, you'd have your potato salad, and then you'd have another little triangular plate for your pudding. I remember like one time having it, it was like a chocolate mousse, it was so nice, it was like generally one of the nicest things I've ever eaten. Um, you get like your fresh juice. This was all in like proper glasses, um, proper cutlery, and this was just like economy. Um, just you know, like short couple hour flight. Um, obviously, this was like the mid to late nineties. Yeah. Um, and no. yeah, it all it all went downhill. No, no, but like in fairness to Ryanair, they do 
proper meals on board, don't they? You just yeah, pay for them. Like, whereas these get more based around the quick sandwiches kind of thing. Yeah. They, they, they really nail those. So, it's, you know, it's different horses for courses, isn't it? So, Jet 2 is off to Rome. Oh, I don't mind we go to Rome today. I know. Not into Athens today. No, definitely want to go to Rome. Yeah, Rome's my, my favourite city in the world, you know that, so yeah. uh, I, I, I've never going there. Right, I'm going to get this one, Liz. Cool. Uh, well, as you say, yeah, Mike is saying um, light on the south side is absolutely beautiful. It certainly is, mate. It's uh, it's decent today. I won't lie. It's uh, yeah. you take advantage of it. I thought there'd be more people out for this. I won't lie. Yeah. Like this, I think oh, you'll agree with Mike Clear. He said, uh, "Message to our viewers from the USA: uh, Sleep is overrated. Sleep is overrated. <laughs> so uh, yeah." I like getting all my stuff done at like four in the morning. There you go. It's, uh, it's the future. The thing is, it's like you get it done, and there's like there's, you don't get any hassle if you know what I mean. You know, like people messaging you and stuff yeah. like that. I don't. I, I'm gonna go at you there, Liz. <laughs> but I just mean it's like I know that if I start doing stuff, I can do it for a few hours without any interruptions, yeah, yeah. and it just it it helps. I'm going to pan the engine on this Ryanair. All right. Just because I can. Okay, I'm back where I was. Um, James, see you later. Thank you for stopping by and watching today. Hope you've uh, had a good show. Just wait a I've just seen something. I just need to check. Oh, is that the blueger? Oh, it's the blueger on the, uh, what do you call it, on the uh, base leg going into Warden. I just saw it behind the, um, is it a blueger XL just like to Hang the, on. well, at the end of the runway? Hang on. In that direction. I think I've got it in frame now. It looks like it. I just saw this big white blob as the um, <laughs> that plane was taking off. I love the big white blob. Yeah, sorry. I think you know where I'm coming from on, in regards of that. Um, this is only a right. It is. It's the XL. Yeah, I thought... I just saw something. I was like going, that's really low. And what the yeah. hell is it doing? But, going um, in frame to lose. Oh, excellent. Well, at it's least we've got... Chester, a Chester just because it annoys yeah. everyone how to say... Warden. Warden, Warden. Yeah, Harden, 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 but... whatever you want to call it. It's Chester. Let's just do that and then we don't have to argue about it. Well, I'm going to stay on this and then I'll get the Ryan as it pans through the shot. Okay. It's a bit different, isn't it? Tell you what, people, you don't get that then on other channels. Yeah. Uh, Tom's good morning to you. Rob, good morning. Uh, who else have we got? Ian, good morning. Super 111, good morning. Um, oh, I'm glad uh, glad you're enjoying the picture. Um, it's like we were saying yesterday, a lot of it is... A lot of the light helps the light. so much. Uh, you get some good light, yeah, you're winning. Um, it just accentuates everything, doesn't it? But, uh, yeah, yeah. yeah, light and atm atmospherics are the best locations, timing. Well, we always, that's why we say we do the early mornings, because that's when the best planes are. Yes, totally. 
And, uh, oh, Matt, uh, Mrs. C on board 3A. Do you know what? I was just about to get asked for an update because I saw that yeah. plane land before. Yeah, like... so window slash the only seat on your side, uh, but probably behind the engine, second window back from the door. Just get to get a mobile phone on. Yeah. <laughs> so the light on a mobile phone, put that on, we'll see that. Absolutely. Uh, I noticed, I, I can't remember if I've passed that comment or not. What has missed the... Um... No, oh, he's had a mayor, hasn't he? He did. He <laughs> his, son, his, his kids decided to support Everton. His team got beat, and now he's missed the Etihad and the, and the new livery. Oh, mate. Oh. <laughs> oh mate, I, I'm, 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 I'm sending you virtual hugs and stuff like that. Does that help? I don't know if it does. Probably won't. Oh, um, I should say, I can't put myself away from uh, this live stream, but these drains won't install themselves into the fields this morning. Oh, well, uh, so thank you, guys, you for Have being a uh, great day, guys. Uh, weather here in Cumbria is so so. Well, have a great day, Ashton. Okay, I was preparing for uh, Matt's wife's departure on that one. I, I went on the Logan Air on the panel there on we that. Go. But the light is getting hard to uh, see this, it's, uh, it's getting that strong. Dead which dead. means we're going to get warmed up, but it's going to make panning yeah. a little bit more difficult. Uh, Debbie, good morning. We got te- uh, two e seven six coming out on the uh, yeah from the back. <laughs> yeah, uh, I'm sorry, I'm just I'm catching up with the comments. So yeah, we don't buy it. I bite my own tongue though. <laughs> what, literally or metaphorically? <laughs> both. Okay. Trust me, both. <laughs> okay. Oh. Yeah, the irony of that one is uh, special. Oh wow! <laughs> just a bit. Um. I think that um, catching that bluger makes up for the moon stuff. Yeah, that's fair enough. Um, <laughs> Tubbs video is asking how uh, how do we get up so early to stream? Don't know. No, I don't. We just kind of just. <laughs> it's do the it. Apple alarm clock. If it wasn't, we wouldn't. I, mean, get I didn't up. even go. I just woke up like bing, like seven minutes past five this morning. Oh, is Bright it, eyed, bushy tailed. Is it, is it eight o'clock in the morning? I know it was seven. You said, but uh, I just have to exaggerate everything. <laughs> Oh, thanks, Liz. I just had a heart attack. Yeah, sorry. Uh, Sparky, good morning. Um, will you be with you for about an hour? Just finished the school run. Uh, another cold one today. It is cold. And uh, sorry, I know I'm kind of going up the chat now rather than down because YouTube's annoying. Uh, Money being started with the five gifted memberships. Oh, Thank wow. you so, so much. Uh, they've gone to Wayne, John... DMU, um, MG King, and uh, Dr. Brownlow. So, welcome, welcome. And thank you so much for your kind donation. Yeah, it's amazing. Uh, I'm going to keep moving on with uh, John. Good morning. Uh, oh, I'm, I'm caught up. I'm caught up. I'm caught up where I was. Uh, Get in there, Liz. I'm not caught up with the chat. I'm just caught up from where I was. Oh, okay. That was an anticlimax. <laughs> you got too excited there. I was like, oh, she must have got to the bottom of the chat by now. <sighs> Look. I think we can we can all appreciate that. Yes, I may be behind at times, but you get that. I get that. I go through the chat. I I always say if I've missed anything, just let me know if it's important. Um, if it's anything really important, like I'm on a plane about to take off and I miss that, then I I know one of the mods usually see it and they message me. So it's all good. We've got a good system. We're on it. We're on it like a car bonnet. <laughs> And uh, George, good morning to you. Uh, yeah, Matt said, I told her to put the phone torch on. Uh, she pried with a laughing emoji. Interpret that how you like. I suppose to a non like aviation person, I guess it could be a bit strange. If but... she doesn't, I'm just going to stop the pan. Oh! Oh! No laughing emojis now. <laughs> <laughs> I just raised the bar. I'll just go, I'm just got a Heathrow instead. Um, oh, well, I hope you have a good time in Belfast. Oh, yeah, he is going so, to. Doing a little stream from there. Jeez, I just. Yeah. Sorry, I've got a feather. I'm just looking feather going everywhere. Um, Your murdering jacket, you mean? I remember when you said it was ethical to me. I no, that. it's such a thing, right? No, no, no. Look, would the vegans like it? No, it's not a vegan jacket. 
Um, oh, well, it's, uh, it's got... Um, Would the geese like it? It's got goose down in it, right. Would the geese like it? It's ethical in the... I don't... I can't remember what the ethics are in it. Like, <laughs> so, it's ethical, but I no, can't tell you why it's ethical. Because there was a massive uproar for years ago. You know, when, like, especially when it I became really I think it's really how popular. they were farmed, wasn't yeah, it? Yeah, so Canada Goose, those jackets that everyone loves, um, they would like they would live pluck geese because the thing is when you live this sounds awful but when you do that obviously the down comes back but they were absolutely done for it so they're all ethically done now um so i think it's if the the animal's been used to something else and the down's taken from that now obviously there's still the farming issue you know there's, there's a whole kind of should it be done or not kind of thing but it is what it is um, I, I, I look I'm, I'm not lucky i'm just saying i just think it's really hilarious that they can call yeah, murdering an animal and the goal is like, I'm not yeah. sure about that. that one's not going to cut well with me, I've got to be honest. No. Good oh, jacket, well. though. Yeah, this one, I think, has seen better days, I won't lie. I feel like I've been wearing it for about two years straight. Um, All right, let's, we're going to get this 7-6. Seven, seven, yeah. Sorry about that. It got a bit bumpy there. I'm just uh, grabbing my mic in my hand. know that um, one of these went to Salzburg this weekend and they, the local spotting community went mental over it. <laughs> like lost their minds kind oh, of. Oh, we can still talk then. Sorry? Can no, no, talk- I'm about oh. to press it. Oh, right, okay, sorry. So I was just asking you to get your mic off. Or... I think it's very apt that that plane's called Sunshine. Yep, uh, it was going to Boa Vista. Or is going to Boa Vista, should I say. And we got the... I just, rea- just realised I panned that at 600 mil. <laughs> just like, stupid sigh. Oh, well. Um, Singapore Airlines is over the north of Manchester. Excellent. Look forward Ooh. to uh, getting that. Keep an eye on that one. Oh, I can see it. Oh, wow. There we go. Watch this. Let's let's just grab that A three eighty tail. And go up. And uh, James, good morning to you. There's Singapore. Just coming round the back now. Fantastic. That's coming in from Houston. Uh, and James watching from the United States. Saying, "Got up early to see it. Love it. Wow, that's amazing. That is uh, really quite early over there. I think it's amazing that you can pick these planes up." And that detail from here, I mean, that's probably one of the big advantages that we have with moving, upgrading to 4K. What I can tell you is my eyes are not 4K. <laughs> your, your eyes aren't even not K. Do you know what? I know, I can't even, I know I'm in a low resolution to save my phone battery, but I can't even see it on the screen because my eyes, are, there's no contrast. So I hope you can all see and enjoy that and are not like me. It's just, there. Just, 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 just reassure Liz that the Singapore was there and I'm just not making it up for it. <laughs> so it's just an imaginary place. Yeah, just to play mind tricks with her. Liz, I'm messing with your head.
and um, money being slower. Just like a comment, actually. Like, um, I'm sorry to hear about your dad's health, and uh, we send you our love. And I'm glad that watching some planes can just take your mind off your mind off things a little bit. Yeah. And, uh, it's weird. I mean, Joe was talking to us about that yesterday as well. Like, just watching planes, it is really... It's, like, a bit therapeutic, especially if you're going through some stuff. It's calming, isn't it's it? It's calming. I do find that. It, like I say, so there's, there's times and, uh, you know, I, where I, like, I watch, you know, the other streams and stuff like that, and I, I won't actually watch it. I'll just have it on in the background. Yeah. Um, and I'll just listen to you know the engines and stuff like that, which is, is, I, I just and it just helps me get along. And it's not something that I'm just going to put my head up to watch every you mm-hmm. know every second and stop me doing stuff. So yeah, I, I find it really good. So I'm just looking over at the uh, runway visitors park, and uh, there's quite a few people out there. Uh, there's a few people on the boxes I can see. They're looking at the phones. They're definitely looking at the phones. I can tell you that. That's what um, everybody does. Yeah, like going. Is there, where's the Singapore? Is it coming in? It's uh, on finals now. Yeah. Well, I say finals, it's up near Hyde. But yeah, it's still like finals. Hyde or something. It'll be Hyde, won't it? Yeah. Uh, so Matt's put uh, Dornier about to push. Uh, only got an MLAT transponder, so probably on F24 uh, until uh, Right, Matt, I'm, do- I'm doing all the checks for you now just to check that we're good to go. All right, we've got half battery in the mics. That's good. <sighs> oh, Matt, as he said as well, he said it was a bit late for your threat. She'd already turned the phone off. <laughs> oh, what? <laughs> She's not one of them. We like, <laughs> turns the phone off like when they tell you. <laughs> Do that right at the end. Uh, Mike, thanks for stopping by today. Have a good day. Cheers, Mike. See you in a bit. I, I am actually up to date the chat now. Uh, Neil, good morning. Oh, um, wait a minute, Liz. I'm just going to come over. Yeah. Well done, Liz. Pat on the back there. She's up to date with the chef. <laughs> I'm having a bit of a coffee because I'm so cold. Sm- I do wonder. I don't know if you can hear it in my voice. Like, thank you. Um, oh, the cold has got to me. It does. It but, does. you know. Like I say, when we got here. It, it was like, It was all right. It was all right. It's, it's when the sun comes up. But all we're wanting now is, and we're starting to get it, is the, the, the sun is behind us and coming through the trees. So that'll warm you up. Yeah, that's nice. I'll take that. Yeah, exactly. And we can just watch the uh, A380 being bathed in some gorgeous early morning light at the moment. You know, we complain about the cold at the moment, but we'll be complaining about the heat haze double quick. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> if we have another summer like we did last year, but like, it's too hot. I'll still take that, though. No, right? I'll take Do you know what? Hull Bay down at the bottom. I've then. always been more of a, a warmer person. I prefer being warm than cold. I hate being cold. Um, however, I feel like this past winter because we've been out so much sorry Liz there's a helicopter there is a helicopter I'm just trying to pick it up and see what um, height I'm just that. like I'm going to be so grateful for the warm weather or just just something that's not cold right is that no, there is um, a helicopter coming in I think I'm not sure what it's intentions are if it's just going to cross the airfield I'll keep an eye on that could be something cool I didn't see anything on the inbounds for it, but you never know. Uh, Tubbs, it's the, uh, what's the monarch playing at the RVP? DC, isn't it? Yeah, it's a DC something. Oh, I didn't even notice this is the uh, little bit at the end of the runway. I'm recording this, because this is, this is going to be up like an absolute rocket. Harrison will touch himself inappropriately when he sees this 4K. <laughs> and we've got to turn and burn.
uh, Ali Cat, good morning. James good Watson, good morning. We're in a sunny Leeds. Go. Good time in this. <coughs> Sorry, don't die. Try not to. <coughs> Thanks. I appreciate that. <coughs> I haven't got the mic. I'm not recording this one. You're all right. I was just moving the mic so people don't have to hear me coughing. Okay, oh, that's double bonus. Isn't kind it? like that. So nice that you don't like cough on everyone like you did with those two old men in uh, the premier, premier that thing. sounds really weird she killed, she killed two old men I d- <laughs> you're making me sound awful she defo killed him all of those beautiful engines so I just saw that helicopter and it's just got flown over the airfield. And, uh, David, good morning. I said uh, just joined today. Uh, I'm enjoying looking at it from uh, uh, from the outside. And I said that I've flown from Manchester a couple of times, but not for a long time. Well, welcome. Yes, absolutely. Welcome to the channel. And we uh... Obviously, we catch Manchester on a very nice day today. Exactly. Uh, cheers Sparky there saying uh, Emirates 8380 currently scheduled for the uh, 940 departure I was just about to say I think it might be earlier what time are we on now? 8 minutes past 9 oh no we've still got the rear uh, cargo hatch yeah open, so but probably you are looking about maybe half an hour or so no I think it think? might be might be a bit quicker I might be a bit quicker because they're, I think they're there and I think they're probably about to close up in the next okay. five, 10 minutes well we'll keep our fingers crossed the, the, look, the, the staff there are looking like they're not doing much that's what I will say so. oh well so they've done most of the work I, I, yeah they've, they've, worked, they've worked hard and now they're uh, just waiting back. It's backing it off because you've got to remember as well. It has to the plane has to be de-iced, so that does yes, add time onto it as well. It does. So I did check as well, though. Uh, we've actually got just under two hours for the next one to arrive. It's going in at about eleven. Oh, that's cool. And JS spotting. Good morning. Yes, mate. Um, oh, it's DC ten, the Monarch. Yes. Reg DMCA, GDMCA. Sorry. EJ8320 Neo going to Arecife. That's up nice and early. Oh, BA is coming down another taxiway. Come on, let him be this one. Let it be my one. Got uh, Ryan Air about to touch down. Don't care. Okay. BA. It's another A320, it's a louder one. Again, uh, I but get from that, Zagreb. but it's, uh, this is a BA. And if it comes down. Not I've, this taxiway, the one after. It'll be epic. I called this people. He's never been. He's never normally that excited about British Airways. <laughs> yeah. Okay, I'm going to record this, Liz. Okay. Someone's trying to make him wave on the flight deck and it ain't working. <laughs> Oops. Good try, though. We, we look. God we, we got a British Airways wave once, didn't we? We certainly did. I uh, posted that reel up. We did. Oh, sorry. Matt's wife is, Matt's wife is making a... Uh, 
an entrance. There she is. Mrs. C. Mrs. C. In, she might not be in the chat, but she's there on that plane. And, uh, Lottie, good morning. I've actually got the shakes. I'm nervous. Oh, wow. Robert, good morning. Um... Mark, get that, get that TV, get that iPad. I don't care what you got. Get it on 4K. This is what you came here for. <laughs> this is why we're not at Heathrow. <laughs> oh no, to be honest, I won't go there anyway. <laughs> no, true, we won't. <laughs> okay. I, I, I definitely saw her. Uh, I didn't. <laughs> but she definitely sat behind the engine. Oh, sorry, everyone. PA is coming on. Here we go. Back in the room. I was basically told to shut up for ages there with all the recording going on. I, I, I basically just like went, zip it. <laughs> like zippy off rainbow there. Anyway. Uh, da, 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 da. Where was I? I hope Matt like, enjoyed that. If he didn't. <laughs> can I do? Let's now go to Heathrow. Ooh. So I've got the KLM now. Uh, let's taxi away. Uh, sorry, on the runway, not taxiway. Get it right, babe. Hi, it's going back to Amsterdam. Uh, really, okay, good morning. Herbert, good morning. Um, good point. Why does the uh, crew aren't allowed to have any fun anymore? So I'm all waving. So, uh. Oh, well, I will get Wadders waving on a plane one day. <laughs> one day, one day. Um. And an Etihad in the old loop. Yeah. <laughs> has, to, has to be that. Those series of events put yeah. together. Uh, Daz, good morning. Uh, cheers, uh. 
But uh, Sparky there with a the comment saying the close-ups as they taxi departure are fantastic. Oh, uh, this thank is you. why the streams are great at this point you're up to until 10.30. Or is it 10.30? The switch pops. I don't even remember that A320 coming in. No. The Air Lingus one. Oh, well, I assume it's going back to Dublin. Yeah. Uh, Matt said, Torch, she didn't let me down. Paula said she saw it too. Oh, you can see. Oh, that's awesome. That's yeah, brilliant. said, uh, thanks, Simon and Liz. Uh, <laughs> party's at my place. <laughs> Unless my in laws are all still watching. <laughs> no party, mate. <laughs> oh, not a problem. I'm glad we caught her this time. I know she has a lovely flight and trip. Hey, well, it's busy at the moment. Yeah. Uh, Erica, good morning. Oh, I think I'm going to do... Uh, I'm going to get some footage of my Ryanair homies. You do that. Try and come by good morning. I think this is the great thing about these the 4k things you can literally look into the pilot's eye from here now yep so I mean, this is a uh, zoomed in at 600 mil in 4k boom it's right now 737 it's going to be going to barcelona and as we say we were the original 4k streamers here at manchester and at heathrow so but sass in the uh new livery about to touch down oh, oh. so an a320 neo from copenhagen i want to get that but the ryanair is telling me i have to get that you had the. I thought we were going to get a turn and burn off them, but they disappointed us. We did. Uh, Graham, good morning to you. Uh, just let you know, I've uh, uh, got brought a uh, domestic membership to this brilliant channel. Well, we're very happy to have you as a member. We love our members. We love everyone who watches. You're all amazing. Yes, you are. We really like do. we were saying before, all we'll ever ask you to do is like, subscribe. Anything else is just a Anything mega bonus. Anything else is such a bonus. Same, we, you know, it just we love helps you all. Do regardless. tricks and stuff like that and come down here more often. Like, exactly. So, you know, it just helps to build the channel. And we understand that, like, in these times of hardship, it's not easily available to everyone. Right? So, Absolutely. if you can do it, that's amazing. If not, don't worry about it. Just enjoy the stream and me moaning. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> exactly. That's what it's all about. Okay, Emirates is pushing. I'm going to stay in this right now. Yeah, that's cool. I'm going to get this one, Liz. Uh, yes, Matthew, we will still be here at 10.30. Well, we certainly will. Uh, so, Tish, good afternoon to you. Still morning here at Manchester, 20 past nine in the morning. It's cold. It's sunny, though, so... Uh, 
Um, okay, cool. So uh, we've got some uh, family on the Jet 2 to Grand Canaria at half ten. Okay. Also, well, hopefully they get out on this runway still. Well, not with the icing. Sorry. I'd... Okay. I just got a bit of very bad news on that one. That's not going to happen. Well, we'll still get a great. Uh, we'll get them. We'll get a great clip of them. Exactly. They'll get a nice rotation past the tower shot. Hopefully. Mm. Well, there you go. So it's uh, it's all good, just slightly different. Exactly. Um, because yeah, obviously they do uh, switch to single runway ops at about ten thirty. Yep. As we say, we do love seeing the Emirates on here. It's uh, it's the one that I know everyone anticipates the most. Yeah, so we've had a Ryanair from Dublin just touched down. Obviously, we do have the... Uh, oh, yeah, there's an aeroplane. <laughs> an aeroplane. Say, it's really hard to concentrate on the runway one when you know you've got all the stuff on runway two. Yeah. But yeah, so we've got the uh, Emirates 380, it's the EK22 going back to Dubai. That is uh, en route to us over here. Um, also, that Swiss was obviously he's left his thingy on, hasn't he? Um, so he's on the taxi now. He's on the taxi now. I just realised that when I saw it, I was like, hang on a minute, didn't I mention the Swiss? About like 20 minutes ago. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> but uh, the Swiss AT20 going back to Zurich is on the move. Excellent. I'll actually show you this Swiss now, as it is now coming out towards us. So I should get some Pratt & Whitney love from this baby. And uh, that little um, other private jet from uh, Teterborough yes. is not far away now. It's just passing Bolton. Okay. So uh, I'm trying to see if I can just spot it in the sky. It's, it's so clear today. <laughs> tiny can... little plane. I, I, I tell you what, I think you probably just about get it. Oh, wow. That's impressive. Honestly, because that uh, Singapore looked quite big in the frame, you know, when I was uh, doing it before. Uh, I can't see it though, but I thought you might be able to. Oh, this light just is sublime. It's so nice, isn't it? I hope it's like this on Wednesday. I, I don't think it is. <laughs> Right. Yeah, things change, things change. But... No, because this was, today was supposed to have been cloudy as Oh, hell. was it? Oh, yeah, well, they, they, they've been putting this cloudy forecast out, but then it's actually not too bad when you go out. Okay. So, well, uh, well, we'll find out on Wednesday, I guess. Yeah, um, nice to uh, do some really, really good rotation shots. Yeah, absolutely. Uh, Taylor, good morning. And, uh, yeah, it, it is, it's, a bit, it's a bit cold today. Um, you called that right. Hashtag nippy. Yeah. So, you know, thanks for keeping us company this morning. Our pleasure. Oh, no. So, so Jenny's saying, um, loving watching the stream. Currently having my old fireplace removed. So the sound of planes is a nice in-between the banging. <laughs> I bet it is. <laughs> Absolutely. Does look good this E220, doesn't it? I must say the E2 does it for me though more. I'm yeah. a big E2 fan. What, what's your take on it? Which one would you prefer to go on? And I'm not talking about like airline specific. I mean actual. Just so I want to go on the A220, okay. but I do love Embraers, so yeah. it's a tough call. It's a tough it call. Certainly is. Right, I will get this one, but I'm not going to get the taxi on. I'm just going to get. Actually, I will do.
um, yeah, so uh, Mr. Pingo, the staircase is on board um, between the upper and lower decks. We also have the Arini ATR now. It's about to depart. Uh, Eric is saying, uh, missing the beautiful journey to the future livery. Uh, it's been at least two days since the last saw it in Manchester. <laughs> yeah, I mean, to be fair, they, went through, they go through phases of sending these things in, don't they? They do, teams? and then we go through this barren phase where we have nothing and everyone complains. I know. Like, I know I'm, I'm bad for it. I'm like, when are they going to be sending the next special in? Yeah, like, Steve, so like, oh, just playing them routes, playing them, nothing, nothing exciting. Yeah. Oh, Hannah Monaghan in the chat for good old Lancaster. Lancaster massive. <laughs> To be honest, I'm I'm a bit behind. I don't know if you're still watching. I'll just say, Hannah, congratulations on the uh, on your new house. Yeah. Big step. Exciting. Really is. Can't wait for the housewarming. Yeah, that's what we're there for. Aren't yeah. We? <laughs> Morning, Stephen, in a, a sunny Italy, which I'm sure is going to make Simon very jealous. I want to go to Italy. <laughs> I'll go to Italy, Italy today. All right, book a flight then. Do you want to go to Italy, Liz? I do want to go. I, well, you always go on about it with such high regard. I've only been to Venice and like a bit around the Alps, a bit right at the top. I'll have to sort that out then, won't I? You will. Uh, Paul, good morning to you over in Thailand. Right. I think we'll have a coffee. I'm going to have a coffee. I'm going to have a coffee after the A380 goes. That's fine, I'm going to have a coffee before it goes. Oh, that's all right for some, isn't it, really? caught with the chat probably go back in a minute and be like oh, 55 yeah. messages please just absolutely spam the chat no, please okay, don't. create emotes and all that kind of rubbish <laughs> <laughs> that's what I'm here for okay so we've got the jet 2 coming towards us Go and play Jess Gunn in your heads and stuff like that. <laughs> so I'm not ready for this. Well, I, I hold my hand. Do you know, I only associate the Jess Gunn song with the holiday's livery. So do you know, like if I just oh, have really? the dot, dot com livery, I don't really associate oh, it with okay. it. It's always the holiday livery. Well, this is going to Antalya. Awesome. That is a proper holiday destination, I will say. You can imagine people coming off and trying to get those reels, can't you? Do you know, like with the holding hands. Oh, God. I bet I want to. I'm going to go on that sound later on uh, social medias and see uh, how many people have got checked in the background or in the video. Oh yeah. Oh come on, send the A380 down, Victor Alpha. Just for a laugh, just for me. I've been such a good boy today. Uh, Herbert, uh, yeah. So Simon actually uh, gave away his. Uh, Prop blur in secret before, didn't they? It has to be done. It's a sharing community, isn't it? I can't remember what it was now. The uh, prop speed. Oh, yeah, that was and That it. was, like, just getting that nice, the cuts on it. Yeah. So, yeah, uh, but, yeah, Herbert is uh, just slightly different. And, uh, Taylor saying, uh, Italy's lovely Florence is my favourite. Florence is Okay. Uh, I love going up uh, up the Piazza di, uh, di Michangelo. Um, it's beautiful. This view of the city over there is just sublime. I've done some cityscape shots from up there. It's, it's okay. Um, I don't know. Like, for me, it's, Rome's amazing. Um, Cinque Terre mm -hmm. is just stunning. It's one of my favourite... But I can really relax there. It's one of the few places I can relax. Wow. Which, for me, is a biggie. It is. 
And uh, Wynn, good morning to you. Also in Lancaster. Got all the Lancaster code in the chat right Lancaster now. Lancaster Massive. I think we're going to have to do a Lancaster uh, emote. <laughs> okay, I'm going to concentrate on the A380. I'm sorry, Jet2. Does anyone... <laughs> Does anyone object? Is there anyone, like, know anyone on board this Jet2? If so, I'll jump back on it. But if not, I'm not doing it. <laughs> all right, William, good morning to you. Uh, how many coffees do you drink? Well, to be fair, in this flask, there's like three decent sized cups of coffee. Yeah. Um, so, on a normal day, I'll have two cups of coffee, maybe three if I've got up early. You need it, to be honest, because the one thing that happens, I, I noticed that during the live stream, is that you, your energy does pick up and go down. It does, you especially know. the colder you get. Exactly. Yeah, yeah. I re you really feel you have it. these peaks and troughs, so it, it, it can help you just like, get through those difficult times during the stream. Um, so, I love coffee. <laughs> yeah, it's... Uh... That's why we have a coffee emote. Exactly. We do. Okay, I'm going to guess that this jet... Oh, there's that one from Teterborough. Oh, okay, yeah. Harrison, okay. if you weren't on a plane, you'd probably like this, but tough, <laughs> you're on a plane, so don't care. There we go. Back to the uh, to the action here. I think this jet 2 is going to go in a minute. I yeah. just think it was waiting for that to land. Uh, Ian Brown saying, uh, Mama from Italy, uh, Dad from Sheffield. <laughs> something happening to on departures here that I'm missing why sometimes if there's something happening down there they won't have the planes take off so do you know oh, so right. like down the opposite end I was going to uh, say we've not got in like the airspace down there we've not got dodgy centres we need to reset again have we no 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 it's, uh, it's just something that happens uh, like say so sometimes when we have uh, departures from Liverpool mm -hmm. uh, on certain ops it, that, that can stop us uh, stop yeah. our planes going out for a short while okay so that might be happening i don't know that's the answer but i'm just i'm just looking to see if i can see anything down there okay well sarah's saying that coffee hates me found out two weeks ago uh done lots of cycling and coffee stops and the headaches and palpitations are next level uh, ah. not even uh, strong coffee back to ti go you've got as long as you find something that you enjoy that's that's the main thing but yeah if it's if it's causing you those kind of symptoms then yeah definitely that, that's, that's just a sign that you shouldn't have it it's like me with alcohol, I have. <laughs> no, I exactly. There's like some symptoms that I don't particularly like with it, especially if I get a bit older, but it, you, you know, they just don't have it or I'll just, just deal, deal with, with it. it. No, I just deal with it. Oh, Craig, have we still not brought any food for Tickety Boo the Robin? I think he's all right. <laughs> the, the Robin's good. The Robin's good. He looks fat. I think it's because he's been eating. Simon's stuff hasn't he I'm sure didn't he have si it's like one of Simon's Simon's sandwiches. been stuff Simon Lowe's been stuffing him what a legend <laughs> just like going out there going I'm going to feed this bird <laughs> deal Simon he's great <sighs> I'm sure someone said in one, like, one of our like streams last week or something that they probably like took some of his food no he definitely gives him some of his sandwiches I know, I know that oh, I, okay. I, I, and I think he brings him some stuff out now specifically when he's at this point right I'm not going to concentrate on this jet too as I say because I don't care Be there saying it.
the two he's just popped in right in front of us Sorry that, was, that. that was rude Then. Um, no, sorry, what I, was I won't saying. lie, I didn't even see that. <laughs> yeah, no, that was well stealth. I did, um, I yeah, no, just... Andy was saying sometimes as well, it is the Liverpool traffic that can uh, hold up departures. Yeah. All, I, all I did is hear it, and I just went, I just looked over at Liz and just went... <laughs> it was one of those, like, sweary looks, you know, that you yeah. have. Uh, Alan, good morning to you. Brian, good morning. Good morning, everyone, and I hope you're getting ready for this epic A380 departure. Yeah. And uh, it should be good, because this light is absolutely stunning at the moment. Don't think we uh, don't think we know who's flying today, do we? I think uh, James has been in uh, New Zealand, hasn't he? And he has. Flew back to Melbourne yesterday or the day before. Well, I'm sure you'll agree with me. That was, as always, epic. It was. And uh, if you want more A380 action, the next one uh, is due at 11.01. It's about one hour and 20 minutes away. And Uh, we will be here for that. We will be here. So, you know, either stick around or if you have work and things to do. That's when you need to come back by 11 o'clock. Exactly. And what we're going to do is we're going to do an extended departure on this one. Uh, yeah, let's go for it. Oh, he's just did a little wing wave there. A little cheeky wing wave. <laughs> uh, which is always nice to see. But um, yeah, we'll get the extended departure on it and uh, we'll get it coming round the back. As I say, Ryanair's just landed, but come on. I, mean, I think you'd rather have this. And this is why a lot of people uh, turn up for in the chat. I don't blame you because it really is... A unique perspective you get here at Manchester. Yeah. This close up. And the roar from that, I was looking at, when I was doing the pan, I was looking at the numbers in regards of, you know, the sound. And it was peaking big time. Which is quite cool to see, to be honest. Yeah, it is, definitely. Then I'll get a cup of coffee after that. Probably I haven't finished ch- mine yet. And then change the microphones over. God, it's all go here then, isn't it? Oh, it is. And then we're prepared for the next bit of the show, where so... Uh, Jim, good morning to you. So I hope we all... uh, Well, I can see all the awesomes. Look at that. Epic. Yeah, it really was, wasn't it? It's... uh, It just... The thing is, it just creates so much drama. And I think, you know, when you've got so many people coming in there and just, like, showing some love to it, it really helps... I just imagine what it'd be like if we started, you know, if we did our streaming when we had the 747s here at Manchester. Yeah, exactly. That would have been crazy. Well, fingers crossed at some point there might be some charter or something again like there was last summer. Yeah, exactly. Well, I mean, I'm sure we will get the Atlases back in again, won't we? Um, we'll get a uh, the odd Antonov or something. That'd be cool as well. We will. So it's uh, it's just heading north at the moment, and it's going to be doing the bank bank over towards the east, and then cross over back across the airport. For it leaves our airspace and goes back to Dubai. Should we see what the weather's like in Dubai? Oh yeah, let's mug us off totally on this one. Yeah, go on then. That's what Liz is here for. That's and, why I'm here. And here it goes. Can barely even type bank. Dubai. I'm that cold. It's going to be a high of 24 today. It's currently 23. Feels like 23. Sunshine. They are winning. I'm jealous. I won't lie. 
I'm really jealous. I feel like at the moment it's like so cold. Like I take three degrees. Never mind twenty-three. Yeah. Three would be fine. It's not too bad now that that sun's on my neck a bit. Okay. I've got Turkish A321. I'm, I'm still staying. I'm sticking it. I'm making executive Yeah, decisions. Turkish one of muggers off all the time. With, like, yeah, exactly. Send an A330 in it, or a Dreamliner or an A350 and I'll think or about... Or a 777. Or even the ultimate, the 777. Yeah, exactly. Um, sing an a, send an A321 and don't even get on the stream nowadays. Yes, fuck. He's saying no turning to avoid nuts, but as usual, love it. <laughs> yeah, absolutely, yeah. Yeah, someone was sending an email from Nutsford as we uh, as uh, that plane wasn't even taking off, <laughs> saying that it had made a racket even though it hadn't even flown over the house yet. And uh, Claire, good morning, said, I've been in the Lurkers Lounge since six and sneezing. That sounds oh, well. like the best way to be. We love that you've... Uh, we love the Lurkers Lounge, you know. Uh, I can say I'm usually in it. Yeah, exactly. I, I am. Well, like, not of my own. I'll always pop out to say hello, you know, for a thing and I, I, and then I'll go, I'll go back in. But I'll always be watching. I didn't do yeah. it last week though. I was saying I, I, I found you need a break. I yeah, I was finding streams a bit hard work last week, um, so I, I took a week off. But I'm, I'm, I think I'm ready to go back in. There we go. Oh, thanks, Ian. Superb, superb camera work, Simon. Oh, thank you, mate. Yeah, my my panning is starting to come on a bit. I think yesterday I had a bit of a bad day because I had uh, tendonitis. It re- oh, I was in quite a, quite a bit of pain actually towards the end of the show, but. Uh, you hustled through. I hustled through uh, and then took some pain relief. Winner. <laughs> but, um, yeah, it was a bit weird. So it's nice to come out and actually have a bit of a free hand today. It's, uh, it's... Absolutely. And uh, Jim Bird saying A380 is time from Glasgow from the 26th of March. Can't wait. Yeah, I won't mind popping up for that. Well, there you go, then. And uh, Ali's do. been a member for one month. Oh, brilliant. Thank you. Good you... morning, Think Players, or good morning. Good morning, and thank you for your support. We yeah, really it's do amazing. appreciate it. You continue to support, it's, uh, it's fantastic. And we've got the Sass in the old livery coming out towards us now. Dan, I don't need to do the uh, microphones for a bit, I just looked again, there's oh, okay. like well over a third left. Uh, thanks, Aisha. Saying excellent coverage, you guys. Oh, thank you. It's great that you guys enjoy it. So yeah. Now, Paula, can see the A three eighteen off of me now. I bet you. It's. Uh, Do you want a coffee now? I would say yes, please. If uh, if I would say that. yes. I would say yes. I just I didn't know if you were like totally amenable towards that, but you are. So I'm taking advantage of you, Liz. <laughs> Do my trolley dolly duty. Oh. Is, uh, there you go. Miracle, I don't spill it. Excellent. <laughs> I'd give you I a tip. See. I'd give you a tip, but but I'm tight. Oh wow, thanks. Tom told me never to tip people. What does Tom know? He knows everything. <laughs> he knows ev- everything about seven three sevens that matter. Oh well, that's all right then. Went a bit of a long way then. I know. I think KTC forgot about him, just like gone off for a break. Bad. <laughs> all right, Emirates is out. We can all chill now. Yeah, exactly. We were just watching it back on the stream. Oh, I did look good that didn't it? And then like going, oh wait, look, got sat there waiting. <laughs> Duh, Michael saying, "Great camera work, Simon." Oh, we are just waiting to see the A380 come over our house here in Sheffield. Oh, bro. I think you'll definitely get this beautiful yeah, clear day today. Definitely. Visibility is absolutely superb. This is one of them days that if you um, if you got a PPL, um, you want to be out flying. Here we go, we've got Sass coming on. Oh, awesome! I was just saying, enjoying it to the fullest. Better than having a co- uh, better than having a cuppa. Get in there. Oh, I will appreciate that. We really do. Your support's just it's next level. Let's say we've only been doing this for three or four months. I think it's four months. I think. Am I pushing it now? I'm saying three. Yeah, I think. Um, I no, it's late. It's October, middle of October. October, November. No, yeah, it is. No, it is. It is. Yeah, yeah, it's four months. Four months. I was going to go back and look then, but all right. 
Yeah, it's four. It's four. I'll stop saying three now. I'm just making us sound better than we actually are. <laughs> Someone's going to come in and go, it's five months, right, and I'm not, I'm not ready for that in my life. <laughs> oh, well, it's not. But, um, no, we just appreciate the support. It's amazing. Yeah, you're not getting a zoom on this one because I've got a coffee on the other <laughs> end. Sorry. <laughs> it's all right. There's production value down the drain, isn't it? <laughs> all my standards go when I get a coffee in my hand. All right, what else have we got going on? We've got a Ryanair right now, coming taxi. out. Yeah, that's going to be going to Paphos. Should we see it? We've also got an easy jet that's going to be going to Paris. Excellent. Do you know what? I'm jumping on the RVP again. Let's say hello to everyone who's on the mounds there because they must be freezing as well. Yeah, they must. So uh, let's show some love. 600 mil in your face. <laughs> 4K in your face. No if mixing. anyone on the mound watching, look south side, give us a wave. They're definitely they're looking at arrivals there. I don't know what they're looking at because I can't see anything on finals. Oh, cheers, Rob. So nice filming of the 380. Close up and, dis and distant up. <laughs> yeah. Um, Crash drums, good morning to you. Der P, good morning. Lovely crisp February morning. And great coverage, as, blah, blah, blah. great coverage as always. Try and keep warm. And that's me not being able to talk because I'm too cold. Beautiful. <laughs> And, uh, well, again, Ben, on, uh, on your dad's, uh... No, it's his account, oh, it's not Ben's it? account, it's not, it's not his dad's account. It it's is just Ben's account. It's Ben's account. But it's under his dad's name. No, it's not, it's really, ben, Ben's changed his name by deed, Paul. To, to Tony. Tony. Yep, I know that. We've... That's some sort of tax thing there. Yeah, it's taxed. <laughs> oh, it's a dead one, it's the best streaming duo. Oh, thank you, mate. Thank you. So, um, shots from uh, Altrincham, uh, the Altrincham ladies game this weekend. Crackers again, mate. Absolute bangers. No, oh, your pictures are amazing. Just smashing it out of the park. Just every time you go out now. Yeah, we really are. So, uh, Ben, our resident sports photographer, extraordinaire. Stop I can't it. even say that, extraordinaire. He likes planes, though, as well. We've got a quad going over. Okay. Um, it looks like, I know, do you know what? It, it's that misleading thing. It could be a quad, though. It's quite a distance out. I'm not going to be able to go up. It is. It's cargo looks. No, I can't go up for it anyway. Oh. It's uh, too far over. Oh, well. Well, you were right, though. It was a 7.4. Get in there. And uh, Paula with the £10 at Super Chat saying, great camera work, Simon, uh, in the beautiful light. Oh, thank you so much, Paula. Really appreciate that. Thank you so much. Yeah, you're an amazing supporter. And I know you're like always in the chats with us and everything. So thank you for your support. I'm glad you like my camera work. Winner. <laughs> oh, oh, is he going? There we go. Yeah, I thought we had a back to stand job there for a minute. Not today. And, uh, yeah, Mr. Pingo, as Ian said, uh, he, he actually he did reply to your question. Uh, so if you scroll, we should still be able to see it. And, uh, bus driver, good morning. Saying a bit of a late start for me, but I'm here now. As we say, better late than never. Exactly. It's always good. Exactly. 
just when you can, you know what I mean? And work, work means that you can't do it every, you know, all the time, but then you can just pop in for like half an hour or 10, 15 minutes. It doesn't matter. We're just glad to have you here with us. Exactly. <coughs> I don't have to voice there. <laughs> okay, so this I saw this BizJet being de- uh, de-iced before, and now it's coming out Oh, it. yeah, it's going to... Oops. Um, I did just click on it. Farnborough. Well, that'd be up like an absolute shot, that won't it? Oh, just a bit. For a farm, bro. Should be fun. Okay, so we've got f- about 40 minutes left of dual ops here at Manchester. Yeah. So I'm hoping we'll get, well, the, there's a Virgin A31 first that usually goes out about 10 past, tw- well, till t- 25 past in that ballpark, doesn't yeah. it? So hopefully we'll get that. Um, it's usually a Tui around that time. I'm hoping we get that. Yeah, that'd be cool. Yeah, uh, so that biz dress, the one that came in from Teesborough. Teesborough, yeah, it is. Going to Farnborough, and then um, it's actually going from Farnborough to Warsaw. Well, it's, it's how they work it, isn't it? They just try and mm. sell it at certain places, yeah. don't they? And then, like, this would probably be a cheap deadhead flight. You know, like, you know yeah, the ones you that, can get them. Where you can get them for, like, pennies. Mm-hmm. Uh, next arrival will be a Logan at ATR 72 from the Isle of Man. It's uh, near Stockport, so don't... I'm not in a rush. No rush. <laughs> and we've also got an Air France A320 from Paris, about to turn on to finals as well. And a bit further out is also an EasyJet A320 from Amsterdam. I'm stood up. Probably caught that one on the way out earlier. Oh, we did? Yeah, yeah. We did. Yes, we did. So we've got a bit of action coming out as well, haven't we? We've got the EasyJet coming out, we've got Jet 2, and of course we've got this big jet. Just seen what time uh, it did that flight out to Amsterdam. It was seven oh five. It yeah. went out. Yeah, it's going to be going to Geneva later. That aircraft. Do you know what? I've not checked for a while. That oh, sounds like a full sector. That doesn't it? Yeah, it does. So pilots usually. I don't. I don't know if people know this, but you know, at, um, the low cost airlines they usually kind of have like two types of day. You usually say you either have a two sector day, yeah, or you have a four sector day. And usually, if you've got the uh, the short flights, it's usually going to be um, two lots of short haul flights. So it's a four sector day. So um, you yeah, know, doing an Amsterdam and a Geneva definitely has four sectors written all over it. Yeah, hey, uh, hello, Kitty Eva has been doing a lot of New York flights. Great, thanks for that news. Oh, I need power on my phone. Uh, you need to move over then, don't you? Yeah. Oh, you need to get that power bank. Oh, is that in there still? Yeah, and I'm thinking I've still got the cable here. So, Sorry for the noise, but you're going to get near my microphone. Oh, God. I'm just getting to the wire. There you go. Thank you very much. Oh, gosh. Ooh, okay, so I'm just going to stand in the sun. I'll try and stand in the sun for like a second. Honestly, I think it, it's really beneficial. On the back of my head and neck, is really warm now. The back of my head and neck is covered in a coat and a That's, that's your problem. Scarf. I, I, I think the hint was that you should probably take it off. I, I, think know. It's, I think it'd be warmer. I'm not sure it would. Well, I think you should try it's it. It's not the back of my neck that's cold. <laughs> okay, we've got Logan Air now touching down. Well, I'm trying to warm my hands up. I need to do some visualisation. Imagine there's a really hot fire in front of me. Yeah, take this. It's in my hand now. No, it's fine. No, take it. I'll use the other one and you can use this one too. It runs out. Okay. You take it. I'm panning. Where are you, where you at? Well, it's, in my, it's in my panning hand. In your panning hand? In my panning hand at the bottom. Thank you. There we go. <laughs> it's still pretty smooth footage there. I'll take that. Right. Okay, we've got this uh, midjet now. I'm going to record this because I think this is going to be up like an absolute rocket. So, uh, I'm going to take my mic off. Hang on, I'll get mine off. Thanks, Liz. Oh, 
hasn't been given permission to take off yet. <laughs> Great. <laughs> He's awaiting clearance. There we go. I was happy I recorded that. That's one. That was decent. And we have the air fans touching down. I will grab that and then move it onto the easy jet. There we go. So this is how it is at the moment, isn't it? It's really peaks and troughs. It's like one minute there's nothing yeah, happening, and then next minute loads. it's like I'm panning like a, a madman just to get back to the uh, just to the movements. It's... I'll take it. I'll take any that kind of action like that, but it's. Say it's uh, that's when it's more consistent. Right, where was I? Esther, good morning. Esther in the chat. Esther in the chat. Uh, Beastie, good morning to you as well. So I'm so late. Lol, well, sorry. No need to apologise. Yeah, you don't need to apologise. You're here. It's the main thing. If we didn't, if we showed up late, then we'd have to apologise. Yeah. Because uh, that would be rude. But we like we tr we, we tried to go on time, if not a couple of minutes early. We tried today, and then <laughs> the curse of this spot kicked in again. It did. Very strange. It really is. It's just it just doesn't want to boot up. Yeah, it's very from, weird because we place. didn't have this problem yesterday. Well, no, it's, the, it's 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 been this spot two weeks in a row, hasn't yeah, it? Yeah, it has. It's really odd. It's uh, it's been. It's like, I, I don't I don't get it. Don't get it anywhere else apart from this spot. So I say I, I think like I'm going to plan on going five minutes early next time we come here. Yeah, and then if I it goes so. horribly wrong, I'm still going live at you know six thirty. That's exactly it. So, uh, Raul, good morning from uh, Gran Canaria. I'm going to go on the engine. Uh, James, we'll keep an eye out. The I've just seen the. Um, I found it now. The well, it's not left yet, but the uh, beluga. So, we'll uh, we'll try and keep it comes near us. We'll see if we can catch it. Uh, yeah, you know I'm a big beluga fan, so uh, I can't say no. There you go. Liz was just looking at me really weirdly. I thought you were flopping your arm at me. Nope. I was just oh. uh, zooming in a bit. Oh, right. I thought he was flopping his arm at me. Uh, no problem, tell. George. Thank you for watching today. See you later. A nice one, bus driver. So we've got you on one monitor and flight sim on the other. Oh, winning. Morning of aviation for me. That is like winning, especially if you're doing real flight simulators, you know, real traffic at the time. Yeah, that's it, isn't it? Um, ooh, top man, like that. tell you is I'm zooming in on this because this is going to use a lot of runway. Yeah. 
A Jet 2? Use runway. What? Derate your takeoff? Are you sure? Hang on, I'll find out where. As I say, it's the one airline I can turn around and confidently turn around and go, that's derated. <laughs> Every other airline, I can't say that. I'm just like, I don't know. Uh, it's after Fort Aventura. Right. Where is the Prince of Wales? Oh, you've not even left yet. You're still taxiing. You're not even that doing that, I don't think. I think you've basically... Oh, he's just got his transponder on. It won't go no, it's, well, it's, no, it's moved. Oh, is it moving? Well, it's... It's been at one knot for a while, put it that way. Oh, no, it can be like that. Ah, uh, right, that, well... That, that thing. They usually do, do them so that it, it, two hours in between. So usually when it lands and it's two hours after that, they go out. Right. Chat, I'm throwing it to you. And you see that thing in the air. Let you see know. it taxiing more than ten knots. All that. Uh, let us know. <laughs> Just means I can keep the filters on. <laughs> uh, Lord Darla, good morning to you. Some nice overhead action, but unfortunately, just a bit too. No, oh, thanks, Mike. There's a uh, two Dreamline to Cancun pushing back. Excellent, thanks, Mike. Um, yeah, I'm hoping for a bit of action from over here in the next uh, five ten minutes. If we do, then we're in for a good, good few minutes over on this runway before it closes, which is uh, it's where it's at. Would you say, Liz? Would you say yeah. this is where it's at? This is where it's at. David, I think that's a sign to just stop vacuuming and just, just watch the that. stream. I just, just watch the stream and forget up, it's a sign. Just don't even bother. Yeah. <laughs> Vacuum cleaners are like that, just evil. Oh, I'm not saying, uh, oh, meeting, volume going down. Um, I said, if you don't want some back, uh, then thank you it's so much this morning. Very much appreciated. No, it's good to, good to do that, mate, so don't worry about yeah. it. Hopefully, uh, hopefully meeting's not too long. Hopefully it's one of the, well... Is it one of the meetings that could have been an email? Yeah, yeah. That's the question, isn't it? Or a it? voice note. Voice note's best. Yeah, definitely. Because most people can stick a voice note on a system. It's just like, yeah. thank you. Boom, thank you very much. Exactly. Uh, Suzanne, good morning to you. Let's see if we can see anything. Yeah. The only problem, we can't see around the back where that two would be, so... Um, unfortunately, I can't see his tail pushing. Okay. I, as Mike says, that's why he's magic. <laughs> and uh, Chris, that's amazing, saying I uh, watched back last night. Said uh, you were early enough to um, catch I was landing on the uh, To Eat Dreamliner from Bridgetown. Oh, brilliant. Did you have a nice holiday? Because <coughs> I think every flight goes to Bridgetown at the moment. I, I think I it does. Vibe. I think most, most of the people over there must be speaking. Man <laughs> must be Mancunian or, you know, from up north or something. You alright there, babe? No. Okay, I'm dying. This is dying on the screen, everyone. I've got like a tickly throat now. <laughs> so I don't feel like I need to sneeze. <laughs> she sounded like the exorcist for a minute, to be <laughs> honest, there, didn't she? <clears throat> Ooh, this one looks quite big. So we've right. got something that's coming over the top. Right, two seconds. Let me have a look. I'll have a look what it is. I definitely. Big Maybe thing the over place. the top. There's My no points. There. Going through this white cloud, and there it is. It looks quite big. Oh, I'm saying that's a quad. Um, I can't see it properly, but which way is it going? It's coming. It's doing that um, east, uh, west to east. Um. Oh, oh like God, the, that's far away. Yeah, I know. It's crazy. That's it, over Liverpool way. Yeah. Yeah, that's where I'm picking them up. Right, it's cargo look 747. Oh, we'll stay on this one, people. Uh, that's come from Huntsville, and it's going to Luxembourg. There we go. God, I was literally looking around like, no, I can, there's I no can pick, I, I can pick them up from halfway through uh, over the Irish Sea. And then, like... Uh, okay, yeah, so that's literally... Um, just to give you an idea, when you picked that up, that was flying north of Liverpool Airport. Yeah. 
No, I can pick them. I've, I've done that where I picked them up from the Irish Sea before. It's just like, wow. But yeah, so. Well, at least you get an extended bit of this. There you go. You get a 747, everybody. Tag, put it in tags, people. Channel tags, 747. Put it in the description. Description. Put it in the title. Put it everywhere. <laughs> oh. oh, we could put Blue Grid XL as well. Oh, my God. This channel's peaking. <laughs> oh. Oh. oh, I've got my panning handle Gosh. coming in now. I don't think I'll be able to stay in this for much longer. Right, it's going to get bumpy because I'm going to take the fingers off it. Three, two, one. I'm going to have to stop. Oh, no, it's still going. Better stop there. Oh, well, you got it for a bit, didn't you? And that Tui. Oh, that was, that's perfect timing, that, Liz. There you go. That Tui is just literally just about to cross the runway. Perfect. <laughs> Winner. Well, thanks for that cargo looks. Uh, BC say it looks like a lovely early spring day at Manchester Airport. Definitely got that, yeah. I mean, it's cold, so I wouldn't say sp spring to me is like, ooh, the chill's gone. Uh, but are you still streaming Wednesday? Yes, we're going to... Uh... That's our... Uh... Sorry? That's our baby now, isn't it? Yeah, so we're going to do what we said we were going to do last week, but didn't because last week it went windy. Uh, we're going to go down to the uh, far end, the wood end lane, and, and get the close-up departures. Yeah, rotation shot. As I say, it's not going to be a particularly long show. It's going to be like 6.30 till That 10, will be 6.30 because obviously we're restricted by uh, runway two times then. Yeah. But uh, we do love it up there. Oh, Sassy new liveries pushing. Please come over on this runway. <laughs> pretty, pretty, please. It's but, only eight um, minutes past, so... Yeah, it should be good. Yeah, so the, uh, that, that show should be amazing. I'm looking forward to that. We've actually got a couple... Um, there's two people, I know, a couple of people I know flying out on that already. On there's what, There's a sorry? pilot as well flying out as well that I know. Good mate. When's that? Wednesday. Wednesday, right, yeah. cool. So, um, yes, that should be a good show. Looking forward to it. I think this this is like one of the few shows recently where you don't know anyone flying. All right, because I've got no friends. Okay, Liz. <laughs> I was thinking you've got loads of surprises. I've got no friends anymore. <laughs> um, and we have, is it a Lufty I'm uh, about to touch down? Oh, look. Yes. Uh, yep, Lufthansa A321 in from Munich. And it's a 200. It's open the engines. Ooh. Got the Virgin Atlantic A330 to Barbados has uh, pinged up. Oh, we should get that as well. That'd be good. Yeah, I don't think that was his best landing there. And that wasn't my best pan. Something both had in common. Oh, well. Both botched that. Nice one. Oh, we'll concentrate on the two. Yeah, Taylor, I know um, obviously it's been quite a, a big news story in the aviation world. Obviously, they, they rolled out the last 747, didn't they? But let's remember, everyone, that thing is going to be around for a long time. I know we don't see them as much as we used to. but um, if, you, if you live near a cargo airport, you saw it. Well, yeah, exactly. Um, yeah, we still They're going to be around for quite some time yet, I think. Yeah, for I mean for for cargo airlines, then then things should be good for another fifteen twenty years minimum. You know what I mean? Uh, plus, you know you can have Air Force One as well. So you know you, you can have seven four seven for for a good while. So you know it's not the end of the world. I mean I know it, it's hard in regards to its use as a passenger liner, but there's still other ways to get to see it. And you'll just love it even more every time you do see it. I know yeah. I do now. I really do appreciate it when I see a seven four now. Oh yeah, definitely. I think I um, found interesting. Did anyone see the um, the incident from was it yesterday or the day before with the was it UPS seven six? I know it was a seven six that was arriving, and there was a Southwest seven three seven taking off. Um, wow, that was that was uh, very close to where. Uh, okay. 
Yeah, I, mean, I heard got, about it. I didn't actually N- look. Into NTSB it. put out a, a kind of, uh, a statement in regards to it already. Okay. But from the uh, the data that they've got, you know, like on flight radar and everything, it wasn't good. Okay. <laughs> Vision thing. It's flying to Florida in March. You gotta give us dates, mate. We'll yeah, we'll definitely. That. I'm not saying we can live stream it because it depends on what date it is, but I'll, I'll get you shots if you wanted. Because I am a photographer. <laughs> really? You take pictures? I take pictures. I know people don't think that anymore, but I actually do. Yeah, and we have the Jet 2A321 coming out on the taxi now. Oh, Jay has spotted him with a question here today. Oh, no, I can't be doing with him and his questions. You can so, stick your questions. So, question for you both, oh. um, those in the chat. It said, uh, if you could have picked an airline to have the last 747 delivered of anyone who operated them, who would you pick? Oh, does it have to be you operated them? Yeah. <sighs> the stipulation in there. I know, why does he stick that stipulation? Um, right, give me five minutes with that one, I need to have a think. <laughs> I'm, I'm not saying BA, there we go, that's my first one. Even though they did the retro dress and everything, I, mean, I think the, the retro dress alone, that puts them quite high up. I was just about to say, so I was going between BA and Virgin but now you said that that swung me I'd, I'd want it I want BA but I want the Landor livery on it see I, I became a fan of Negus no, okay see uh, my heart says Virgin Atlantic so my heart says Virgin Atlantic but my my head says someone like I'd love to see oh, I don't know it's, oh, this is going to sound weird but Pan Am oh right yeah okay yeah no the classic the classic I'm going for Right, but if it was if it was an operator who didn't have it, I would love to see it in the mighty orange in the orange carrot livery. <laughs> I'm just saying, I'm throwing it out there. Wow, that plane would just look like the best thing ever, and it has to be in the in the carrot livery. It can't be in the uh, the normal liveries. You can put a phone number down the side as well. You got a phone number down. <laughs> you can put the, oh, eight, the four, five seven, five number down the side. The number down the side. You can have the like. You can have a website. You can have an email address. Yep. All the social media links. Yep, that's, that. There's enough room. <laughs> so that, that, that's my take on that one. I hope <laughs> that kind of gives you an insight into what my how warped my mind is. <laughs> um, I'm sure if any psychiatrists uh, are listening, they probably want to have me committed. Well, seven four seven easy jet carrot. Mighty carrot. That it would be the mighty carrot, wouldn't it? That's what they should have done inside of it. The mighty carrot. Oh, eight four five. <laughs> <laughs> What about yours, John? I'm, I'm guessing it's John. I don't know. Well, JS Spotting. Well, it is John, isn't it? Yeah, but the accounts... Kind oh, of right. Oh, I'll have two, two, so I'm... See, sometimes Simon knows more about the people in the chat than I do. Yeah, but so they still get some... Uh, they still get quite a few uh, 747s over in LA, don't they? They do. I'm so jealous of what, when I'm watching airline videos. Yeah. You know when they when he's doing the when he's on the H hotel and he's like um, he's just turning round uh, to go south side and he's like, he's looking into the that area. I'm like, God, I hate you, in the nicest possible way. Yeah, exactly. I'm just so je- I'm just jealous. I'm a bitter person. But yeah, no, um, LA is just fantastic for them. I mean, they seem to still have them like, every couple of hours. Yeah. But I will say that Big Jet TV sometimes clobbers that, doesn't it? You know when he does the Anchorage ones? Because they have just 747s. Yeah. 
No. So that was the Jet 2 to Tenerife. Didn't someone say they were on a Jet 2 to Tenerife? I thought it was later, though. Or was it something else? But that was Jet 2 to Tenerife, anyway. It was uh, A321. And we got a BA. Let's just turn yeah, it Yeah, going back to uh, Heathrow. And um, Nathan, yes, yeah, do we stream every Monday. Flying in March um, would be great to get it live. Yes. Uh, yes, we are live every Monday. Oh, uh, no. When, which, when, yeah, it depends when in March. Yeah, when in March. Uh, there's, there's, there's something that we, we are doing in March which might uh, stop that. Do you know the dates for that yet? No, there's, there's possibly, possibly two events, isn't there? Because we're doing something at the beginning of March. Yeah, okay. Yeah, so it depends when in March. If it's the first... If it's the... Uh, oh, no, it can't be the first. So, no, no. So, you should be all right as long as there's one event. It's actually one event that doesn't stop us doing that, so... Chuck is the date. We'll have to see. I don't have the dates for the thing we're doing yet, though, but it's definitely in March. We'll try. If we're here, we'll be here. <laughs> Unless I, like, fake an injury or something. <laughs> And uh, thanks, Hayden, saying uh, excellent camera work, Simon. Thank you. <laughs> Sorry, I yawned. I was like... <laughs> and, uh, Mark agreed with British Airways, I think, for the 747. Timing with the BA. Uh, BC saying Virgin Atlantic or Cafe Pacific. Uh, Schrodi saying Ryanair uh, to get a single 747 for sure. Oh, God, can you imagine how many seats they get on their that? socials. If they but, could, could you imagine <laughs> how much they would charge right. for the upper deck? Les, Les, I'm going to record this one because it's yep. one of my favourites. Okay. Thanks. Thanks, everyone, for understanding. Of course, he'd have to wait there, wouldn't he? Of course, he would. Me off. I was about to say, as soon as I turned the uh, recording off, I bet you he just took the spools off. I was like, going, yeah, okay, you've proper mummed me off now. Okay, so what I can see at the moment, we've got a Finnair coming out, we've got a Jet 2 uh, 737 coming out, we've got a Ryanair 737 uh, on the other side of the runway. I still can't see the Virgin A330, so I don't think we're going to get that. No, I doubt we'll get that, unfortunately. Very nice, that light really accentuates that, uh, that livery. Right, sorry, just had to yawn there. Um, uh, Anusha, yes, we will. Uh, I think it was you that asked, wasn't it, about the... Um, hang on, where was I? I'm sure it was you asked about the... Oh, yeah, the evening. There we go, I thought I'd seen it. Uh, about the evenings once spring... Um, yeah, so we will be doing more sort of shows like later in the day and into the evening. Um, you know, we want, A, it to be a bit warmer. Uh, <laughs> not that that's a problem because we're out here all morning anyway, but no, it's the, the runway, like the runway two operation times change. And also, obviously, as you get into the summer season, more flights. there's more flights. Yeah. So it's, it's hard work at the moment. Uh, it is when it's quiet, to, uh, especially to, to, in the evenings. There are, like, we have looked... There are some big gaps at the moment yeah. that it would be really quite dull. Um, I'm not saying that we couldn't fill it. It's just, I, I'm not sure it'd be great for you, Pete. Yeah, people. exactly. So 
Charlotte Reiner's off to Faro. Um, but yeah, expect, you know, morning, noon and night. And uh, also, as uh, Jet 2 now coming out, that's going to Alicante. It's a 737, which ties in perfectly to who was comment was it that I saw uh, Mark saying a 747-8 in a Jet 2 livery. Because we're, we're going into the film, a realm of anyone having that. You don't like that, no? I'm shaking my head. I won't lie. I'm like going, no. doesn't like that one. I don't like that one. <laughs> like, yeah, I'm not feeling that. God, imagine Jess Glynn then. Just think about that. Oh, God. <laughs> oh, dear. Oh, here we go, here we go. 747 in the Orini livery. Oh. Oh, now we're talking, aren't we? We're just stepping it off it. Right, I'm going to go on the engine on this one. Finair's made it over here, which is good. That's good. And uh, thanks, Kev. I really appreciate that comment, saying it uh, takes skill to talk to a group of people uh, like you are, but come across as though you're talking to each of us individually and you have that skill. Well, thank you. Yeah. You do, we you try do, a, crack, you do a cracking job of that. I thank I you. Think you also, I, just, I just rock in with some sarcastic humour every so often. <laughs> you do a really good job of interacting uh, with the chat. So, no, I think you, you should take some plaudits for that. I'll take plaudits for the pan and you take the uh, the chat ones. There Is that a deal? Go. Yeah, that's a deal. Excellent. Uh, Chris saying the Canadian Pacific Airlines 747 used to be orange. Well, it, wasn't mighty, it wasn't mighty orange. Well, no, I get be... what you say. I totally get you. <laughs> uh, but... And just have it Manchester-based as well. Yeah. Just does like the Malaga flights or something, I don't know. Or the Amsterdam flight. Well, I think that's the last one off this runway and I messed it up so Well, that's going back to help. Because I'm so emotional. <laughs> I guess Helsinki. Oh, thanks, Matthew. Yeah, I've seen uh, LA is good. Um, I watch it all the time. Um, but you guys are so close to the action; it's more fun here. I think you've got like we are so lucky and yeah. spoiled in Manchester. Um, so I really praise anyone whose main airport is not here, because although like you know Heathrow's one, LA's one, you get all like these amazing movements, but. What? I'm just doing the uh, Team America signal. Look, look, but I, I, I think, and let me just see if I can get it in shot yet. I need to. There's a pile on down there. Yep, straight up from there. So we've got two coming in, and I think this is a quad. Okay, hang on two seconds. Oh no, it's not a quad. It's it's a big. Whatever it is, it's quite big. You can see it pulsing. The autofocus isn't sure of it yet. But it's quite big. The contrails are coming off it a decent size. Um, Please which, be triple seven at least. Which way is it going? It's, th it's from the same direction as the last load, so it'd be well past Liverpool this one. Right. Okay. Uh, so that is a Lufthansa A three hundred and fifty from. Uh, yes. uh, speaking of which, LAX. There we go. On the way to Munich, and yeah, that is still over the Irish Sea. Yeah. That is. Well, there's one behind it. I don't, can you see the one behind it on the, on the thingy? Uh, yeah. What's that? A Lufthansa A350 from San Diego to well, I'm, Munich. That's, I'm, that, I'm on that one now. Wow, so. that's uh, that's impressive. I won't lie. We'll go on this top one. Um, but yeah, as we were talking about, uh, or as I was talking about LA briefly, yeah, like uh, like I say, LA Heathrow. Um, you know, they're notoriously difficult at times. Um, you know to get good spots and everything yeah. and 
you know, we're just so lucky here. Not only do we have like, you know, you have got your like your runway visitor park, but you've also got obviously the whole of South Side, which is not only very open and really publicly accessible, but it's raised above the fence. Yeah, that's what and obviously makes the, it. the light's perfectly behind you on this side. You know, there's a spot down at the other end. You know, there's there's a couple of the spots you got down at the end of the runways and stuff. Um. But we, we, I, you know, like when we talk about going to Heathrow and stuff like that, look, we can't, we don't compete with the traffic there. No, and we don't try to. That's the thing. Yeah. We, what we say is, we, I always say is, you're going to get the best shots though from here. Yeah, like, that's that, it. That's the one thing that we can guarantee you. It's a, it's an amazing, amazing location. Right. So Nathan's saying a flight on the twentieth of March at ten past eight. What day is that? What day is it? Well, I'm going to assume it was a Monday. Well, you said it was a Monday, so yeah. If we're not doing that, the other thing, then yeah, absolutely, like I can guarantee that we'll be out for it. So yes, um, definitely remind us probably the week before um, in the chat if you can, or send us a message a few days before um, via social media. Uh, and on the day itself, if we haven't replied to you by then, ma- uh, make sure to just like go. Oh, I'm on this one. Yeah, get me. <laughs> Film me. Yeah. Uh, on approach, we've got a Norwegian 737 from uh, Bergen. How long have we got on that? Uh, it's at Stockport. Okay, I've got, I'll be able to get this one going right over the top then. Fantastic. Uh, I'm going to just pop the filters back on. And I'm guessing that blue has not moved. That's no, not... Well, another one came in. Um, oh, well, looks... that means that, so what they use... Unless it's switched, oh, I don't know. No, no, no. So what they Go usually on. do is they have the one that comes in land because they use the same taxiway. Okay. So it usually comes in and landed, then the other one will push back and then oh, right, part okay. of that. That's how they usually do it at that place. So Cool. So uh, about a quarter of an hour away, we've got an Iceland Air 757-300 coming did, in. Did you change it to the special? Or is it just the... No, I did check that before and I've just checked again. Well, it's not going to change now. It's already left. <laughs> it doesn't just like... It's not a chameleon. I can't just change into the uh, the Heckler Aurora livery like mid-flight. Um Oh, I hope some geek in the chat goes, no, that's a 200, not a 300, Liz. No, like, it's actually 300 today. Yeah, it's 300, that's what I'm yeah. saying. It would be the uh, 100 years livery if we got a uh, change. Yeah, but um, I just had a great idea. Do you know, like, you know, thinking future wear? And, and this is, like, me thinking well outside the box, because that's just what I do. Um, you know, obviously now we're like, oh, we're paint a livery and blah, blah, blah. Can you imagine technology changed so that you could literally change like liveries like almost like holographically or, or like, like wear some... a pair of glasses or something well not just not just wear a pair of glasses but just like that it kind of changes just like there's something that it's made out of that it can change so if All you right. know nice one like if EasyJet fancied being a carrot for the day they could, yeah. they could put like you could that's an amazing idea this literally everyone in the chat's like going what the hell is she smoking hey look it's people like me that think of these things and you know, oh, I've changed well, the world. That's... I can't make it. Oh, well, that, that, that got here from Stockport very quickly. Oh, the Norwegian. Yeah. <laughs> it is, it has got, here. like, good engines. It's not like a, a little dash out or something, is it? Oh, it's got, it, we've got, it, oh, it's got a face. We've got a face. Oh, okay. Let's see who it is today. We have. Hang on. John or Jan. Jan, which would be Jan. Jan. I'll let you read uh, that one. Can you read Bals, it? Balsrud. Balsrud, yeah. There we go. It's the, uh, he looks so Jan serious. Jan Balsrud livery. He looks very serious there, I must say. Like, <laughs> don't mess with him. He's got a really good poker face. He'd, like, he'd rob you. He'd have no money. Yeah. Uh, Strady saying flight on a Sunday in April at 7 a.m. on the British Airways. I said, might catch our departure from you guys. And so we then yeah. have a six hour stopover in London because they changed our flight out. Oh, wow. wow. Nice one, BA. So really, uh, really enjoy. Well, if it's BA to BA, you get to really enjoy Terminal 5 there. Yeah. Going to have a party there. Yeah. Good. I would say a good set for like, if you are flying out of Terminal 5 um, at Heathrow. You are on like the, you know, it's probably, it doesn't make much sense if you're in the A gates and they're all like the European flights and stuff. But if you are. Walk. Yeah, well, A walk to B and C gates because obviously they're the satellite terminals. Um, and they tend to do like the longer haul stuff. 
but go there if you just want to have a chill and a coffee because it's dead because people tend to only walk over there once they yeah. know where the gate is so especially if you've got you know you've got flight radar and stuff if you know what aircraft you're going to be on you can find where it came in and stuff and yeah. but honestly it's so much quieter over there and it's just totally agree you know, there's some decent shops over there you can get a sandwich yeah. and stuff like that yeah so you get sandwiches coffee there's boots and stuff yeah. uh, smiths and it's just like cause it's pandemonium in that main bit yeah okay so our first departure off uh, this runway oh I need to check the microphones oh yeah microphones need to do a replacement in a minute oh nice and Sarah I mean this is a bit ago with Sarah saying uh, our 380 um, our outgoing A380 has just passed our incoming A380 with just a, th- uh, a thousand feet between them A380 friends um, yeah I hope that I hope the one who's underneath got um, a video got a video of that because that would be epic. yeah company would love that said that uh, love flight radar that's my uh, educational input for the day guys well thank you appreciate that I'll take that oh and Virgin is pushing Oh, got an easy? Easy. <laughs> Sorry, Jerry, I apologise. I sound because he loves you so much. I do. He's got, <laughs> I do I, like, I think we spoke about, like, uh, when we went over um, Storm Eunice. Yeah. Eunice one, yeah, it was. Um, and, like, like, that's when we started kind of going out. So there's, like, a special place in our hearts for him in regards of that. So There you go. There you go. So when I do it, I... I don't mean it disrespectfully. I know some people have done that in the past, and I'm not one of them. I do. Well, there's a channel we we respect what you've done for live streaming and aviation. Exactly. You're not going to get any hate from us. All right, where's that thing gone? There's a tui down there. I know it. I'm just trying uh, to see the tail. Hey, you what? Sorry. There's a two seven three down there. Oh, I can't okay. see it. Annoying me. Uh, ATC Swede, good morning, saying hi again. Uh, watching your stream from the tower at Gothenburg. Oh, wow. Airport said it's not too busy today. Here or there? I mean, here it's kind of like... It, it it's ebbing busy. and flowing today. It wasn't as busy as when he was here last. Yeah, that's true. So, uh, cause we had, Like I said, we had a nice little bit of traffic coming in. Right, there's another one coming in off that track. Okay, two seconds. Yeah, there's no rush with it. It's probably over at the Alamance. So, uh, well, we've got... Uh, that's a bit closer. Uh, oh, that's that Lufthansa 350. So, right. So, you're looking, like, way out, aren't yeah, you? Yeah, way out. I'm, like, well over the Irish Sea. Okay. So, there's one that's heading a bit further south. No, I can see that one. That's the Virgin Atlantic 350 from New York going to Heathrow. So that's why it's turning and south. And two parallel, roughly about the same position. There's one that's following the, the, the Virgin A350, and there's another one that's using the exact same tracks as the... Uh, the A350 did. The A350s did, I should say, not one. Okay, well, we've got a KLM Dreamliner out there. I mean, there's something really big much further back. That's an American Triple. But, I mean, I'm kind of like, how far? How far are you seeing it? I was to say, we do have a bit of action here now, but I, I just like, I do like my over the top. I think, uh, I think we all... We do all like the overheads, don't we? Yeah, I do. I like them. Um, you've got an EasyJet on finals. It's an A319 from Hamburg. Which we'll these... concentrate on our thing. Okay, right. We need to do the mic change. Okay, yep. We have officially gone. To... Oh, unless you want me to just plug mine in here. Are you going to... Oh, no, because that doesn't help, does it? Doesn't Sorry. <laughs> right. If I just start getting them ready now, it's... it's yeah, good. that's cool. Just uh, give them a new... Uh, private jet photo is good. Good morning. I will apologise to the chat because I'm probably just going to be preoccupied doing this for a minute. Oh, wow, Strody saying, uh, speaking of the flying carrot, um, did you ever see the Easy Cruise? It was a cruise ship head yes. to toe in orange, inside and out. I need to Google that. Right, I know I'm like proper behind here. Uh, a geese I can hear. Yep. Oh. Oh, thanks, David. I'm just glad. Uh, I'm just glad so many people enjoy these streams. Well, I'm plug that on and get ready with the other one. Yeah. Two seconds, guys. Uh, sorry, I've just had to forget that. Uh, jet has just come in. Hello. 
to right down the runway. If anyone does a go around, you are screwed. I'm not going to lie about that. Okay, let's just do. Check. Mm. That's your microphone. This one. Okay, so um, position thing, uh, so in plan 16th of March, it'll be during Simon's stream. Oh, that's oh, I'll good. Get, I'll get a photo. There you go. Sorry. Video or the Simon on photo? What more could you want? Some double Simon sound, action. <laughs> sound check on mics. Check, check. I always say that, it's weird. Yeah. Right, I need to put this one back. Thank you. Just um I need to not mess these wires up because I'm likely to do that later. Hopefully you can all hear us well and stuff. I think when um I know I need, there was I a few turn it, uh, yeah, I need to turn it up a little bit. Yeah, there was a few comments uh about either mine, you being quiet and me loud and whatever, but um This is always loud. Well, there you go. So I bitch that's just gone up, I do realise that. But it means that I don't have to worry about plugging in things and dropping things. So it works benefit. out better for me. I'm selfish, that's how I roll. <laughs> I don't know, it sounds decent. Yeah, I think it was maybe while we were switching them over. Yeah. Um, oh, you're good. Your numbers are good, oh. my numbers are good. Right, let me... Because I just flicked to the bottom of the chat there just to make sure that it wasn't all... It wasn't all going awful. Yeah, the, the, the volume, there might be a little difference in the volume. I'm going to try and equalise the two out uh, over the next day or two. Um, so that when there is a change, you, you probably won't notice it at all. Apart from me going, all right, let's give me a mic, give me a mic. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Um, that's about it. So we do have the Virgin now coming out. It's just popping out behind the tower. And I will buzz down to the t head of uh, two, three, right, because we do have a Ryanair that's on coming out. There it is, I can see its tail. And it's a max. Lovely. Right, I have no idea where I was in the chat now. It's all gone wrong. What's? And I have. Oh, right. Okay. <laughs> when you say that, I like, go, what, what the hell's gone wrong? <laughs> no, it's just me. Uh, oh, well, it's all right. Long finals, we've got the uh, Iceland Air. Oh, Actually, it's not that far. I thought it was better than that. It's uh, about to go over Cheadle. Okay. Um, so it's about a minute out. Yeah, sorry. I thought it was much further out than it was. I'll go down. I think I was more zoomed in than normal. And I'll go down to the bottom of the runway and get that. As we do love uh, a 300 on here. They're you know, relatively rare, aren't they? Yeah. Uh, David, welcome back. Um, maybe I had a good say and had a long chat with my daughter. Um, I'm now planning a chip. A, a chip? A chip. Happy oh, days. I feel very nice. a trip. Oh, you've got to tell them about them chips. Oh, got. I will. Uh, from Christchurch oh. to Wellington in April, uh, making my first flight since February 2020. Well, that's awesome, David. And uh, yeah, I hope it was lovely catching up with your daughter. Yeah, we'll let this 757-300 land and then you can discuss what we, we got scammed yesterday, didn't we? Yeah, so... We were just like, we went to Tesco really quickly after this birthday party and uh, they were like, oh, we'll just like grab some, is it like chicken wings? And we were like, oh, we'll have some like wedges or something with it and stuff. Uh, not obviously, you know, we had pizza in the end because it was just, we couldn't be bothered cooking. But uh, we, we saw McCain and like, oh, some like salt and pepper, like, sort of uh, takeaway, like style fries. Yeah. And we were like, oh, we'll get them. 
I didn't. We didn't realize. And to be fair, it does say on the front of the bag, but they don't make that very obvious. It wasn't. It it's wasn't. just a bag of McCain fries, and you get some seasoning in the packet. I just make seasoning myself. Exactly, and it'd probably be better. The biggest fraud ever, that one. I won't lie. And here is the seven five. Go on, butter the bread on this one, people. <laughs> Yes, you smashed it on a 4K live stream. Get in there, people. The nation of Iceland are proud of you. If Heckler or Aurora Livery had, uh, was able to articulate emotions, it'd cry. No. That's how good that landing was. Uh, Joe Lawrence saying uh, great content as always guys uh, there's something therapeutic about having this on in the background whilst working uh, it makes the boring uh, paperwork side of my job go a lot smoother well I'm glad we can uh, help keep you so many of you entertained I know uh, a lot of people do say that um, I just can never see how my voice could ever be classified <laughs> as therapy <laughs> or even in the same sentence yeah well it's happened. I'm taking it. I'm taking it, people. I know. I do think my voice has changed a little bit since I started streaming. Oh, there we go. Like, it's not as <laughs> as it used to be. <laughs> I, I, I'm, I'm fully aware that how bad it is. Oh, dear. Like um, oh, Mark's saying uh, a Robin emoji. I mean, we don't actually tend to see the Robin actually on stream, do we? But no. we, could, we could do that maybe at some point. We could just, can. like, knock one up temporarily because the, the thing I want to do with the emotes is probably have different emotes with different spots. Yeah, exactly. So like, like, swap the KFC one out when we're up here and stuff like yeah. that and then have it back in. So, um, I'm, uh, yeah, I, I'm, I'm up for doing that. Yeah. Okay. And we, are, we will be due a f another emote as well um, because we've increased our membership, so... We'll be able, probably be able to stick that in the next one. If you've got any more ideas, please just whack them in the chat. But some of them can't be done, especially with long words and stuff like that. It just oh, I've not quite figured it out, really. Yeah, but as I say... I ought to do a panning one for me, I'm not going to lie. <laughs> oh, dear. Hashtag panning God. I mean, I've given the title myself, I mean, so I think that takes it away from me a bit, but... Okay, Liz, uh, so we've got two coming at us from the locations that we've had over the Irish Sea before. Yeah. Uh, one in front, I don't think it's a particularly big one, the one, on the, the one that's further behind looks like it could be a decent size. Two minutes, right, you've got an arrival, like, here, it's a Ryanair, yeah, so... no one cares. No one cares, right, okay. Uh, so well, there they are, there's the two, but this one on the, on the left. Right, there's a lot of them. a little bit bigger. Uh, um, there is a 747 over there. Oh, is there? Oh. Yeah. Uh, is it the first one or the second one? The uh, second is KLM. Yeah, I thought it looked a bit bigger. Okay, well, we'll get this departure. I'm not going to miss the Virgin, so don't worry. Oh, Jet 2's up there early. Is this a positioning flight? Oh, gosh. Sorry, Liz, I'm all over the place. That is a positioning flight. Wow, look at it, it's like vertical. What the hell? Hang on. Big place, just look though, just look. I've never seen a plane up there in all my life. Not even a biz jet. It's going to lash them. That's ridiculous. I don't know what they... There you go, that's your information. I'm just looking at F. What's Well, that was crazy. I I couldn't even remotely pan that because it was up that it was the 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 rate it was up at. How bizarre. Uh, Stuart saying, uh, dropped a phone this morning. Since then, the chat display. Uh, on my telly has a dark background, it's much easier to read. 
uh, proper result for a technophobe. I thought it was just like that in general. Anyway, maybe updated, maybe the drop updated it. But uh, yeah, I, I totally get the. Uh, Can you screen that shot of that flight from? Yeah, the the, the, uh, the dark background is much easier to read. Yeah, we agree on that. We prefer those. Thank you. I appreciate that. Yeah, no worries. Um, and there is the seven four that was uh, seen coming across. Oh um, yeah, you can actually see the. Uh, it's a quad now. Okay, so that is a. Hang on, let me just get the details of that again. Um, so Kalen Cargo. So the, Martina. Uh, yeah, Martina. Uh, it's come from Miami, and uh, no surprises, it's going to Amsterdam. It's a seven four seven four hundred freighter. So I always have like certain spots where I can see stuff, you know, planes, and I have reference points. I'm looking at that Jet Two Seven Three now, and it is like it's like miles above where it should be. Wow! Wow! Okay. Okay. Well, see, this is more normal. But, you know, there we go. No problems with getting that in the. Uh, the <laughs> Oh, fantastic, Matt. Meeting's done until two. Volume up. Uh, oh, and Mrs. C just landed too. Oh, amazing. Excellent. That's quite a... Actually, I think it was ages ago that left, wasn't it? Was it like... No. Yeah, okay, no, that makes sense. It's, uh, it's a lot quicker. Well, it's a lot longer than I thought it was in the time, in the time that's passed. I don't make, making any sense there. Yeah. Uh, Alan, good morning. That's what I have to deal with. <laughs> Blue skies and no rain, exactly conditions as well so no heat haze it's even better and uh oh nice one uh, jess spotting saying uh, i've booked a holiday in march uh for march 24th with jet two uh, i'm hoping it doesn't change uh but it's shown as a 757 which i didn't think oh, would still be around mate. by then you know my curse with that one so you're probably going to get changed <laughs> I'm, I'm transferring my curse onto you all right i know i'll be in the chat again my bad my bad we will get there. Okay. Okay, well, that's the last thing we're going to see of that 7-4. Okay. Bye-bye, 7-4. Seven, oh, we've got a jet to... A321, now departing. We've got Carlos in front of it. Go on, Carlos. Right, that's the one that's not on radar, so nothing I can do about that. I'm going to tell you what's lined up. We've got a Jet 27372 Fun Charles down at the bottom there. Got another Virgin coming out as well. Yep, so the one at the end is the Virgin Atlantic to Orlando. Yep. Uh, so then obviously the one that's coming out is the um, the Barbados, which uh, the wonderful Mike just put in the chat as well, I saw. Yeah, EDC, he's turned into a Jet 2 space shuttle. <laughs> it did, honestly, it was bonkers, that. Like I say, I, it, the one the one plane that... Yeah, we, so Matt's saying last sham's near Basingstoke. Hey. It's not, it, that's where it was going. Oh, okay. And that's why I did show you, because okay. I did say it, and he didn't hear me say last sham. Okay, sorry. But yeah, it's near Basingstoke, so it's not far away. No, but I mean, even that, the, the, uh, the rate of ascent was just like bonkers maybe they were given permission for once like you can do what you want like you uh you don't have to go to the end of the runway and they I were bet, like I right bet, i bet the boss of jet two is watching it because I, I i i have heard rumors that he well, sometimes he will go down to the uh or he's historically gone down to airports okay and uh watch planes take off and there have been notes sent to pilots who been a bit too easy on the uh, a bit too hard on the engines <laughs> oh, exactly so uh he's probably watching this this is his he, he loves live streams because he just goes i don't need to go anywhere i can be efficient from home and still yeah there. right awesome mike saying that beluga xl5 is taxiing out at we'll broughton bound for hamburg should be overhead soon we'll keep an eye out you know me oh, yeah broughton that's the other one the other name for it oh, oh yeah broughton that, that that one causes issues as well <laughs> Ah, oh, 
our seven four looks epic above us. It's actually going to cross the. But yeah, so Beluga is actually taken off. It's taken. Okay. It's taken off. So we'll uh, keep an well, eye we, on that. We, we, I think we have reference points after the last time we did it. Yeah. From here, so I, if he takes a sharp turn, I, I've got an. Well, he's gone. He's basically going. He's gone out and gone west. So he has to. He's going to Hamburg. So he's going. He's out. got to come over this way. Yeah, he has to. He's gone around. I've got to go around, and I can't find it. Uh, uh, yeah, there it is. We got uh, we've got the yeah Aer Lingus uh, or the Emerald Airlines. Uh, ATR seventy two. Uh, seventy two. Just I think they're obviously doing their engine testing thing at the end of the runway. Whoever's there. And, uh, uh, jet two. Yeah, jet two. Because I can hear the engines. Right. So that's what's happened. Jet two ruin it. They just wait one, one of them goes up dead early. The other one takes forever. What the <laughs> hell? Are you? Just wait to play more Jess Glenn. I'll tell you what, they won't be too happy in that. No, they won't. Um, so yeah, they won't be singing, uh, are you ready for this? Because they literally weren't. Do you think they were singing that on that other takeoff though? Mm, I don't, I don't, yeah. But they probably were. Let's see if we can get it now on the extended departure. Oh, let's zoom out. Where are you? Over. Uh, Esther, I just got your message. Can, can we just check with everyone? Is every, are our mics good now? Because I uh, just wanted to double check that's that's all sorted itself out. We should sound about the same volume. Well, the volume's coming out. I think it like I, I did see those messages before, and I think that was just when we were switching them over. Right. Okay. Um, but I do just want to um, double check with everyone. Yeah, just want to double check. Uh, Nicholas, good morning. And that jet is finally rolling. Off to the lovely Madeira. There's not a love, a lot of love for it from um, that Aer Lingus, though. No. That's a 600 millimetre pan. Don't do those again, mate. Make sure you change over. <laughs> and uh, yeah, Travel Central. I think it is. I think it is said like that. But you know what? That's why I always joke about it because there's so many people that get like, like really like where it's off. That's why I just like, I just call it Chester or Broughton. Just. Uh, can you keep an eye out for that, please? Yeah. Speaking of belugas, right? Um, it's just about to go south of Runcorn. Okay. Uh, well, yeah. Oh, actually, about to go over Runcorn, just past Liverpool Airport. I'm thinking I should be able to see it. Yeah, and its path is uh, straight for us. Oh, that's the problem if it goes too far over the top. So he's round there at the moment. Okay. So the Virgin's taxi, you know, I'll have to get the Virgin, I'm sorry. Yeah, the Virgin has yeah to it does. Uh, sounds fine. Okay, perfect. Yeah, I just think it's one we switch. Actually I think it was when we were switching them over, yeah. Yeah, sounds good. Oh, perfect. Thank you, everyone. Thanks, everyone. Just like to double check, because uh, I know, I like, sometimes we've sort of listened back to our things. We're like, oh, this sounds rough. Like, why did nobody tell us? Yeah. <laughs> like, we actually, I know a lot, like, I know sometimes people that do things can get a bit stressed with we know something's wrong like stop telling us but actually no we I thought I saw it there oh, um, no we, we want you to tell us when something's wrong yeah no we can we might not be able to solve it on the fly but we, well yeah we exactly it depends we, what it is we can, like. we can work on it I can't see that thing for love and money that's really annoying it's actually going more of a north track it's about to go over Warrington got it Prince of Wales, everybody. There we go. Again. It's about to uh, track another plane. Oh, it's going through it. They're both going together. Beautiful. Come on, please clip that someone. 
Uh, I'm just trying to see what there was. Oh, and the virgins go in. Oh. Right, I'm going to do a mid down the runway job on this one. Oh, gosh. I've still got it in my eye line so I can actually do this. I can actually get back onto it. I'm on it, I'm on it, people. So you watch should be nearly here as well. I can't be doing with planes coming in at the moment, Les. <laughs> well I can't multitask. <laughs> I'm a man. The Emirates is four out. Four minutes? No, it was in four planes. Would have been three, but uh, Aer Ling the Aer Lingus that did a go around's uh, jumping in front. Right, let's, there we go. I've got the I've got the XL. Okay, okay. I've nailed that. I won't lie. So it's four planes out. Yes, yeah, so we've got a Ryanair next. Then we've got an EasyJet. Then that, um, yeah, the Aer Lingus will do a, another go. Hopefully, nothing's down the runway this yeah, time. The the, uh, uh, the Ryanair can get stuffed. We're at way for the XL. Especially as I get a load of retweets from Airbus in the UK. Yeah. Oh, it's banking. It's coming quite close to us now. Oh, this could be decent, Liz. Okay. Oh, hang on, I'll, I'll up my uh, thing to 4K so I can actually see it. <laughs> um, but yeah, I, think, I can't remember. Someone put in the chat that Lasham uh, does maintenance and someone else. That's said, right. Yeah. Um, uh, Mike Dunning saying it, so they're just about to go over the Irish Sea. If they're doing that, they might just be doing some sort of tests and stuff. And oh, look, there's the there's the whale. It's big smiley face. And, uh, Nicholas, morning. Welcome from uh, Melbourne. Who needs to go to Chester to get that? Just it from Manchester. Exactly. You got the inbound and the outbound. What could you want? I'm actually going to... See the uh, smiley face? Right, I'm going to come close to my planning handle in a minute. I was going to say, right, if you've got... If you're on a mobile device and you're in 4K, you can zoom right into that. That's epic. And it... Uh, it's alright, it's an ATR. I'm actually just going to pause that so Simon can see it zoomed in. Oh my God, that's amazing. <laughs> so yeah, that is the... Um, the benefit of 4K... And obviously YouTube now enabling... I want 8K. <laughs> <laughs> now enabling their mobile devices uh, to be zoomed in on. Oh, I'm here for that. That is epic. Okay, I'm going to have to go off it now in a moment because we are getting close to the bushes that are near us. Uh, overhanging. And I can show the uh, Manchester arrivals and departures the love that they deserve. Oh, we just had another plane go over the top of that. There we go. That's a nice way to finish that. That was brilliant. I enjoyed that. Thanks for indulging me, chat. <laughs> so we also have a two Dreamliner on the way out. And cool. we have an EasyJet touching down now on runway two free rides. Uh, David saying, I love the Beluga. They're impressive to see. Taylor's not a fan. Like, I think that, do you know, it holds for this man. I think they're ugly as sin as well. And I think head on. I love them. The only like decent shot I have of a beluga is a head-on shot, which is hilarious. But I love the belugas. I'm a big fan of them. Uh, it has to have the smiley face. If it doesn't have a smiley face, you see, I'm I'm loving the old the the old three hundreds now because they're getting so rare. We've got another quad going over the top. Okay. Like uh, the over. arrival was the um, EasyJet from Paris. Um, I'm not going to go on it, so you don't need to check it, please. Okay, that's cool. Because ne well, next thing you've got the Aer Lingus that did a go around. Yeah, exactly. No, After no, that, I'm, you've I'm got the con Emirates. Concentrating on these now. That's cool. And uh, in line, waiting to go out, we've got Jet 273. So I'm going to Gran Canaria. It was that one. That's the one someone's on. That Jet 2 that's at the bottom. 
Okay, well, I'm, I'm, I'm concentrating departures and the yeah, that's now, cool. So that's just cool. so we know, I can't remember who it was, but someone's on it. Yeah. It's just turning on now, so. That's cool. Um, <laughs> I bet that Aer Lingus is there going, that Jet 2 better move. That's that better not be the same Jet 2 that was there it, 10 minutes the ago. That's what happened yesterday, wasn't it, when we had to go, to go around? Yeah. A tower would be asking them, what are your intentions? Well, you'd hope so, wouldn't you? Yeah. Uh, but also down there, yeah, we've got the Virgin Atlantic VS-77. It's an A330-300 going to Bridgetown, Barbados. Then got an EasyJet A320 going to Geneva. Excellent. Uh, then got the TUI-737 going to Las Palmas. Okay, here's that Jet 2 departing. Also got a TUI Dreamliner that's going to, be, going to go to Punta Cana. Punta Cana. Oh, yeah, I've been there. It's nice. <laughs> yeah, it's a bit fun. Is a seven four above us as well. Yes, it is. So we've had like loads of seven fours today. We've had more than uh, yeah, than LA. <laughs> I'm kidding. I'm not. Oh, that's also awesome, Matt. So he said uh, not on four K screen, uh, but set resolution to four K and zoom in. You still get those uh, all those pixels. Oh, awesome. Bro. Well, you just got to make it work for you. I know that everyone has the internet. I'm amazed that mine was just working, and it's usually terrible. <laughs> I think, uh, I just think the situation that we're in with our mobile su uh, suppliers just works now. Yeah. And here is the uh, ATR that uh, did the go around before because of the uh, jet two that was on the runway. Oh, yeah, it was Matthew. Was like, it was me. I have family on it. There you go. There well, we go. Hope you like that, mate. So it was a Cargo Lux 747 that you yeah. saw. Definitely sticking 747 in our show tags now. <laughs> I'm totally doing it later. I, I totally am. I, I, I think we... Do you know what? We, we said this last time and we forgot and it's happening today. Yeah, I think so. It's a legit tag. We, we put legitimate tags in our YouTube tags. Yeah, there's, there's, a, there's a few who put some sketchy stuff in there. Do you know, like... Locations that they've never been to like and stuff Los like that. Los Angeles. And stuff like that. And you've it's... not been to LAX, you should not be putting LAX in your YouTube tags um, in terms of plane spotting. And, you know, it seems innocent enough, but it is actually, like, trying to get people into your, like, your your video of any kind in a... In an unethical way. Yeah, it's against YouTube's um, community guidelines. You're not meant to do it. Oh, we've got Virgin on the on departing now. Yeah, and after that, we'll have the Emirates A380 in. Well, this is a good few minutes here. I it is. Uh, Stick around. Press the like button if you enjoy it. Exactly. But, uh, I really appreciate that. Yeah, this is the Orlando service. I forget. zoomed in way too much. <laughs> uh, like, it was Bridgetown service, sorry. I'm, I'm behind here, getting confused. Uh, I can also tell you that the uh, Aer Lingus A332 Orlando has pinged up, as well as the Singapore Airlines A350 to Singapore. Oh, we've got a good few minutes for you, Pete. We have. But yeah, beast from the east. Beast. Next to touchdown. Well, let's just get in that corner ready for it. Can't see it as yet. So we've had we've had a go around. We've had Beluga XL. We've had seven four seven. 
We've had two Virgin A330s. We're going to have an Emirates uh, A380. This is decent. A Singapore A350 as well. Yep. And here is the beast. Pick is always very nice. And uh, David saying uh, Emirates arrival is probably a good point for me to say good night. Uh, knack it after eight, five a.m. Oh, five a.m. Fire alarm. Nobody wants that. Uh, thanks, Liv and Simon, for yet another brilliant stream. Uh, and thanks to the mods for your background vote. Well, uh, thank you, David. I'm glad you've enjoyed it today. Yeah, and thank we'll you. see you in the next one. As you say, our mods are fantastic. So thank you for them for all the yeah. hard work that they do. And uh, Graham, uh, thank you for tuning in as all well. We'll see you in the next one, hopefully, too. And well, there's a Victorian transport video saying, will you ever go to um, other countries to film as well? In brackets, Australia. Um, yeah, I mean, we're, uh, we're, we've got some trips in mind. Uh, Australia, I won't lie. As long, although it's I want to do Australia. I want to do Australia. When that will happen, <laughs> I'm not too sure, but... We need, we need to um... wish Ryan Air flew to Australia. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> to be fair, this problem. I feel like Paul, our mod Paul, needs to look into that. Paul, how cheaply can you get to Australia with all like all the flights you can do? Yeah. So um, in regards of that, we've got near enough all of the equipment that we need to do with the abroad shows yes. now. And in, we, what we've what we've had to do as well is we've had to make sure that we, we can do it in a way that we won't incur loads of batteries because that is what's killing us. That's why yeah. I had that little rant about the Egypt before, I won't lie, because uh, it just makes it so much more expensive. Um, so, yeah, we will be doing those soon, to be honest. Uh, yeah. uh, James, yeah. Interrupted there by uh, that was going to Geneva, uh, but yeah, James, we uh, Simon mentioned that um, uh, that incident at wherever it was, uh, Austin, yes, uh, briefly before. Uh, I, said, I, have, I didn't look into it, I don't know what the internet yeah, is. It, it doesn't look great, but what I always say is, look, I, I know that they had a load of data thrown off from certain um, providers, so you know, we're talking about flight radar servers and stuff like that. I won't lie, they can be really inaccurate, so mm. I'm not going to judge anything. I've heard the recordings and stuff like that, but what I'll wait for is the initial report from the NTSB, and I think that's when we'll get a, a better understanding of everything. Yes think uh, it's very easy to actually go out and judge um, but until we have that uh, preliminary preliminary finding um, and of course then you know you still want to listen to the actual final report but you know you get an idea of what's happening so yeah I'm, I'm not going to jump on it I just think it was uh, an interesting decision and there have been a few similar ones from what I understand recently so it's uh, an interesting subject yeah and uh, Herbert there uh, with the uh, the awesome three euro eighty oh, super chat saying a three eighty landing fee. <laughs> if, it only, if it was that cheap, you get a lot more uh, you get a lot more traffic at Manchester. But yeah. no, I really appreciate that, Herbert. Thank you so much. Yeah, thank you, Herbert, for you. We know support, that mate. you all love uh, the a three eighty so much. I just love that we can catch it twice for you in uh, in one show. Two different A three eighties. I like this shot as it goes past the tower. Sorry, that's what I was yeah, just thinking of. I love this one when it zoomed in a bit. Uh, now, Portland FC saying, "I was so busy watching you filming of the uh, 
believe you, Rexel, I never noticed it flowing over my house in Liverpool. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, mate, we're just messing with your mind. <laughs> I can see the A350 is uh, is lurking at the back of uh, here at T1, I'm looking to come around the corner. Yep. And uh, Malcolm saying uh, hi, guys. 380 is nice to fly on last week. Uh, flew with Singapore from Heathrow, and Ooh. then uh, the A350 to Manila. Both that types are brilliant. Yeah. So good day flying that for someone that likes planes. Okay, so we have a two on the roll. like a max and, uh, Victorian transport videos thank you yeah obviously if uh, if we do get Australia booked at some point I know there'll be lots of people who'll be asking for all the good spots and which locations and stuff So 2737, not a max. Is that just an 800? Yep. Yeah, uh, going boy, to... well, I just looked at the engines. I was, thinking, yeah. I was, just, I was looking at the uh, calendars. It was five, to but it looks, uh, Grand like Canaria. An and um, nothing on the approach just yet. There is one, There is a Ryanair um, out just past Hyde now. That's coming in from Berlin. So next to depart, we have the TUI 787-8 Dreamliner. It's going to Punta Cana. As I said, nice place. Um, then we'll have the Ryanair to Brussels. Brussels and Mussels. That's <laughs> so a standard 737. And the other two down there is a 2737 Max. And that'll be going to Brussels. That's positioning. Oh, yeah. <laughs> and that was really weird. I was like, just find a two fly to Brussels. We've got another quad coming over in a minute. Okay. It looks like it anyway. Let's have a look. Let's see who it is. I'm, get, I'm becoming uh, an expert on contrail. <laughs> contrail watching. Yeah, contrail watching. It looks like a quad anyway. It doesn't look wide enough to be a quad from here, but the mm. contrails look like a quad. There's no. two planes very close together. Yeah, I think that's what it is. There is a British Airways A350 over there. Ah, okay. And right next to it. Oh, no, you're right. It was hidden underneath the BA. There is an Atlas Air 747 Dude, over there. I'm so good at this now. Uh, Atlas yeah, Airs, the, Miami yeah, to Amsterdam. to go south now, isn't it? Yes, so that was uh, British Airways from uh, San Diego to Heathrow. Oh, my contrail watch is going to become stuff of a legend, I think. <laughs> You'd have thought it, say. That's an emoji, I'll tell you now. Well, some contrails. Yeah. Not a bad shout. Uh, Graham, thank you for tuning in today. We'll see you later. Have a good day. And uh, Wadders as well, get uh, get some work done. Don't you to get sacked. No Wadders, don't get any work done. Get sacked. <laughs> and just watch... Just watch streams. Just watch Etihad's all the time. And there is the uh, Erlingus A330. But yeah, cheers for tuning in again. Oh, that was a big yawn, that. <laughs> I'm definitely going to need that other cup of coffee in a bit, if that's okay. Yeah, that's cool, that's cool. And we do have a Ryanair now. Um, sorry for the fast pan, but that's life. Uh, yeah, so that's the one in from Berlin. Got some workers down by the uh, turn-on mound. Oh, okay. So, yes, yeah, so we've got Ryanair to Brussels, to e to Brussels. I wouldn't mind doing a trip to Berlin, you know. No, okay. I've never been to Berlin. Yeah, lived fine. in Germany for three years, never went to Berlin. Oh, I love Berlin itself, <laughs> but I like just to do stream as well. Oh, right, yeah. I don't know what the spots there are like at uh, Brandenburg now, though. So I need like to that. ask, uh, what's his face? Yes, we would. Um, TJ. Yes. Um, we've also got an Air France down there. They'll be going back to Paris. 
And then, yes, on taxi yeah, out, Singapore Airlines, SQ51. There it is. I was going back to Singapore. Obviously, after coming in from Houston earlier on this morning. And we have a Ryanair at the bottom of the runway about to turn on. Also got a, the Lufthansa A321 that'll be going back to Munich. And uh, I think you just mentioned it as well, the Aer Lingus A330. On the way out. Are on it today. We are. And this right now is rolling. Let's have a look and see how many are over at the RVP. I do like my RVP checks. That's quite a few. RVP checks. Huh? Qatar. Yeah? Is that what you were asking me? I was asking you. <laughs> wow, we, we need to start doing sign language. <laughs> <laughs> we need to sort that out, don't we? Oh, it's ridiculous. Yeah, that's a shout. Yeah? Yeah. All right, well, that's 27 minutes away, the Qatar 777. Ooh, not too. As I say, I think we'll get all the decent movements in as well in that time. So. Exactly. Perfect. Oh, that's up early. I mean, not as early as the I was going to say, was it as early as that jet tea? My jet tea, that's a new reference. That was like a 757 departure. Uh, Ronaldo, good morning to you. Is it still here, still morning in uh, Perth? Um, how's the Manchester weather? Cold, cold but sunny. I'll take it over rainy and yeah. cold. Yeah, sunny and cold is better than raining and cold. And windy. Yeah. yeah. Ronald, they do a bit of a mix of both now, I'd say. Right now, they do still fly to some vaguely, seemingly obscure destinations, but um, they do have quite a monopoly on a lot of the more main airports now as well. And um, Singapore is turned on. Cool. Uh, DJ Angel Writer, good morning. And uh, saying all those shark planes, they do have a bit of shark, they have sharky vibes down there. They yeah, do. they do. I do. I, I said. I like. I, I also said that. Do you know when we're doing our Sunday shows and we got them coming out the back? Yeah, yeah. Uh, that gives me off Jaws vibes. I do want to go. Dun -dun. And that's about as much as you should do of that. Thank you very much. So, um, yeah, Singapore now rolling. Oh. Someone check on uh, if anyone's got any radar thing, if there's any military hel helicopters in the area. There's a helicopter. Yeah, there is.
behind us so I can't see it, that's why I'm asking. Sadie, good morning. That was stunning though. I'll say that. And that um, Singapore went against two planes in the background as well, which is really Very nice. as well. Uh, next out down there. I can't the hear the helicopter anymore. No, I can't. It's very strange. Of the uh, Ellingus A330, it's the uh, EG935 to Orlando. Oh, what is this coming? So, do you know it's on the tracks, the Atlantic tracks? There's yep. one that's about to go overhead. I'm not on about that one, but there's one that's further back. Uh, it probably, I want to say it might be going to Heathrow, but it's like it looks like an A380, I'm going to say, from here. And that's like miles out. It looks huge. And it's a 747. Is it a 7-4? It looks so much bigger than yeah, the other ones. Yeah, it's an had. Atlas Air 747. It's yeah, going it's to Amsterdam yeah, this from one, Miami. It just looks so much bigger from, do you know, the position where yeah, it's yeah, at? Yeah, yeah, Okay, I still need to do a bit more education on my air control. <laughs> Hey, at least she saw that it had four engines. Yeah, that's, that's true. I'll take that. Oh, the, the, I will. Like, I'm moving on to this uh, this departure, this extended. Yeah. So, uh, A350 looks gorgeous. Morning, pieces saying uh, brilliant camera work. Joy to watch. Oh, thank you so much. Thank that, you. I'm getting there. I won't say I'm brilliant yet, but I'm decent. <laughs> Duh, MG at King, good morning. Uh, Ken, good morning to you as well. And uh, Christopher, good morning. Is people going on like breaks or something from work? Oh, there's a lot of you just suddenly shown up. Oh, we love it. I'm not going to argue with that. Welcome to everyone, especially if you're uh, new to the chat. Yeah. Please feel about, uh, you know, if you like what you're seeing, you know, give us a cheeky subscription and like the stream. It really helps us as a channel and say it doesn't cost anything. So. But yeah, Chris was saying, um, I was early back now. How long are you staying live for? Uh, well, we were just discussing well, we that. Just, we just did this by, by a sign language in a really bad way. Yeah, but we're going to wait for the Qatar 777 to arrive. So that's in, well, it's currently now 32 minutes. So we're looking about half an hour. So probably until about midday. I've also got the uh, Cathay Pacific A350 now uh, pinging. pinged. I think it's actually being pushed back, Excellent. potentially. That's good. Um, tell you what, this is doing a sharp turn over the air. Yeah. But that'll be going back to Hong Kong. So yeah, we'll get you all these fantastic movements out. Obviously, we've got a load already. And then uh, we'll get the Qatar in. Let's see if uh, Simon can spot any more, uh, <laughs> any more planes going overhead. You can actually hear the engines near yeah, 350. Oh, wow, okay, yeah. yeah. And, uh, Cathay Spotter, good morning to you over in uh, California. Well, we'll be Cathay spotting for you in a bit. Exactly. But welcome to the, uh, the chat. Uh, David was saying there was a chopper near Wilmslow. Okay, thank you for that. I just heard it, and I know that we've had quite a few uh, military movements moving up towards uh, City Airport, so I thought, yeah. is there a chance we might get one on the stream? Would have been cool, but alas, no. Oh, well. Um, Esther, yeah, saying that, that 747, the Atlas Air one, is just coming over the Mersey. Yeah, it's, I, I was just saying before, like, I can't believe how far out that, well, I can't see, that Simon can see. It's no, a good job that one of us has I can see him well before that as well. That, that's yeah. the scary thing. I just really can't identify what plane they are before uh, they get over there. So we do have the Aer Lingus A330 at the bottom of the runway, so that should be departing in a moment. So we'll get on that. You got your other phone with you? The rubbish phone? Yeah. Yes. So do you want to just check what they're saying for that one? One second. Yeah, yeah. Well, I can do it off a good one. It's just that I need to jump on your Wi-Fi. 
Oh, right, well, it's on. Okay, so I'll do that in a minute. So it's just that I don't have a SIM card in there. I'll tell you what, it must be great doing some work on the airfield like that those people <coughs> down there are. Yeah. On a nice day like this. What did you want me to check? That one. Uh, departures, it's always late. Yeah. All uh, oh, right, I know what you're asking me now. Okay, one sec, I will check. <laughs> oh, <geez>, that was <laughs> hilarious. Sorry, it's just another spot and it's like the most nonchalant way, just like, no, I'm walking in front, I don't give a crap. Plenty of space behind us, man. I'm just going to walk in front of him on the way out. I'm like, when, when there's a plane coming, <laughs> I'll wind him up. <laughs> I'm so sadistic like that. Um, okay, so yes, you're asking me in the airport. Uh, departures, 12.15, wasn't it? Yeah. Yeah, because I know it works. Morgan just asked about it. Um, Gate's open. Okay. Um, twelve fifteen off the, off the blocks. Okay, what we'll do is we'll go at twelve fifteen. Yeah. If we're not getting any life from it, then we're gonna go. Yeah. Um, but if it if if there is life from it, I it's, it's coming out. I'm more than happy to get that. Yeah. I hope that's all right, Morgan. One that went to Punta Cana. Um, I think that's the only two-way Dreamliner we've seen, haven't we? We've seen two. Oh, we've seen two. Where is the other one going? The last um, one was last one was on the the uh, Bridgetown. Oh right. Okay. Is the the one that was on this runway? Oh yeah. Okay. I, so, I meant to record it and I didn't press oh. record. That's why I know. Okay. I'm, well, they're the ones uh, in. So uh, Michael's saying perfect time for a show. This is a public holiday in Ireland. Oh okay. That's cool. Hashtag, there's an excuse for me to have a drink. <laughs> oh, Irish blood in me. I'm getting an Irish passport. Well, I, I will support you with your Irish heritage. Thank you. Didn't you were never drinking again? <laughs> Is that? I'm just gonna see if I've, no, I'm for only for EPA. I would remember that because I just think of alcohol again. Oh my god, everything's alcohol at the moment. Oh wow! Well. <laughs> I wanted to try to turn me into an alcoholic. Okay, that's Carlos. Oh, there we go, Carlos the crow. Carlos. The um, crow. Victorian transport videos. Uh, saving to go on the Qantas non-stop flight to London. Ooh. Wants to visit Manchester. and Go see Manchester United. Get in there. <laughs> I like you. Um, with some family who are originally from uh, Manchester. But also playing spot. Yeah. And I think you'd be United rude games. not to. And what, sorry? I've got to see United games. That's the priority. <laughs> sorry. And, uh, James, we had a, an A380 arrive just half an hour ago. Yeah. Oh, that was ages. That was already half an hour ago. Wow. I'm actually on it. Yeah. That's uh, so that's arrived. And then obviously we had the one this morning... 
we had a 2-3 left departure. Yes, we did. In some stunning light as well. Well worth going back and having a look at that. Yeah, I'm just trying to... Uh, it's probably about three hours into the stream, so we're probably now looking that at might, two hours back from where we are now. I think, you know, like, people are asking for timers and all that. Yeah. Okay. What I would probably look at start doing during the stream is start making ident markers. Oh, I've, I've, when, already, I've already thought about that. Yeah, but and then like try and cross reference it with how long we started, and then you could just like list it off to people. Yeah, that's cool. Oh, I thought you meant now. I was going to do it for like afterwards as well, so you know when people go. Oh, back on. yeah, absolutely. But I just think there's quite a few people who watch during the stream, don't they? They just come okay. in a bit late, and it's just like, well, these are the significant ones. You know, could copy and paste it into a thing and put it in the chat. Oh, here's the cafe. Awesome. And, uh, Martin, good morning to you. We did have a good weekend, thank you. What were we doing? Saturday was quite a chill day. Sunday was busy. Yeah. Busy, busy, busy. And it's another nice day here at Manchester. It's a nice day I mean, today, yeah. It's a bit chilly, but it's, it's nice. I'll take that any day of the week. I'll have that coffee, please. Yeah. Just two, two seconds. I'll go around and get it. If you want something doing, you have to do it yourself. Sorry, no, I'm just, I'm just watching something. Oh, and he gets just arrived, but I'm getting coffee, so that's life. <laughs> Priorities, eh? Uh, morning, Jake. Hope you're well. Oh, is that Jesus? I just I just saw someone put Jesus on there. It's Jesus. I think someone said it came in before. Uh, Liam, That's not Jesus. Good morning. Yeah, it came in like. Uh, Papa Kilo. Good morning to you as well. Uh, yes, Optimus, uh, when I was tracking it down, all the Jesus departures and arrivals uh, would have been really helpful if I'd have had timestamp at some part of the street. We're not doing Jesus. Right, so <laughs> on timestamp the A380, you know, the 777s, the A350s, oh, and the EasyJet Jesus liver, uh, uh, registration. I was going to say the livery then, could you imagine? <laughs> oh, that would be beautiful, that wouldn't it? <laughs> <laughs> right, so we've got a uh, Ryanair 737 down at the bottom. That's going to be going to Valencia. Okay, there's actually a plane down there. That's there nice. is, but there's one coming in though. We've got a Pegasus 737 oh, from Istanbul favorite. coming in. Yeah, great. Uh, behind that, there's a British Airways A320 coming in from London Heathrow. I wonder when I'm going to start getting the Cafe 1000s back. I don't know. Couldn't tell you. I like the, uh, the Cafe 1000s. Well, before that, we'll have uh, an EasyJet A319 to Amsterdam. I feel I should go to the bottom of the runway, yeah. <laughs> I'm getting that vibe. The uh, Norwegian in the uh, Jan Balls rug, Rudd livery. <laughs> you said it worse than I did. <laughs> <laughs> and I said it badly, I won't lie. <laughs> Oh, gosh. The uh, Norwegian man on tail livery. There we go. That's is, all. Uh, is pinged up. Oh, do you remember we went two, uh, two man on tails? Oh, God, that was a wild I day. I think our stream has just gone downhill ever since. <laughs> Morning, Owen. You all right, lad? But, uh, nice to see you yesterday. I'll be honest, Owen, I didn't even know it was you because I spent all my time looking at my phone when I'm Yeah, I was it. like, I said, did you know who it was, you know, when you went? And she went, no. I, I know. Like, oh. Well, the thing is, I heard a Liverpool accent and I just was like, oh, it's Aiden. It's always Aiden. And to be fair, apparently it was Aiden too. Yeah, So was. <laughs> I was half right, half wrong. I was, uh, I was, 
I, I think I've said, I think I think you probably know I said to Raiden why I was a I was a bit weird. I was a little bit well, I was a bit worse for wear, wasn't I? Well, it's not. It's like because we had a. It's the coffee to... was wearing out and everything. That was the thing. Yeah. It's also it's. It does feel like it is quite tiring sitting out here in the cold. Well, standing out standing. here in the cold. <laughs> standing. But I hope you're good, mate. Oh, Ryanair's now moving. Move off it and then, of course, the Ryanair goes. Even better. Beautiful. ATC Swede with the uh, 27 Swedish cr crown. Crown? Krona? Krona, is it crown? Cra I just know I said crowns last time. Is it crown? Oh, well. I'm sure it's crown. Uh, 27 I sec? I'm just going to say sec. Well, um, whatever it is, <laughs> whatever thank you so much. <laughs> Sorry. It's like We're going to have to do research here, Liz. I know. It's, it's like a game. I like to test myself. It says, uh, love your stream. Uh, keep up the good work. Oh, thank, thank you so you. much. It's great to get support. Even though I forget what currency you're in. You, I've been there. I've been to, well, I've not been to, I've been to, Sweet, I've been to, oh, I've been to Stockholm and I've been to well, I, the very north, but. Okay. I'm, I just think it's fantastic getting support from someone within the industry. So thank you so much. Absolutely. Thank lot. you so much. Oh, British Airways. Slowing down. There we go. For all you BA lovers out there. Oh, uh, Jesus is behind the A380. Is it the one that's... Oh, okay, there's one that's pushing. I'm going to have a look at that in a minute. Is it Jesus, is Jesus push it? <laughs> that sounded wrong. <laughs> Just a bit. Pope's going to kill me for that. <laughs> Jesus is pushing, I think. Is it? I don't know. I can't tell. There is a bit of heat haze there. Uh, anticipation from the eighties. Jesus is pushing. The Jesus is going to the Isle of Man. Jesus is pushing. There we go. <laughs> Never thought I'd say that in a stream. <laughs> Never thought I'd say Jesus is going to the Isle of Man. To be quite honest with you, but we move. For all you, you Jesus lovers out there. Ronald saying it's Krona. Krona, there you go. Ooh, that was halfway there. <laughs> um, well, I, we might not I be failed. able to tell you... I ruined the million pound question. We, we might not be able to tell you the currency of Sweden, but we can tell you this is an easy jet departed off runway 23 right at Manchester Airport. Boom. And we can, of course, tell you thank you. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> That's the main bit. To assess my knowledge on global currencies, you know. I know how to spend it. Keep the mind fresh. I haven't played Wordle yet today, so. That helps, doesn't it? I can spend it. It does. Okay, we have a Ryanair now in finals. We'll grab that as soon as I can. There it is. There's a bit of haze now, you know. See a little bit of heat haze, Liz? Oh, wow. Yeah, I know. I didn't think I'd be saying that today. And, uh, Marco, good morning. It's still just about morning. I said, uh, hey, guys. Um, flight attendant Marco from Virgin, Australia. Oh. Uh, love the channel and the accents remind me of when I lived in uh, Salford. Brilliant. Well, we love that. And we That's hope you're amazing. having a great time down there. Absolutely. Fine for a great airline as well, so yeah. Uh, well, thanks for your kind words.
Yeah, Esther there as well. Why does everybody else know what Swedish money is called? Why did I forget? Esther googled it. Oh, wow. <laughs> Don't be telling Fizz now. Yep, Dean, we are still live. Dean, we're not live. This, no, no, Dean, this isn't live. This is a pre-recorded segment. Um, <laughs> we just knew you'd come back at this exact time. And we decided to finish the stream just as you came came back. <laughs> That's how we roll. No, we're going to... Um, we're waiting for Katara. We're going to see if the Heinen can go it's on pinging. time. As I say, they're looking for it off the block time. But the, the issue that you've got, of course, is that it needs the icing. Oh, yes, of course. So that's going to play a factor in it. But as I say, we'll, we'll, we'll hang we'll, around to 12.15. Yeah. 12.15, we'll stay. Because i tell you what, I need the icing. No, you don't. Okay, here comes the cafe. So that is on its way back to Hong Kong. Very nice, that. So elegant, but what, what I always find astounding is, and I know the loads aren't particularly great with cafe at the moment, and that's because, you know, there's a lot of things going on, but um, that thing rotates so early when you think of the distance it's going. Yeah, I know. It's crazy. So we've got an easy jet arriving Green. from Belfast. See it. A320 Neo, and uh, next out will be a Norwegian Man on Tail 737. Get in there. You've just been waiting Shall I try it again? Jan Balsrud. That sounded better. Livery. You mean, you there probably you butchered it, but it sounded better. It, well, that's, that's all it needs to It just needs to sound better. It doesn't need to actually be better. Absolutely. Well, you and, it uh, oh, Qatar's actually on finals as well. That came up very quickly. Probably gave him some direct. Um, yeah, direct definitely. To, um, Tim that in is there just like going on radar, going direct, direct. I know Simon and Liz are looking to get off. <laughs> yeah, so that's on. Uh, that is passing Stockport. Pass Stockport. Excellent. Making a beeline for Cheadle. Uh, so that'll be the Qatar Triple Seven in from Doha. And now there's a plane down at the bottom. I guess I can see his tail. Oh, I did see his tail. I can't see it anymore. Oh, it's man on tail. I can see it. It's man on tail. Man on tail's down the bottom. <laughs> it's rolling. Just to ask, how hmm. far out is the Qatar? That is literally going to be touching down. It's touching down. I was about to say, I was going to jump on the... Uh, it's the past ca- he- yeah, it's past Hill Green. Okay, I was going to jump on the cafe for a minute, but um, obviously not. No. Oh, I can see it. The uh, chase flop, so it's the... So d- uh, is Danish- it world? Oh, God, I don't know. Uh, um, it's white. Well, then, yeah, yeah, it's it is. It's world. Oh, I love this plane. We have a history with it. <laughs> uh, yeah, Flop's saying there's Danish Corona, Norwegian Corona, and Swedish Corona. Okay. That's easier to remember. I'll forget, but it is technically easier to remember. We're just stupid. Not the same currency, though. Yeah. No, not the same currency, but the same name. But I like the person who came up with the Euro. <laughs> Make life easy. Oh, well, it's good to see non world again. It is. They're causing us absolute havoc on one of our reels with comments. Oh, gosh, yeah. Um, Shorts. 
shorts, I should say, but you know what I mean. Yeah. Uh, Dean saying, uh, don't like, you know you miss me. Didn't even know she were gone, mate. Who are you? <laughs> I thought it said Bean. Mr. <laughs> Bean was in the chat. <laughs> okay. Bean. Okay. Who, sorry, who's that again? <laughs> um... Oh, like French francs and Belgian francs, obviously back in the day. Uh, different currencies, both called francs. Obviously they're euros, so it makes Oh, sense. here we go. So, we have, so we've got two racing towards us here, and they're having a race, definitely having a race. What, overheads? Yeah, watch it, and the, uh, the that Norwegian just passed through them. I've got them too. Right, hang on, I'll try and One find. on the left definitely looks like a quad. So, but I think these are two quads. All right, hang on, two seconds, two seconds. I've got to go. I'm calling this one early. And they, these are miles where I can barely see them in my eye. Okay, right, I found one. No. No, I'm not seeing any... Uh... There's no quads. I can say right. I'm at island now. You're not seeing that far. No, I'm not. No. I know you're good, but you're not that good. Uh, what else have we got? Flying him. There's a dreamliner. Oh, it's probably one of them. The, dream, uh, the second it's two one, dreamliners. Is it two dream? Wow, they rip up a hell of a lot. There's a two E and a KLM dreamliner. Wowzers! That so you got the, that's astounding because like the, 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 I don't think the seven four seven lifts rips as much in regards of you know contrail in regards of than these two. These wow. two, these things are massive. I spotted them from. A good distance, I'll put it that way. Yeah. So they are still over the Irish Sea. Um, they're north, just probably northeast of Londudno now, about See? to go over Rill. We are learning stuff on Contrail School today. Yeah, you've got a uh, KLM from uh, Liberia or Liberia. Uh, it's a dreamline, obviously, going back to Amsterdam. That's at 41,000 feet. That's the one that's slightly ahead. Behind that, you've got the Tui Dreamliner at 43,000 feet from Cancun going to Brussels. Oh, Brussels just touched down. Oh, speaking of Brussels, then. <laughs> yeah. Oh, well, I'm not going to concentrate on them anymore, dude, because they're not seven fours. So <laughs> can't stick them in my tag. This. <laughs> it's all about the tags. They're already there. Dreamliner. Two in. I suppose I could stick KLM in there for a laugh. There's, uh, there's an American triple heading this way. Oh, it's going to Heathrow, so it'll probably bank south. It will do. Same with the Virgin behind that. We'll stick on the uh, non-world. Is it there? That sounds like a good idea. It goes past the stand. Well, there's a KLM triple that you might be able to see. That's over Ireland. <laughs> What's that in Botswana? Because I can't see it. No, <laughs> Ireland. Oh, no, like, give it a chance. <laughs> I've got a cloud bank in the way. I know it's clear. It's not that clear. I'd say I've seen it in Botswana. I'm, I'm peeking. I'm off home. <laughs> Oh, that light looks really good on that non-world. I don't think we've seen it in really good light before, have we? No, I don't think we have, to be fair. Well, I can hear a, uh, a washing machine. <laughs> I think it's the one that did the go-around, isn't it? It probably is, to be fair. Uh, you've got a Ryanair touching down from Milan. Oh, I can see the uh, the one behind it, the 777. Oh, right, that's the American then. Yeah, so the one that you said was going to Heathrow, that's banked off now. That's the one that is going to Heathrow. Oh, well, no, I can see one further behind that one then. Oh, God, hang on, hang on, hang on. Oh, there's a Max going. Sorry, I'm, I'm paying too much attention to these contrails. I've got to stop doing this. I do get preoccupied with the fun. Oh, there's a Norse Dreamliner there. Yeah, that, that, I can see that. So where's that? Just tell That me. one's actually closer, so that might be the one you saw... Uh, then no, you... right. So yeah, right. So right. That, yeah. They're, so they're the two that I've seen. Okay. No, the Norse one wasn't that one. You saw a KLM and a Tubi. Right. Further behind that, which I've only just seen now, is a Norse Dreamliner. Right. Is that parallel to the set triple seven? No, it's ahead. Yeah, just but just like not that far. Well, it's... they're the ones I'm seeing, and then there's another one behind that. Because the one's gone off towards Heathrow now. Okay, right then. The one behind it is a Virgin. Okay, Dream so where, where is that? And behind the one that's just gone off now, which the, is the a triple seven. This is very difficult. Though, no, the Virgin one. one that you just told me about. Where is that? Which is behind the triple. Yeah, no, I meant on a map. Over the Irish Sea. All right, where about? Oh. <laughs> Jeez. 
would you like me to point out? It's like I a... want coordinates, to be honest. Oh, uh, there's some algae to the left, and there's a there's a fish to the south. Can you imagine the fun that we have with the satellite, uh, satellite navigation? With well, it's, it's hilarious. I think we need a Bicca remote. <laughs> Just going off this. I've got two Dreamliner going out. Yeah, can we concentrate on what's going on here? Because at least I know where stuff is. <laughs> we need to kind of get a, an understanding of where we're going from. Oh, we've got a JCB coming down. Oh, they're trimming the bushes. They've got the bush trimmer out. No. Calm down, Liz. You're bush trimming anecdotes. Now, I think they're doing the bushes down at the bottom. Oh. The south side bushes. If he, if they are, this this man could be the hero we all want to be. This could be the hero. <laughs> we never knew we needed. The geeks will love you. Oh, no. I don't, oh, let's have a look. I'll see what the machine is, but I think it's a trip bush trimmer. Oh, it is. Yeah, that's a bush trimmer. <laughs> Wait a minute. I'm going to have a look. I'll have a bit of bush action. <laughs> we love a bit of bush action in this chat, don't we? Oh, it's naughty, that, isn't it? Oh. God. You all right there, Liz? No. Hey, you seem to be laughing there. Let's oh, see geez. what's funny. That bloke who doesn't like us having a laugh will be uh, in the chat again going, oh, I don't, I'm not, not too sure about this. I've made good Liz quiet. No, I'm, I'm just messaging Ian. Oh, okay. And um, we have the Austrian Embraer touching down. on the tail. Oh, squeaky brakes, squeaky brakes, squeaky brakes. I do notice the Embraer does have some rather squeaky brakes, doesn't it? It does, doesn't it? Oh, so Stuart's saying that it looks like Greg's have some uh, new hot item on test. Um, You're saying this stuff to me. I'm fat. <laughs> um... <laughs> And not PHAT. They put nothing in. Uh, I assume that means nothing in the north of it. Barbecue wraps, chicken wraps, loaded wedges. Oh, yeah, they should definitely get them. Although, I still, it's still a lot of pasty. Yeah, I just want pasty. Oh, that pasty I had last time from there was epic. Wasn't it? Just came out of the oven, didn't it? Yeah, you had like the freshest steak bake you'll ever find. Yeah. So rubbish at this. The ATR's just gone off. Oh. Just pretend you didn't hear that, it didn't happen. No. On the Austrian, it looks well nicer. It does, I agree. I promise to get the two Dreamliner, I'll make up for it. But 
which is down there. I'll fill you in later. Okay. <laughs> Just take it ages to type because my hands are so cold. God, she deserved that. Is your thing stopped working? What stopped working? Your hand warmer. Yes. Should we use that for a minute? No, it's fine, it's fine, it doesn't matter. I'm fine, I just, it, I can't type. <laughs> okay. You can't type anyway. <laughs> True. This chat landed. Let's have a, a look. Where's that from? That's from Nice. That's nice. That is. Air Charter Scotland Europe. My well, that's a catchy name, that, isn't it? That's my favourite. Of all the air charter companies, that is my favourite. Oh, Simon's got an ops car planning opportunity. Never gonna say no. <laughs> if you're driving this ops car, you're now on TV, mate. You're in 4K. Dean, it's uh, the bickering's all part of the fun now. Is it? No, I'm kidding. <laughs> I think it's fun. Mile of the German Shepherd puppy. Woof woof. <laughs> <laughs> And uh, cheers, Ronald, saying, uh, nice fun in your stream. Uh, but Milo was saying there was an A380 on top of us. I missed that one. Maybe yeah. it was going the other way. I blame Liz. Oh, fly. yeah, it was going the other way, to be fair. No, no, it's not good enough. Uh, <laughs> Sorry. Sorry, Milo, I, I'm ashamed of Liz and her inability to spot a 380 is going over the top. Well, you might be able to see a 350 or a 777 over... All the way over there, I know you like spotting them over the Irish Sea. Oh, no, it's going well to the, uh, well to the east of us. Well, maybe you won't then. I can see it. I just oh, right. I won't be able to. Well, next arrival is a SAS. Uh, near the very A320neo from Oslo. Excellent. I can see it now. And uh, let me just pop my filter back on. Oops. Phone's doing what it wants to do. Got a couple lined up to go out. We've got a Tui Dreamliner going to Varadero. Excellent. And a Ryanair 737 going to Cork. Can't beat it. Two very different locations. And the two is on the roll. Which one are you more interested in, Liz? What? The Tui or the Ryanair behind it? The Tui. Actually, I'm more, I'm more invested in Esther naming a two for clownfish, Simon and Liz.
thank you for tuning in, David. Have a good afternoon at work, or a good day at work, good evening at work, whatever it is. But have a good time as much as you can. Um, I am a little bit behind there. <laughs> Exactly, Stuart, but that's what makes us unique. You don't talk about, you know, me telling you the positions of planes by algae and fish, but well, here we are. That's what we bring to the table. <laughs> Switch off now, people. <laughs> d d don't put yourself through this kind of rubbish. <laughs> well, Christopher finds it funny. <coughs> Uh, what are you going to do? Okay, Owen so said apparently uh, Lufthansa and Air France KLM Group are looking to invest in Flybe to bring the airline out of oh, Let the airline die, right? Just I let say it this die. with the most utter respect to the staff. Let it die and let it go and be done with. <laughs> Right. Not, I know not. I have my, you know, I have my issues like with I totally feel dash eights, but it's staff and everything. But oh man, it's I, not fair on people trying to like getting jobs, losing jobs. Just either have a good business plan or just get out of business. If you I don't mean, know how to run a business, you shouldn't be running a business. It's as simple as that. Stop trying. The thing though with it is that if it was KLM and Air France and it's the group, isn't it? So it'd be Virgin Atlantic as well. With their fingers in the pan. Well, they, they used to do that. Like, they used to... So many people used to go off fly B flights, go on to the Virgin flights anyway. Like, well, that's that, well, that's, that's but again, what, we're trying to go full circle. It's like, just stop. <laughs> I know, but I'm just saying if they've got the backing of that and then they have the connection. So, to you know, if they kept their Heathrow slot. I think they should change the name. I think they should completely just do something different, in my well, opinion. they wouldn't be able to do that now, would they? Because they've got the use it or you lose it rule back in place, haven't they? I'm in the lose it camp. <laughs> I mean, Virgin could take him over effectively, or KLM could uh, stick extra if they could buy them slots off them. I don't know. I don't oh, know what the I crack is. Know. I'm going to let have to the put uh, up for auction again. I don't know what the crack is when you you, you return the slots. I'm just going to let him. I'm just going to let him fight it out. <laughs> fight, 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 fight. BA just always sticking the roar in, going, "Oh no, Virgin can't have uh, slots because we have three quarters of them already." <laughs> Shut up, Nigel. That's why you hate your own staff that much that you won't. Yeah, there you go. Cami saying the LH group more interested in the slots. Yes. Yeah, I could imagine they the are. Slots, I could definitely see. But oh, sorry, I, I'm catching up with the chat here. Okay. Um, Owen said from the article I read, Lufthansa are looking at purchasing it and adding to their group like Swiss and Austrian. It makes sense more that way. Yeah, it would. <laughs> just to expand the slots because the slots at Heathrow are just ridiculous. If you, you know, and if I don't know what the, the like I say, I don't know what the crack is in regards to returning slots, or can you you sell them on straight away at like a cheap price through uh, the administrator? But eBay, <laughs> <laughs> Facebook Marketplace. I'll buy a slot. Yeah, I'll buy a slot. I'll buy a slot, and I'll I'll jazz it up and I'll sell it on, <laughs> make a profit. This thing's just arrived. What the hell is this? Is this a PC-12? I just saw a little... No. Yeah, it is, isn't it? I, I don't know. There's nothing. Oh, hang on. There it is. Uh, oh, it's the... Um, it's the Ravener. But it is a PC-12. I know. Yeah, sorry. Oh, babe, babe it's nearly your reg. It's G. Luso. <laughs> That's nothing near like mine. Gee, Lizzo. <laughs> I think Lizzo's taken. Oh, well, I'm not having that. It's, uh, it's, your, it's your play. Right, what I will say is the Heinen has pinged up, so what that could mean anything. No, I think it'd be ready to go. Well, I will take that. Oh, they did that last time, didn't they? They were about 15, 20 minutes, so... Right, can I have your phone for a minute? I'll have a look at flight radar. Oh, God, right. Chat, I'll be back in a minute. You'll have to take the filter off. Put down the pockets for a bit. Oh, the big nose blows. <laughs> I don't like that. Though. 
Someone just did a massive nerve blow. Oh, I've got dirt on my leggings. Oh, 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 oh. Oh, there's a plane. There's a plane. <laughs> Don't forget the planes. I won't forget the planes. Seven coming towards us. Thank you. Yep. Going into Amsterdam. Right, we've got an EasyJ A3 at 20 from Barcelona arriving. Which I'm pretty sure we saw leave before. Oh, we did. I thought so. Uh, right, where was I? Trying and, to uh, oh, the there we go. Um, I was saying, uh, just uh, been catching in... Uh, sorry, it's not... Start... <laughs> start again. Just been watching. Uh, back at the takeoff from earlier. Uh, great planning. Oh, um, you. What you missed was uh, two minutes before, father-in-law messaged, uh, saw a takeoff, thanks. And, uh, uh, eh, did I miss it? <laughs> no idea what he saw. I, I don't know. I mean, I do... maybe the stream was a bit ahead? That'd be my guess. Maybe he was in, like, he, he's a time, couldn't, you know, he, he has a time yeah. machine. Maybe. But, yeah, no, I'm glad, uh, glad we enjoyed that. Yeah, my stipulation on this Hainan is that it has to be pushed by quarter past. Oh, it looks, yeah. It looks in the middle of the thingy. Hang on. I have flight radar to catch up. Flight radar's crashed. There we go. Um, It's not doing anything. No. I don't know if it's... It's like in the middle of the... What do you call it? It's like yeah, no. in the middle. Well, that's not boarded. I can't see it either here. Well, we'll keep an eye out and see what happens. Um, um, whilst the lights are high, then I'm not going to cry about it. <laughs> I don't see it. I've seen it a lot. Oh, I'm doing a full 600 mil millimetre pan on this. I'm regretting this already. Oh, dear. <laughs> Thanks, Esther. But as uh, Cami has sadly pointed out, that yeah, there was uh, there was a there was a Gila's once upon a time, and it uh, it, it crashed and uh, was written off. So um, yeah. Well, that story didn't end that well. <laughs> no. Um, oh well, a lot of stories don't end out well. Luckily, this Gila's lives on, and my second reincarnation is much better than the first. Right, let me get an update. Uh, Morgan said that the doors are closed on the Hainan. Yeah, because his girlfriend's on it. That's what I was saying. Uh, ah, was okay. Before, yeah. Okay. So at least we've got, we've got insider updates. Doors are closed. Yeah, they're still looking at uh, what you call it. And uh, Roy, thank you, saying now of Lurkers Lounge, I have to sign off. Great stream, Simon and Liz. Have a great um, rest of your day all. Well, thank you, Roy. Have a good day as well. Yeah, thank you so much, mate. I miss a load of Ryanair's. I missed a couple of these jets. It's been a good day.
Alright. Optimus Toaster. Like, I'm sick of these, like, just like these pathetic little planes being named, like, with a similar name to mine. I want, like, I want an A350 for that, Reg. Um... Yeah, we're we're not here for the small bit. We want proper big, gigantor names. Uh, what do you call it? The Virgin Atlantic is uh, up. Uh, that's uh, a three thirty. That's going to New York. JFK. Yep, that one is pushing. That is Carlos one, and there is Car- oh, we've got two Carlos's in the shop. Carlos one and two. Carlos one and two. Is there? Yes, Jim still streaming. So what an effort. We just we just did this for you. We just like we said we we're, we're not we're not going to finish our stream until Jim comes back in because he said he might come back in. Yeah, that was it. Yeah, that was literally it. So we can finish now. Thanks for that. Uh, see you again soon. Our oh, one car is gone. I moved over there. Oh, okay. Got attack uh, Portugal. I'll attack attack Portugal. <laughs> um. it. Paul said it seems a bit quieter today than usual. Like the volume seems a bit quieter today than usual. Um, there you go. Sorted. There we go. Happy days. As I say, we don't want to go too far because what happens is when you you push the sound too far, you get distortion. Um, and you you actually lose audio quality. So it's about pushing it to a certain level. Um, Yeah, gee, Lizzie, though, it's a little plane, and I don't want a little plane. Like, go big or go home. (sighs) Oh, not good you on that. I was like, I need a kip yawn. <laughs> oh, dear me. Can, so to the person whose girlfriend's on the, on the high nan, can you message your girlfriend and then tell the crew, like, just to shout up to the tower that they want a push now? Yeah. Even if they're not ready, just tell them that they need to go now. <laughs> and I'll sort it out our side in regards to the tower to get you like an earlier slot. Now I'm making this up. I have no, <laughs> no influence <laughs> whatsoever. I like to think I do, but I don't. No, you don't. You said, not, you said that so definitely, Liz. I know, right? To be honest, I think they would have been de-icing this virgin first, and I think they'd probably be legging it down now to that uh, to the high nan. Well, that'd be good. I literally don't think you heard a word I said there. No, I know. I'm looking at some of that. Okay, Les. Okay, so at the end of the runway, we have a hey, aeroplane. An aeroplane? Well, you know, because you're looking at something, that means that I, uh, I couldn't ask. But it's a Ryanair. It's okay, Liz. I'm, I'm on it. I can do this on my own. I don't need you anymore. All oh, right, nice one. Uh, you can get a lion then. What do you call it? Uh. Yeah, and it's a 7378-200. God, it hurts me every time I say that. Uh, Craig will stompy the horse. It's usually on our like the Moss Lane end, so on our Sundays. But um, obviously, because it's cold and it's winter, they're not out at the moment. Stompy will be back there. I stompy guarantee, will be back. I can guarantee that. Ah, and the Virgin <laughs> is now moving forward. Little planes are still cool. Yeah, I guess. <laughs> I don't think Liz is feeling that one, to be honest. 
Yeah. yeah. How many people started yawning then because Simon yawned? Oh, did I mentally do people? I oh. think you might have done. Oh, that's superb. I've never had that influence in my life. and I'm getting power hungry just thinking about it. <laughs> and uh, Doc Brownlow has been a member for a month saying keep up the great work. Well, thank you for your continued support. We really yes, appreciate that. Come on, Hyen. Uh, Hatter, yeah, sounds like you need a well-earned afternoon nap. Yeah. I want a bite to eat and then I want a nap. I want a nap. I also want to feel my feet again. <laughs> I lost the feeling in my feet about half past eight, I think. <laughs> it's now 20 past 12. She's literally got no feet. No, they're, they're just, they're, they're frozen. <laughs> Oh, very nice. Uh, Esther Postman just brought her a uh, Virgin Atlantic 747 Lady Penelope model. Oh, very nice. Not an actual... No. I was waiting to get some models. She bought I... one off Paul. He, he does them. He's, he's, he's selling them. He's got a load left. I'm kidding. I don't just made that up. <laughs> no, because that's one of the things that Paul's going to be selling, isn't he? Yeah. At the, um, the TAS Fair, he's going to be selling some of his models. Yeah. Right, they're in the safety briefing, apparently. Oh, it's not long now. Liking it. Thank you for the updates, mate. It just makes me warm in my heart knowing that it's not going to be that long. <laughs> <laughs> You've got any interest in inbounds? Is a Saudi? Is there a Saudi in during today? I, don't, I can't remember what days that is. Uh, no All idea. merges into one after a while. It the information I've got in my head. Just seeing if I can see anything with shadows or anything reflections pushing in the background. I can't. Uh, I've got a Ryanair about to turn on to finals. You got a tap rolling. I didn't see that one go down. Uh, no, but we do. That's gone back to Lisbon. <laughs> I nailed it. 600 mil. Happy days. Stick it in the bank. Tap tap. get that one no no oh it's quite oh okay so we've got one uh, well I'll just I'll keep an eye on it so it looks like we've got a uh, it's not saying anything on it, it well I mean it, it, it mm. doesn't have to declare emergency in order to uh, no, go back should. to uh, go back to the airport but it it's looks descending like though it's oh, what high is it 28,000 oh we could be having a diversion here yeah. people um I'm just Sorry, someone popped that in the chat before. That's why I've been uh, been quiet. I've been keeping an eye on that. Um. Sorry, I know the uh, link has just gone. I'm just looking for any possible arrivals on the thing. Well, it's not on the board at the moment. Where was it? Where did it? What was his departure? Was it Munich or Frankfurt? Frankfurt. Right. But yeah, thanks for the uh, heads up, Aviation Zone. Basically, there's um, there's a Lufthansa A330 that's Frankfurt to Austin, and it's turned around and is currently near the Isle of Man, descending. descending. So, I'll we'll keep an eye out on that one. You may want to check the Facebook groups. They um, you got people with scanners who'll be listening to that. 
and um, yeah, Cammy's just popped it in there as well. Well, that'd be a bit different, wouldn't it? Yeah. I, I'm just going to check the battery on my thing, in it? Okay. Yep, 30%, that'll do it. Oh, thank you uh, for anything, great stream. Oh, thank you so much. Well, if we get this, uh, well, we do get this divert, and um, that'll make it something. Well, it's definitely diverting somewhere, I know. Well, it's diverting somewhere, and it's most likely to be here. Well, I think we've got the Virgin on the way out now already, or? That's it, I'm just going into my other group. Yeah, Virgin's out on the way out. Cool. I want some planes on my proper account. Oh, I just sent pictures of the model. That looks shiny. Oh, I feel like the temperature's just dropped again. Uh, Dean, it's just over the Irish Sea. It's uh, LH468. It's not got anything on it because you know it's like sometimes it will pop yeah. up if they are diverting. It'll say where and stuff. But um, What's ha what height is it at now? Twenty six thousand. Okay, it does sound like it's. Yeah. Main thing, I mean, it's definitely it's got as far as into the Atlantic, yeah. uh, and it's turned around. No, it looks like a good spot. Thanks to... Uh, Aviation Zone, thank you. Thank you for that. It does look very likely. Well, it looks likely that it's diverted somewhere, but I'm saying if it's coming down to 26, then it probably looks likely that it's going to be coming up around here. Mm. Well, it's good that we start hanging around for that girlfriend because we've probably started packing up by now yeah double win it's all good i really do feel like it's cold cold or just like shivering the cold has got to me okay we do have a ryanair now in finals You can hear the A330 now just uh, feathering the throttle as it just comes on here. And that is going to New York. What it is. I, what am I going to New York even though I know it's freezing there at the moment? Oh, it's yeah, but it's like it's a different vibe when you're over there, isn't it? It's not when you're uh, near the Hudson. <laughs> oh, no, I know. And landscape photography in the middle. In, like, and it's like... Not when you're on a boat to... Uh, you see the Statue of Liberty? Yeah. Oh, my God. That that cold hits in another way, doesn't it? It really does. I'll tell you what, they warm them boats up well, though. Has anyone ever done the uh, the crown tour at the Statue of Liberty? I have. It was where you're like, you can go inside and actually climb right up to the crown of the Statue of Liberty and get a view out there. It's really cool. And it's so small. You're so cramped in there. It's unbelievable. Yeah, I've not done that. I've been there twice and not done it. <laughs> I bet you look silly there, aren't I, Lou? Yeah, I know. Uh, thanks, Mark. We'll uh, see you on Wednesday too. Thank you for tuning in today. Okay, and the Virgin's now rolling.
as uh, Morgan said, the Hainan is now on the move. Excellent. Thanks for the updates, mate. Do appreciate that. And, uh, it really helps us out. Just, so, sometimes can be a bit of pain going between two things, yeah. can't it? So thank you for that. Um, and we have a lofty update. Yeah, so, um, well, yeah, as Paul said, it's it's not squawking anything, you know, it's not squawking 7700 or anything. No. It's not in any kind of, like... Major distress. No, and to be honest, it was out in the Atlantic, so you would have assumed it would have gone to Ireland had there been anything more serious. But um, yeah. it's definitely in the sun, and, um, I'll just check my... Currently at 19,500 feet. Definitely, it definitely looks, sounds like it's coming in there. But yeah, we don't know why. Should make loads of reasons up. <laughs> Come up with the best explanation. Why not like that? The best made-up uh, explanation. They wanted to come on to think planes. Did you know what? They wanted to come in on our stream. That's why they haven't declared emergency. It all makes sense now, doesn't it? <laughs> uh, yeah, they they. Um, they put on board the wrong um, Frankfurt sausages, so they have to come to Manchester in order to get the proper Frankfurt sausages that they wanted. <laughs> and when you put it that way, it kind of makes sense. For most, it does for me, is, anyway. Yeah. So, uh, joking aside, I uh, hope it's nothing serious. Uh, yeah, not a problem, uh, Morgan. Can have a look if there's anything in the Facebook group chat. Yeah. <laughs> it usually is. Yeah, honestly, it's ridiculous because there's people who just listen on the scanners all day long and it's like they'll have anything before because they'll be talking. Okay, there's nothing in ours. I've got is the uh, inbound one that, that comes in at two o'clock. Okay, I can't see anything in okay, Facebook. Easy so. on, fi on finals. Sorry. But an easy on finals. Oh right, okay. I'm on like the uh, this one, so you know to view everything. Yeah, yeah. It'll probably be like when round when it gets around Blackburn and everyone sees it on there and goes starts asking a thousand questions. Then. Yeah, well, it's uh, sixty and a half thousand feet now, just up the coast, or just before the coast. It does sound like it's coming there, doesn't it? It does. It it's is following um, the Manchester tracks as well. Yes. Well, we'll definitely hang around for that. <laughs> can we say and that's why this channel is called think planes we think about um why planes turn around when they are entering the north atlantic ocean <laughs> <laughs> we're always in people's heads mate well, there's a bit of rocking on that easy jet there oh right yeah that was interesting yeah <laughs> Don't come Jay. knocking if that easy jet is rocking. I don't know. <laughs> the pilot said, uh, Texas or Manchester? Manchester one. No, I said, hope, uh, hope everything's all right. Yeah, that's, I think that's the that's main the thing, main isn't thing. it? But uh, as I say, we'll just, we'll just have to see and I'll try and find out. Oh, Andy, don't, don't tease us like that. Saying, I might be too free left. <laughs> oh, that, that'd be filthy. <laughs> Well, we we've had the trucks out by now. Yeah, we're at fourteen and a half thousand feet. See if there's a big mad hub of activity in the tower. Oh, they've, they've put the shades up. They're like going, no, no, we don't want anyone looking into the tower. <laughs> right, anyone like going? That 
war es der vollkommen nicht. I'm not sure, man. I'm literally like, I have no idea. I think it's really hard to even, like, I've no, like, without a scanner and things, it's just like, I've no, no, idea, I've no idea what's going on. There's a truck coming into Manchester. There's, yeah? Yeah, it's definitely coming in. Right. Left under well, the, 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 only, the only possible, uh, possibility is Liverpool, and I, I don't think they'd take that. I just don't see why they would. No. Yeah, you've got. Uh, didn't know Lufthansa, did it? Oh, no, I didn't know. Lufthansa are a bit of everything, don't they? In terms of aircraft types, I mean. Well, Lufthansa have always historically diver uh, diverted here as well. We've had their um, 747, we've had their A380 on diversions here, so it, it wouldn't. they're comfortable sending planes here. Yeah. So they have facilities for it, so it, wouldn't, it just doesn't surprise me that they'd be using Manchester. So we caught uh weirdly enough we when we did one of our first trips to Heathrow together we uh we caught an A340 Lufthansa diverting yeah, into did. um Heathrow don't we I know nine left okay and they're saying confirmed two free right thank you mate um, I'm assuming you're listening to a scanner always in with the information um no Canada I don't think I'd I, I would imagine if it's anything like that they would have declared it like you think they'd have declared an emergency but I can't see any trucks or don't any, see anything rushing around. Don't see around. any activity or when when I had the uh, when I came down for the cafe uh, with the landing gear issue. Yeah. Um, the, the 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 staff were out straight away and they were you know they were making plans before yep. the plane even landed. Oh, it's over there, sorry. So I would expect them to be out by now if it, you know we're talking about ten fifteen minutes in. Sometimes it can be something not serious at all. I remember when we had the um, British Airways 787-9 uh, Dreamliner divert to Manchester, I think that was going to LA, if memory serves me right. Um, and that was literally just because of hot water issues on board. Oh, so, wow. You know, it's not always a major, major emergency. Sometimes they can get a fudge it and get away with it. But, yeah. say, you know, it, it, some things have to be dealt with. And uh, if the maintenance would allow it, then you can get it done at Manchester. So, we do have the Hainan there. Yay. Uh, Bobby, hello, welcome. Dean saying, is that my beloved 757 in the test bed, Simon? It's not a test bed, it's at the, it's at the back of the uh, Jet 2 hangar. It's where they park them up. Ah, oh, there you go then. So, uh, Lufthansa A330 currently at six and a half, a thousand feet. Yeah. And uh, just about to pass over Bolton. I bet your, I bet your Ender's on the way down. If he's not working, I bet your Ender's like it down at Moss Lane. <laughs> just tell you now. Probably listening to stream like going, shut up, don't tell me where I'm going. <laughs> Okay, so I'm just looking at flight radar. It's just flying south of Bolton. Um, yep. And it's five and it's five six. So. Uh, yeah, Stephen said it just flew over in Wigan. Yeah, Sarah. Everything. Um, I'm not sure why. We're not sure why it's. We're not sure. We don't have a well, scanner, uh, you so know, we, can't, we can't tell. What we can take from the facts is that it hasn't. Um, it's not like squawking 7700 or anything. Yeah. Uh, it was in already in, over the Atlantic when it turned back. 
And it hasn't gone to Dublin. It hasn't gone to Dublin, which would be you would have know, thought would be one of their if priorities. Was, yeah. yeah. So, so I'm not sure. But currently, about just about five thousand feet now. My Facebook group will be going mental in a minute. Yep. Gary just got a picture. Have you got a good picture? Excellent. And, uh, passed over Lucky 13 as well. And of Erica, wow, this is like taking a tour of uh, everyone that's watching. I've got, an, I've got a kind of ge uh, geographical idea where everyone is now. Yeah. Know. And we've got the KLM now coming in. Just passing Oldham. Harrison will be cursing when he lands in Tenerife. <laughs> K K uh, sorry, a Lufthansa A330 in good light. <laughs> He's not going to be a happy chappy. Oh, I'm dear. happy to say that the curse is back with him. It looks like it, doesn't it? It does, doesn't it? <laughs> Plus, he'll never post a photo anyway, so it doesn't matter. No. <laughs> oh, dear. Love you, Harrison. Well, you've got that. Yeah, because he left at eight. It should be there by now. It should it? be, yeah, it should be. It should just be tuning in. <laughs> <laughs> What's going on back home? Are you kidding me? <laughs> yeah, but it's about to turn on fire. I'm going to see if I can actually see it in the skyline. This is a bit too hazy now for that, unfortunately. Oh no, I can. Wait a minute, I can see it. One sec. There it is. And it's about to turn on to finals. Unfortunately, Bushcam's going to destroy this shot because it was looking so artistic and beautiful. Oh, I'll trust Bushcam. It's now the uh, second bush track flight on uh, flight radar. Yeah. Of course it is. Of course it is. You know when the ma when Manchester spotters start getting wind of something like that, it just, everyone's on it. Everyone's on it. That's someone to our left just got a scanner on, so I'm trying to listen in. Okay. <laughs> But yeah, it's on. Uh, oh, it's number one now. Is it number one? It's number one. Can we take credit for that? We're taking all the credit for that. <laughs> Don't care what anyone else says. This that is that is all down to us. <laughs> it's. Um, if it wasn't for us, this plane wouldn't happen to be going into Manchester. Yeah, you welcome everybody. Yeah. <laughs> a joke. A joke. But yeah, oh, I didn't expect this to uh, no. be the way that well, we finish our show. Well, it's all good. That Morgan said, you know, my girlfriend's on the high end, and I went, "When's the high end going out?" We said we'd stay. I'm not saying thanks to Morgan. I'm saying thanks to Morgan's girlfriend. Well, for taking the flight in the for first place. The yeah, the first I mean, there place. we go. There we go. We're all sorted. It's like a series of events that has led to this this moment. Wow. Erica saying, uh, it's a shame it's not 747 that I'd have been, uh, <laughs> <laughs> been springing up. Yeah. I'll, I'll try and order one next time. 
Okay, we've got to be Jeez. fair, I'm glad it's not like a 350 because I've still not got a picture of a lovely 350 in like a good picture. And I'd be fuming. Get your iPhone out, get your phone out, Liz. I'd have to. Requested full runway because the. Yeah. Well, uh, that's obviously an issue then, isn't it? Sorry, why am I getting to this when you're recording? Because we could post it straight away. Oh, God, right. Um, put the jet down for two minutes. Is it coming now? Well, right, the second. It's not that far away, I know that. Right. I'll say, oh, chat. I've demoted you to the chair. Yeah, it's just, uh, it's just coming over towards Heel Green now. Right. And I'm going to get my mic and hold it. Okay. <laughs> pressure? No pressure, no pressure. So, yeah, we've uh, got this diversion. Um, Lufthansa 330. First, we're going from uh, Frankfurt to Austin, Texas. Yeah, that's the one. And it's uh, done, a, it's done a U turn. Done a U turn. Coming back to Manchester. Their side ops are out for it. I can't see any other appliances. Well, we'll find out, won't we? Yes. Lizzie's pacing around like a mad person. <laughs> That's just what I do. I am a mad person. Yeah. Right. You're going to have to, like, I'm going to have to go when you yeah, stop. Okay. Well, everything's down safely. It is, it is. Right, um, in the chat. Yeah, did you wear these cameras right. there? But you did use up a lot of runway. As to be expected. And we'll just, uh, we'll see this get, go to stand. I'll just say it'd be using one of the remotes, i say it'd be the one rather than the side of the tower. I can see there's an easy jet lined up, but I'm going to stay with this. Because whilst these jets are cool, <laughs> off the A330s, it manages that don't happen every day. They do not. Uh, of course, we will get the high nine when it, when it departs. Don't forget that. Yeah, we're uh, not sure what's happened, I'm sure. In time, we will find out. We'll find absolutely. out later. We can obviously update you on Wednesday on our show then. Absolutely. Um, but obviously, there was no emergency declared. It's not stopped on the runway. There's no emergency services out, so... Even their side ops are just watching it. Yeah. So, so they've obviously just been in a stand to go to. And also, like we say, it was, uh, it was already over the Atlantic when it turned back, so it went over Ireland and everything, so... I'm just going to get some... that it isn't anything serious at all. Yeah. 
but I think as the A330 capital of the world, as I think Manchester is. Well, where, well, where better to send one? Where I mean. better to send one? Um, so, yeah. I think the Highland's at the bottom there now. So, uh, let's have a look. Yes, yeah, so I can see the tail. Here we go. Obviously someone, uh, someone's girlfriend is on board, so... I promise yeah, to get that. The so. Lufthansa is just taxiing. There's nothing exciting happening. No. Probably get to see it going around the corner. Put me onto the stand just right behind the tower, which I'm probably guessing that will be made available for it. That's what the usual operating procedure is. I can't see any follow me cars, I usually do that for these. Because I know whilst these planes do have maps and everything of the, uh, the taxiways at Manchester, they do kind of just. Maybe they knew where they were going. Yeah. Maybe, maybe, yeah, no, maybe it's an XA three twenty pilot. I was going to say it's not out of the room. It's a possibility that it's an X three twenty pilot used to fly it. Yeah, all the time. So yeah. Anyway, we'll uh, we'll see this on to stand. I think that's where we'll. Uh, and then we will be going, as we have been here for six hours and twenty minutes now, and I am uncontrollably shivering at this point. I cannot go any boy. Too cold. Uh, I'm quit. also hungry. Quit whinging. Not really quick whinging. Just quick whinging, you. Yeah. <laughs> it's tickles. What would be worse, in the cold and tickles? But no, we, we were going to go after the hind in any way, but uh, obviously. Lofty decided to make a it's special done. appearance. Yeah, it's so. going around the back, so I don't know. Usually they put them on the uh, stand there, but they've got it going around the back. Okay, well, I hope you enjoyed that. Well, I don't know word enjoys a wrong word isn't it because we don't know what's happened on board but you know it's added something to the show hasn't it yeah so and uh, like we'll i say we'll hopefully find out what the issue was what the issue was whatever and we can update you on wednesday morning we'll probably be about uh, a 6 30 a.m start again yeah we're gonna get you some uh, close-up rotation shots of the departures should be cool oh wait a minute what's he doing there Yeah, it also, yeah. I'm, I'm watching this actually. I'm staying on this because um, I'm not sure where it's going. Okay. Is he going on to T? He's going on to T1. Is he? I mean, I know they can take it because they used to have the Etihad Dreamliner there yeah, and stuff yeah, like yeah. that. But um, yeah, he's just like fully gone on the stand. Yeah, yeah, he's gone to stand on T1. I did. I won't lie. I didn't expect that. No, I well, thought they would have put him on remote. But they're, they're, all the staff are there already, ready for it. You can see them at the front there. Oh, there we go. So they're on it. So, uh, yeah, well, if it works for them and everything. I bet you'd do it when, if, you know, if this is still here, when the A320 pilot and the Lufty comes in from Frankfurt, they come in and just go, what the hell? What are you doing here? <laughs> uh, is there any clue for the 330 of Lufthansa? No, we, we haven't. There's no transponder, there's no... No, we haven't heard there. anything. Uh, like I say, we don't know anything, to be honest. So I'll, I'll try and find out a little bit later, but as I say, I don't know. No problems, mate. So yeah, that's where we're gonna uh, leave that. It's on stand now. Looks everything's looks as good as it can be. Uh, I hope everyone's all right on board and everything. Yes, I hope absolutely. it's just a main, main, uh, minor technical issue. But we want to say thank you so much for joining us today. It's uh, it's been cold, but it's been, it's been great. It's been fun though. So uh, thank you all very much for joining us. Absolutely. Uh, as I said, we're back on Wednesday morning. But thanks everyone for watching. Thank you for all your support. Everyone who's watched, looked, liked the video, uh, sent support in. Uh, all our moderators, you've all been fantastic as usual. Thank you so much for helping us out. Yes. And uh, thanks, Simon, for 
Tanya like a legend. That's all what I do. And thank you, Liz, for talking to the chat no and uh, saying that you're cold all the time. So yeah, it's you're been welcome. a pleasure. <laughs> no, I'm kidding. Take care. Take care, Thanks, everyone. everyone. Bye. Bye.